Why? It doesn't say personal item though. It just says oh, choose one weapon one? armor. But then if you look item. under jury jury rigging, the specifically the talent. Uh, at... right here in the talent. Wait, yeah, right. but specifically if you go to the jury rig the talent the description for it, that's what it says. That's where it says it. Oh, we may only have we may not have a stress. That's we might be under a hundred. I know. I'm super excited. We may actually be able to have the yeah, what, 30, 20, 20, 20. Have we re uh, our strengths reset now? Right. I mean, are we good? No. 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 Right. You do you, you yeah. lost the one strain from last session? Okay. So okay. you can drop your strain by one. Uh, but your total strain has not gone down because you guys haven't rested or anything. Right. We'll we'll rest when we get on the ship after we find this fucking robot. Yeah, and roll your Yes. Destiny. <laughs> Good rolls, everybody. Can we just stop rolling destiny points now? Son of a bitch. Fuck. Oh, I got one. Thank you. I swear Fuck. to God. Thank you. <laughs> There's no pressure, but I want to see double white. That's two to two right now. Oh, Fuck. come on. Two to three. <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch. All right. That's Roll tough. that D1. Uh, or no, 20, 40, 60, 90. Hey! Sweet. He still rolls a D100. I know. <laughs> My god. Nobody wow. gets it. No one gets straight. Barely made it. I, uh... <laughs> so a 10% chance? That is a 10% chance. Donkey, I assume, because we actually walked on the ship where we realized, oh fuck, where's the robot? I had time to change my armor. Yeah, your armor was on the ship. Okay. So you can switch. Sick. Um, I, shouldn't, I shouldn't expect any more combat, but do you guys, who knows? <laughs> I, I did choose to go with the ascension gear, so I do have the grappling hook. Okay. Why? Right. Why not? Because <laughs> it was free. Yeah, so... Uh, I didn't get an XP from last session, did I? Did we get no XP way. from last session? Uh, you get one uh, at the end of every session, no matter oh, what. We, well, we killed fuck. some people. We did. Depending we, on how well you do, you get additional. We uh, viciously murdered a bunch of guys with a stun grenade. But that was the objective. We laid so. his ass out as well. That was great. Oh, uh, you failed that, you failed that, you failed that. Uh, we didn't fail those things, we passed them all. No, I'm looking at additional things that could have happened <laughs> that no one oh. seems to notice or do. So you yeah, failed we that. We didn't go to the casino like we were supposed uh, to. Oh, you failed that. You failed wow, that. Okay. You, saw... <laughs> you did that! Okay, shut up. <laughs> Look, the, the important thing is nobody died. people saying that I'm a failure, I don't need your bullshit as well. Look, nobody died, and all we have to do now <laughs> is find the robot cool. and we're good to go. You guys get five XP. <laughs> Woo! Does anybody know <laughs> the what our thing you managed to do is kill some dudes? <laughs> Does anybody know what our grand total XP actually is? Because I haven't been tracking that. I have. Well, either. with all of the failures, Donkey calculated like three. Three total XP. Yes. Three total XP. For last session, you guys get five. No, I mean in general. Do you know how much so we've actually overall. received total? Overall? overall. I have been tracking it for some reason. I didn't realize there was a total XP until just no, now. No, not really, actually. All right, it's all well. right. It Boy, I could spend this 5 XP or I could hold on to it. Hmm. So Thinking no emoji. I need to go back over like, all of my ability good. stuff. Am I the only person who's taken talent stuff so far? No, I have. Okay. I have. Yeah. Like, big time. Yeah, it's just two people seem to sunk all their points in their skills, which is fine. Yeah. Where's my... <sighs> well, someone there needs to shoot lines. people. I, I have a giant sword. Yeah. I have a chance. <laughs> Shoot Congrats. people. But I have a sword. I still want my Vibro Whip, damn it. Combat. Can't take this from me. Yeah, I don't know if there's yeah. one in the game. There isn't, which makes me crazy upset. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, I totally forgot I had fucking second wind. Oh, it feels bad, man. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I haven't had a need to use it so far, time? but. No, uh. Incidentally, to heal strain equal to ranks in second wind, which means I just heal one strain. <laughs> Ooh. Rip. Ooh. Oh well. Hey, yeah, that, that might save my life. Yeah. yeah, it might save your life. That is true. I can take a strain to uh, uh, upgrade the difficulty of a check. I can do the same. Oh, upgrade you... difficulty. Well, upgrade the difficulty of an incoming ranged attack by an equal number, so I can upgrade it uh, by one rank. Yeah, I have dodge. Dodge is cool. 
I am ready for us to go find this fucking droid. All right, yeah. Shoot four pistols. So I guess we'll start now. Half hour after Butcher. So you guys get get aboard the ship, uh, expecting. Fuck. Uh, why can I remember these name people's names? Did you give the droid a uh, name? It three PO. Yeah, it three PO was the name. Um, you're expecting the droid to be on board the ship. You guys get aboard, and he is not there. He seems to be missing. He should be. He should be here by now. As you scavenge around the ship, peek around the corners, and everything like that, doesn't seem to be on board at all. Hmm. So we need to go find him. And last session, I think it was Jera that said something about it. Yeah, I think I made some and said something about it. It was someone. I can't someone. remember. It was Ayala. No, Jarrah says something, and then I respond. I was like, "Wait, is he not on?" No, oh, because I made it as I made it as West because Wes wasn't here. Oh, that's that right. You guys were oh, ready okay. to blast off into space, and then to us like, "Yeah, uh, where's the droid?" Right. So, um, if I were a droid, where would I be? Uh, I the hollow would chest. Rec- uh, I'll kind of step in for a moment. Um, why don't don't we just go back to Isotech real quick and see if they have some kind of tracker? I mean, you would think they'd have a tracker for the droid, sure. Let's give it a try. I mean, it is their droid. Droids are, can be fairly expensive. That's true, especially a 3PO unit. Yeah, so I would say let's make our way to Isotech again. To Isotech. Okay. Going on a trip. So you guys... Out to Isotech. <laughs> my favorite rocket ship. Okay, so you guys uh, exit the ship and uh, proceed down the hallways and over towards Isotope. Um, I think I made a lady outside. Lady uh, glances up. You guys enter the... Push open the door. Or door slides open. And uh, enter the room. The lady behind the desk looks up. It's like, oh, yes. Uh, you, fo- you, you fellows again. Can, may I help you? Where Your droid being... never showed up. It's like, uh, you should have you been there. He like, wasn't. Psycho. Psycho, well, that's uh, bad news. He had a copy of the uh, flight plans on board, on board him. So I would assume you have a tracker if he's that important. Scott, I guess. Let me... Uh... Yeah, she hunkers down on the computer terminal. Let me get some dice. Nat 1, the computer blows up in her face. <laughs> we all die. <laughs> <laughs> the ship explodes. The star goes supernova. The, the space station is on. <laughs> Make a DC-17 wisdom <laughs> save. This is the 10,000 table? Star blows the up. D-10,000. There you go. You okay, want me to open my random table for made RPG for you, Donkey? Uh, no thanks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, that game. It's called, like, the Mayhem or Chaos table or something? Yeah, I doubt it. No, it's just, she would actually know. It's her fucking terminal. Yeah, so she, uh... Types away at the keyboard for a couple of minutes. Like, ah, oh, yes, it seems he's uh, left the station. I thought he left with you guys. No. Well, no. We look like we left. <laughs> yeah, currently it's not showing him on board the station. So That's less than great. All right. Um, Old boys, who's ready to hunt a droid? Damn protocol droids always throwing themselves out of airlocks. Suicidal tendencies. That's racist. That's racist. <laughs> <laughs> well, he has proven to be droidist, so even though he's a droid. Well, yeah, but I'm the best droid. So Yeah, so he's droidist. So I'm the say. high elf of droids. Or so you say. So do you, you guys have any way to track him beyond just the station then? Like yeah, well unfortunately the beacon on board him, due to the limitations of a protocol droid, it's not very powerful. Can you point us in the right direction? It's like, yes, uh... uh like northeast. <laughs> northeast. Yeah, northeast in space. You'll find him somewhere over there. She just points to the stars and smiles. <laughs> Is it within, like, 200 feet? Of the station? Like, of our current location? No, it's the sta- he's, he's off the station. Oh, okay. Like, he's I missed that. Sorry. Gone. Like, uh, unfortunately, I don't know where he's gone. His last known location, he was in a hangar bay. And then out, then he went outside. I guess 
He left. Which Some, hangar bay? He just walked out. Which hangar oh, bay? He just out the door. <laughs> I doubt he. I doubt he would walk out. He's not that stupid. Which hangar bay? I mean, I'm gonna point at Jeeves and be like, "We have this thing. He's that stupid. I don't doubt your droid would be." <laughs> I wanna like, well, shoot him. I wanna shoot him. Let me shoot him. Uh, okay. <laughs> Let me shoot him. Okay. Shoot the droid. He's not there. No, no he's not him. Sweet <laughs> baby Lord. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wait. What is all that? <laughs> Just leave it, Duncan. Just leave it. Just leave it. Just leave it. <laughs> what was all that? Let that both no, of his I guns explode. Yeah, I guess like I that, exploded. <laughs> I must, I must um, exploded. That would Do well. Do you want to keep that? Yes or no? Yes. No. Yes. yes. No. I party white. Say put in chat. Put yes or no in the chat. I just, no. I'm just so happy right now. <laughs> I'm just so happy. <laughs> this is why you don't go and shoot ran shoot off a lot, huh? Okay, well, so we have two oh. no's, two yes. No, that's the same person. The, that's no, three that's of the same not person. Not the same person. No, the ship is missing. It's I'm me. Okay, so wait, what happened? Is he is shooting ship. like a party member? Is he's he's just, either yeah, that. He's trying to shoot me. me. Okay, cool. So what's gonna happen is either I'll ignore the roll, or I'm going to take that roll to its full extent. So both the despairs included. Okay, oh, why am I shooting? Yeah, and two what happens is up to me. On someone next to me. Yeah, why okay, are you? Does that affect the whole party then? Uh, it's agreed on the whole party what they what, if you want to keep the role or not. But well, I'm wait, saying why would that we keep the role? Why, why would I have affect us all in a negative yes. way? That's fine. Yes. Why would, would I have two everybody. reds? <laughs> but why would I have two reds for someone right next to me? Because you didn't let him reset the pool, so he just stayed. The pool. <laughs> I didn't know anything was in the pool. We just started. You know, it, stop being so salty about it, okay? Right. You All right, literally okay. went and shot him. Let's. Let, let's did you actually bargain? If if I vote yes, do we? Will you give us a destiny point? <laughs> what? <laughs> There's no bribery. <laughs> no, this is negotiation. This to happen, so give us a destiny point, and we'll allow you to do it. You you realize this is going to be like you know despairs are bad right and there's two of them. You know what I'm voting no because I know it's gonna happen. <sighs> oh, that's three no's. You know why? Because we're on a fucking spaceport where the punishment for like crime is being like airlocked. I oh, remember God. this from last session. Damn it, we're not having this happen. I'm a droid. I I'll go air. I'll be airlocked. Let's, see, what can I Let's have Dragon be the be the final version. I'm not I'm not dying tonight. This isn't that's, Starfinder. Damn it. That's three no's. It's up to you, Donkey. It's tied to two. <laughs> we I spoke to the ship. The ship said no. Here, here we go, Donkey. Dragon said yes. Oh, it's going. Yes, yes. Fuck. <laughs> oh boy, it's gonna be fun. Oh, I was gonna say, Donkey, if you want to do it like for like funsies, roll a dust. I'll, I'll just roll like a uh, let's roll like a D two. One yes, two no. Is it yes? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Right. So, uh, Jeeves, in a very irrational fit of uh, probably bad programming from when he's been damaged before, uh, oh, the same person probably there's a quick, like, quick glitch in his system as he quickly pulls his gun up and fires. Who'd you fire at? Me. Ayala. Ayala, yeah. That means I fired twice, too. Just didn't hit either one. Oh, it's even worse then. Great. Okay. Oh god, you hit the- you hit- oh god. <laughs> you shoot, shoot the girl. Did shoot I the shoot lady. the lady? Did I hit the lady? Oh, uh, yes, lady actually. <laughs> oh lord. Yes. Yes. Yeah, so you pull up your guns, and you quickly fire a volley of blaster bolts at- A volley? <laughs> a volley, because you pulled two up and fired- I did the Reaper each. Death Blossom. Yeah, so you fire them off. They just barely miss Ayala, who was probably standing next to you. Oh, she, he was standing next to you. I was gonna say I was probably like in front because I was like, or if he was in the back, I don't know the position. Yeah, I just how, know how is everyone standing? Yeah, in, in the front at least. Uh, I'm in the back. I don't I'm know if back, people like, were surrounding us as well. I just know me and Zian were in the front because we were the ones talking directly to. Her. I'm always okay. in the front. This is just the thing I've accepted. Yeah, so you fire off some bolts. Uh, the first bolt strikes the wall, uh, strikes the uh, system on the wall, and an alarm starts to go off. Uh, the second awesome. bolt strikes the lady. Is she dead? Um, she probably has one soak. I need Two to know if most. she's dead or alive. Can we uh, medicine she's stabilize her? Dead, honestly. Oh, sweet yeah, lord! Yeah, she takes the bolt. She slumps to the ground. Slumps onto the table. Slumps as the dead. alarm starts to 
go. Yeah, I was just gonna put his two fingers uh, in his eye like he's saw. I wanna, I wanna his... check her pulse. Okay. Um, give me medicine, boys. A medicine check. Can you reset the pool this time? Yeah, I did reset. The pool. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, she seems to be dead. Mm. Oh, can I push her off the console and see if I can find the droid? <laughs> Plug in my blowtorch. Sure. Uh, I want to take console. a look outside of the building right now. I mean, are there guards already? Oh, they'll be coming. Assemble? Yeah, you hear some. You hear uh, a loud shouting from down the hallway. See, at this point, you're just going to see y'all start taking off his slug Okay, question. Back. Right here. Are these stairs that would lead into the casino? Can they be? Can they be? Yeah, I'm not sure about this map. <laughs> okay, so we're already, <laughs> already going to get screwed, so we're going to go on a heist as I well. I know, I know. Donke, I want those to be stairs as a back way into the casino so we can get away. How about that? <laughs> Wave hand in the air. Yeah, there is a way out of Isotech into the backgrounds of... So wherever you wish to go, in the, to what, the back streets of the hyperspace casino? That's what, that's what the light points are for. Yeah, just because oh, yeah. it's like, just a way to get out and not go through the main area. Yeah, so essentially, if you wish, you can spend destiny point and say this happens. Yeah, this much. happens. Like you get to choose what happens. Within Do we reason. not care about the droid anymore. I mean, we're gonna have. We can't just sit on the computer and hack it. You guys can try if you want, but yeah, Donkey, let me try that. The terminal is open. Damn, let me check it before we this run out. This is why I need smoke grenades. <laughs> Yala is getting the fuck out and going up the stairs. Yeah, I'm gonna go Boom. follow Yala. I'm, I'm gonna Boom. follow them. The heck, and I'll. Okay. Have my so I still pass already. Yeah, so pass. Yeah, sweet. Okay. Yeah, so the last the known when last known location when you see him on the little console is he seems to be along, going along the same path as you were the same uh, hyperspace route that you were given on the data pad at the start. He seems to be bored, maybe like a <laughs> ship of some kind that seems to be heading out along the same path that the Char Lanar took. Okay, so we we have that path already. Yeah, you already have the path that's been shared. I don't need to you. download anything. Okay, no. No. you already know the path. All we have to do is get to pads. the ship. Okay, yeah. so I'll follow. I'll follow them now that we have that info. Wait, does the lady have anything on her? Um, she you're, gonna, you're stopping the loot. The yeah, body that her. you just murdered. I'm a looter. I killed her. I killed her. Mine's a looter. <laughs> okay. Yeah, she has safety credits on her. Yes. Guards. Okay. And then I'll follow them, because, I mean... Donkey, as I go into the anything. hyperspace casino, I would like to take a look around and see if I can find my black sun friend. Um... Can my perception, me... boys? I'm getting the fuck out. I'm going straight for the ship. I don't give a... I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, beelining for the ship. ship. Yeah, I'm going can for I get the ship. roll? Yeah. I'm saying, like, as we're, as, like, as we're moving through the... You quickly, yeah, you quickly around. glance around. There's probably a setback, too, actually. Fuck! Oh! <laughs> That's a... Is it supposed to be that hard? Yeah. Wow. Jesus Holy Christ. shit. Well, so as you like... quickly look around, as you try to spot your uh, Black Sun friend, he seems to be gone. Like, he's either hiding or took off already. Like, once the alarms are going off. Because their alarms are still going off. That's true, he would, he would be the disappearing. Entire, the entire section of the station. Um, are there, like, guards coming through here now? Yeah, all the yards. Let's all the yards, all the boys in the yards. yard. The milkshake, you know? would have had milkshakes. some security cameras on in the office. That's good. The three, that's not good. <laughs> three, three nat ones here. There's no cameras. <laughs> no. Yeah, as far as you know, you guys. Um. No, there would have been a camera in the office. It's like a camera everywhere, pretty much. Yeah, so you guys are what running through the hyperspace casino. Trying to make your way back towards the, I guess, the I'm entrance of it. Be lining for it, and not yeah. stopping for anything. I'm okay. Dashing. As you the quickly uh, run out through, actually have a sheet put up these guys. Actually, I expected to use them. <laughs> Here, here's a question, Donkey. As we like, so where are we when this is happening? Like, are we Central Passage or where? Like, I assume we're um, doing something you like ran this. Out through the, the casino, yeah. You would probably be in the Central yeah. Passageway. Um, yeah, uh, when you look down the passageway, there seems to be guards on the other end running towards you guys. Can I... How are is, they already... Is it possible before they see us for me to use my grappling hook to ascend to the top yeah, of they, the hangar the to get a better would look? Have been, yeah, the guards would have been running, like, converging onto your location, like, Isotech's location, mm -hmm. from various security po checkpoints and offices around the area. So you just happen to stumble across some people heading your direction. 
They wouldn't necessarily know um, that we're like... like. Yeah, does it look like they know it was us or they just running? Um, let's see. How would I determine that? Because if oh God. that's a Roll real time. quick expo- response. It's okay, I've got this. Yeah, they would know who you are. Fuck. No Wait, it's not over I'm yet. I'm using a destiny point, so they already know who you are. Like, there's been a page out alarm lookout for a t- two Twi'leks, one with three head tails, one with two, a droid, and, uh... Fuck. If you don't know a who droid. I am, Don K, then you can't I'm gonna say, say to be fair, my problem having uh, three Leku is that three so Leku are not common. Droid and, uh, Can no. I wave my yeah, hand not, and say I'm not the right droid? Like a Nautilus? Nautilus. Nautilus, there's what it was. So I remember what the race was. I was trying to remember the name of it. Like the ones with a bunch of head, t- a bunch of uh, one kit fisto arms. looking like motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like the one Jedi that pushed over the hey. droid and smiled. Yeah. So yep. we're we're in the central passage, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, can I hack the door to get into the common hangar? Unless it's open. God, no. <laughs> <laughs> Look, y'all want to get away from the guards. Y'all the ones who want to run. No, it's just the fact we're already in combat. <laughs> oh, we are? Oh. I would like to quote Don K from the beginning of this. There shouldn't be any more combat until you get out the station. <laughs> you but it is you guys, so... <laughs> we wouldn't have had combat if y'all didn't say yes. There you go. <laughs> this it was, was well really worth it. Okay. Okay. Actually, I had <laughs> just a random hallway set up. Okay, so you guys enter the hallway. Before oh, combat do? starts, Don K... As- could I make yeah, an attempt to uh, to try to c- really? like, buy time? Oh no, it's blue silhouette man. Oh <laughs> shit! <Damn it. laughs> He's Wait, my nightmare. Oh, it's fairly this certain I actually up set up these dudes. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be the final boss because he keeps showing up everywhere. <laughs> oh my god, that's adorable! I love it. The Why are we fighting the ship? Silhouette, man. <laughs> ship is on our side, boys. Here we yeah, go. Yeah, there is a ship. <laughs> Wait, what? Guys, I always thought our <laughs> ship was a little bigger. Yeah. Um, I actually have a model for the ship when we actually do space are, combat. Are we actually fighting oh. the ship? Dead. No. <laughs> oh, okay. That's like, my God, this is going really poorly. <laughs> it's the sh- it's our ship's baby. Donkey, yeah, okay. are there any? Are, is there any crowd around us? Um, yeah, there'd be occasionally some random screaming people. Let's see. Can I shoot them? Is so it possible shoot? for me to try a leadership check to see if I can convince the people to kind of, yeah. like, increase their frenzy to give us a distraction to try to make our way through? Let's see. I'm going to search for some random dudes in. There we go. Damn, who's the blonde one? Can I be her? Damn. What do Damn, you think? Okay. Some random tokens. What do you think? Where's my charm? Where's my charm? Hold you on. want to make a leadership check to try to entice the crowd? Yes. Do I win? I want to try to entice the crowd with a leadership check. Because um, they're currently running around screaming. Yeah. So what are you trying to what? It would basically create a distraction and give us a chance to try to get to move past like kind of hiding yourself inside the crowd. When acting in a public venue, a character may use leadership to sway a crowd to take action. So what would you say to them? Um, get out of the way. You know what? I'm like, not. What go- would you be telling him to do? Oh my god, it's the murder droid! Everybody, run for your lives! Perfect. <clears throat> yeah, that would scream. That would terrorize everyone. Sick uh, nasty, so leadership bro. probably be contested by I don't uh, discipline. Discipline sort of was it's just random fucking civilians. Yep. Yep. Yeah, my favorite. Make your check. Certainly. <laughs> now, you're with the murdered. Are you with the murder droid? Yeah, you were with the murder droid. Of course. Ready? Yeah, yeah, back to murder around. droid. Being allied with murder droid. All right, go ahead. Hello. Fuck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're trying to entice the crowd into a frenzy to what, run screaming? Yeah, so we can try to have like now. additional like cover to try to run past this encounter instead of fighting it. Try to run past encounter. Yeah, run I think that was the guard slamming them in, slamming yeah. into them, pushing can them he, to the floor. Can he get a bonus if I shoot a few lasers off into the air? It's already made to check. Yeah, I succeeded. Oh. Yeah, there's probably a good oh, maybe like 20, 30 people. So yeah, you can't, they'll 
keep the, these guards distracted. Perfect. If you guys wish to run by, <sighs> yes. I feel like that's also be checked to pass by without being caught by them. I guess stealth with a bonus, like a boost. Um, either make a a coordination or a stealth to get by them. <laughs> Wonderful. Everybody? You guys can choose which one you want to roll. So everyone stuff? will have to make it. Yeah, everyone will have to make it or try to get past. So like you try to hide in the crowd, or you just completely try to avoid being like grabbed by them. Can we? Pass. Can we have a look booster? how well I blend in with these flesh bags? Do what? Is is there a booster now? Uh, boost for why? Because of the oh. distraction. Sure, I'll add a boost die. <clears throat> so stealth is my worst role in my character sheet. As is yeah, either make coordination or stealth. They're both shit. Let's be honest. Yeah. Maybe I Can I shit. use my four advantage? Oh no, he doesn't need. Oh, hold on. My four advantage oh, to help. God. G- uh, uh, G- on out. Let's see, it's success, success, success. She managed to get by. Could I roll athletics instead to uh, grapple up the top of the hangar? Wait, didn't you already say that you did? I mean, those. Uh, Jeeves, Jer, and Ayala got by just fine. Can I can I use athletics to grapple up instead of having to try to get through the crowd? That makes sense. Um, there wouldn't really be anywhere to grapple up onto. Like on top of the hangar. This, would, this is okay. this is a hallway. Okay, like we're actually in like a street street. Gotcha. Yeah, this is more like a hallway connecting the various hangars and shops. Yellow. <laughs> oh wait, you can take away one of those. Um, so oh, it would no. still be no. it, it would be nothing. Can I use my four advantage? The nothing is a fail. I'm I'm used to adding it myself. It makes me sad. Die? Huh? Can I use the four advantage to keep that boost die for Xion? Uh, that only applies to combat. Yeah, it does. So be actually a net nothing. Yeah, advantage outside combat has really no effect unless it's a good amount of advantage, which is. Can four. I? Can I shoot into the okay, air? Okay, so Jeeves, you take die? one strain. Okay. So Jeeves, you have one strain. Uh. Yeah, I feel like that'd be enough advantage to let her roll the second boost die. That's four. Perfect. Sick. Uh, Ayala, yeah, you're fine. You managed to quickly, so everyone quickly just hides themselves in the crowds as the crowd tries to push by the guards as they're trying to push through them and towards Isotech. And that's why they call me Smoke. <laughs> no one calls you that. No, that's literally what my name means. Yeah, as you guys Twilight. quickly like, lose yourself in the crowd as you run by the guards. And uh, as you manage to slip by them, undetected by them. What do you do? I really have to put points in the stealth. Go, go straight to the ship. Straight straight to the ship. Same. Yep. Still heading straight to the ship. Getting right in. As soon Boys. as we get there, I'm getting into the cockpit. <laughs> uh, I'm getting into gunner seat. And then I'll go over comms and say, So... <laughs> this looks familiar. <laughs> wow. Could we reach uh, out to Isotech and say that we're sorry and our droid no. is a moron? No. Um, no, because you said... I said we leave the droid. That's just me. No. Okay, who's going to repair your ship? Do we have a direct contact with this dude that we got our contract from? Yeah, you probably would have at least some, con- some like a way of communicating deal? with him. So yeah. should we reach out to him then? I'm going to or... tell you all to get on the ship, and I'll open the comm link to him. Perfect. Because yeah. as it stands, I think our contract... I thought there'd be one more stuff. dude right here, by the way. Oh no, my, ne- my nemesis. <laughs> I love him so well, man. Uh, Donkey, is, is this guy going to try to stop us from getting on the ship? Um, he... Let's see. Did he be alerted just yet? No. I mean, I'm not a murder hobo, but it no, can happen. Yet. Okay. <laughs> no, not yet. <laughs> not yet. Like, the, the call has gone out to look for these people, but no no pictures or anything has been shown up just yet. It's gone directly towards survivor. security first, and then goes out towards everyone else. Plus 20 wizard with time stop. Yeah, so you guys quickly try to uh, board the ship. You just, like, run past them. Yeah, yeah. Go straight to the ship. Yep. Or, okay. yeah. Hopefully yeah. we can get out of here. I was gonna say, I'm not really going to run. I'm just going to forcefully walk. I'm going to open okay, the so comm link past to... Walk past him? Or walk yeah, past him. Um, I'll walk past. Like, walk yeah. past? Yeah, he glances up. It's like, oh, yes, your uh, shipments have arrived and are on board the ship. I'll tell so him thank you. Go? You know what, Donkey? I'm going to toss him 50 credits and tell him, thanks for doing a good job. Yeah, he'll grab the credit stick and he'll start to examine it. It's like, ah, oh, yes. Uh, Buzz is doing business with you as he sits there examining the stick. Instead of looking at his console. Okay. So you guys quickly, as soon as the door opens, slip past and quickly aboard the ship. Yep. yep. I imagine. And I'm going to have like, what? And the dude's name is what? You never got his name. We didn't, did we? 
You never asked for his name? He's a mindless drone, it doesn't matter. No, I mean the dude in the Infotech. Oh, the Isotech? I thought yeah. he gave his name for that one. Yeah, you got Rom. He's Rom, currently that was the it. president of Isotech, whose secretary you just shot. I mean, I didn't shoot him. Well, one of your party did. Right. I, look, <laughs> I don't control droids. So, let's get the fuck out of here. Do it. Okay. I like how Dwes is still have... just behind the box. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just put them over there. Okay. I mean, we have uh, our, our mission. That's... What's the worst that could happen? Well, so you guys... We I mean, because if, our contractor, is... if our contractor hates us, let's just get to this treasure cache quick, and then we can sell it off to the highest bidder. Okay. I mean, at the end of the day, do we actually need the droid? All they wanted the droid was to, you know... He's our guarantee that if we have him... Oh wait, which droid? Jeeves or the other one? The other uh, one. C3, the C3, the 3PO. That he, they are using him to log that we found the treasure. Yeah. Well, there's other we ways to do it. We can back without that. Uh, so he's like, yeah, Roms wants some kind of proof that you guys found treasure and not just like bullshit. Like, oh hey, pay us. Because he'll pay you just to, to investigate it, period. He's paying you 30,000 credits just to investigate the uh, stuff. However, the G uh, the droid is there to also keep track of what you guys have found. Like Jeez. information, because this is more of an uncharted planet. Information on the planet, on the treasure cast, on the state of the ship, things like that. Got it. To see if there's anything left of value, and to keep track of what you guys found. Shit, it's blue silhouette man again. Well, uh, I'll, I'll okay. contact Jeeves real quick and say, Jeeves, did you figure out where the droid was headed? Oh yeah, I did. I'll plug my blowtorch into the hollow chest table and do computer things okay. to pass it into the cockpit. So that as AL powers up the ship and everything. Relaying that yep. information that the droid's headed to the same place that we are. Okay. So Yeah, it's our same it's the same route we were given. He's on another ship on that exact route. Yeah, I think it takes what I a forgot I didn't download power it. up a ship. Probably. Probably. Okay, how long is that route? How long is the route? Um, yeah. Depends. Are you going to follow the Charlotte or are you going to go directly towards the planet? Because there's two options you have. You can follow well, the path the... the ship took, or head straight to the planet, because you know where it is, the planet, where the planet is. Dancer lady is captain, not me. I am not the captain. So it'll probably take you at least two to three days, regardless of which route you take. Going oh, straight keep... there will be faster. Is it our captain the pilot and leadership? Yeah, the jumps. The question is, do we want to try to find this droid? Do we want to try to... Well, okay, so we know stuff. it's on the same path that we were supposed to go, so it doesn't hurt just to go ahead and go out there. We can we can get the droid, but if it records everything we find, then we are not exactly lawful good. Then we might have to turn some of that stuff in, as where if we don't have the droid, we could keep it, say we didn't find it, That's make some on the back Man, at this point, I would like to just get out of here, and then we can figure that out. We have to go yeah. there regardless, so let's go. I, w I would just recommend that we don't piss off Isotech any more than we already have. Yeah. How, long, I mean, how long have we been in here? Did they finish fueling the ship? Yeah, the ship would have been fueled. Uh, okay. I didn't know how that long. That was we... before oh, we yeah. murdered everybody. My shipment came too. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. I need a sh station. 56. Shit. What is this? Here, here, here's Space our combat. Space combat. Oh, that's the combat thing. Oh, I All was right, like, that's our what station, is you guys. Are leaving it. Um, I don't have a station. That red <laughs> <in there. laughs> I don't have the a red stand. spiral of death. <laughs> yeah, it's a very large station, uh, so essentially it's the right side of the port, map. Port is left, so you gotta face it that way. Yeah, so you guys wish to... Wait, can we add... It's probably a little bigger than that. No. Okay. That still seems a little small. Uh, controlled by all players. Dude. So where are we heading to? Oh, where are you guys headed to as you uh, depart the station? We're going to say I'm the Jeeves put in the coordinates towards the ship, right? Yep. Drone no, R. we Don, uh yeah, Donkey said we already had it. It was falling. Oh, well, yeah, if you have the coordinations going. so you have two options. You have the flight path that Charlinar took. And you also also have the planet's location. Uh, Trogana. 
So it might be quicker so to you go. Can, to yeah, so your unit. options are either you can follow the path and f- go after the droid, because the droids have already gone and, as you just noticed, take the same path as Star Lenar. What's so you can try to, We're going to have to find him anyway, so yeah. might as well go after the droid. So you can either, yeah, you can either follow him to get to the and follow the, the path, or you can try to jump to straight to, towards Jogana and try to cut them off. It'd be smart to cut them off. Because because it'll be quicker to jump straight there than it would be to follow the path. Correct. Because the path leads through the couple like two other jumps before it gets to Chol- Chol- towards Cholgana. What's the planet called? Cholgana. Cholgana. Yep. You said it. And we are a hundred percent sure that ship is going to be there. It's not on my list. No. That is the path that the droid was fo- was heading out towards before they managed before they lost c- contact with the beacon on the droid. Is that okay. the outer rim? Yeah. Cholgana is definitely out of space. space. It's going to be C H O L C H O P G A N N A. Don't care. Is there a possibility that one, the ship will not be. I mean, we're going after a ghost ship that is rumored to be there. Okay. Got it. Punch it. Yeah, so you guys wish to depart the station then? Let's. Oh, yeah, no, we're getting the fuck out of the station. Okay. uh, We'll figure out the path or the. or the planet here after we're free. Is it a common route? Is it a more commonly yeah. used route? The planet is not occupied. It's not. Yeah, it's it kind of a nothing planet. planet. So it's going to be partial. It's route. more of an uncharted planet because it's so far out of the way and no one really goes there. Okay, so partial route. So region. It has... it's one difficulty upgrade. Let's head to the planet. Okay, so you guys wish to depart the station. Okay. With the three Starfighter. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. <laughs> Press X to die. Okay, so you guys uh, leave the station as the alarms are blazing off and the things. Um, <laughs> as you guys start to take off from the station, the station's uh, batteries turn to look at your ship and prepare to fire. Stealth. In addition, you can spot... Um, yeah, like, give me a perception check. I don't think ships have stealth. <laughs> Clo- uh, the ghost. Right. I mean, yeah. cloaking is. So Ayala, the pilot, yep. My man. Yeah. <laughs> distance, as well on the sensors, three more smaller fighters seem to be also heading towards your direction. Don't care, are there any bigger ships out there? Come back. Well, boys, we got, some par- we got a party incoming. Yeah. How quickly can you jump, Captain? Not the Captain. Probably not soon enough, but I'll try. Um, Someone can make a roll to see if they want. Alright, what should I roll? Um, so where are you jumping? I'm jumping are you going to, to follow the path, or are you going follow to... Follow the path. Yeah, I'm, I'm following the path. It's the oh, one that I... Oh, went you, mean, you mean to We Chogana? didn't talk about it yet. I was going to say, we haven't talked about it, and there's ships incoming, so... Straight to, to the planet. Quicker. Yeah. Yeah. We, were, we were talking about it, just not really in character. Over the comms, I will tell you, it punch it, it oh. to Chogana. Okay. Alright. Uh, so you're direct. So you're jumping straight to Trogana. Yep. Oh, okay. This is okay. And combat. What? Did it... Especially since the pilot's doing it, you have a setback die. Oh boy. Plus one Sometimes. difficulty upgrade. Okay. Uh, roll when you're ready. No unless you wish to use fight or dark type points. I-, I would say use it, even though it's our last one. Yeah, I know it's our last one. Use it. Yeah. I mean, we just don't despair this shit. Or and I'm gonna upgrade my side, so I'll throw that in on my side. Um, you guys also have an astromech droid on board. Wes's. There you go. True. Yep. Thought he sold yep. it. So that's a bonus because yeah. Asher McJoy's yeah. actually have a bonus to doing that. All right. Okay. So roll when you're ready. Right. Don't fail this. No pressure. You did it, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Triumph. <laughs> Be blazing. Nice. Boy, that's why I got that three three yellow dice. Okay. <laughs> God damn that yeah. roll though. <laughs> as soon as you get, let's see. So to make each failure a bad thing. We didn't fail well. well. I was gonna say there's none of them. Okay, um, I think within two turns you can jump straight to Targana. With double triumph? Uh, One success, two advantage, and two triumphs. Let's see, what does triumph give you? When dealing damage to a target, have the attack destroy a piece of equipment. As we left that all those batteries were targeting us. Can we have the batteries? I would just say the batteries... Um, How do you want to spend them, Ayala? You're the one piloting it. You have two (laughs) triumphs to spend. Where do I go yep. to look at that you shirt? You can either spend um, four turns jumping, 
Or you can spend a triumph to knock off three of those turns. And then the, you can spend another triumph to knock out the laser cannons on the, the station. So they, that. Yeah, so they they target they target they turn to fire to fire at you, but they're just missing because of how close you are to the station. I'm just that good at flying, don't I? Yeah. Can't believe they're it. just too close. Yeah. So like they're too close, so they're fu- they, they fire nearby, like close to you, but you just quickly dip and dodge out of the way. The fighters are still behind you on the, on your tail though. And then we and then, just have to survive a turn. Yeah. Okay. Right. Okay. So the fighters would. Oh, where the fighters be roughly? Do we put our shields to to full aft? Yeah, or is that a starfinder? Port. port. Port rather. Aft. aft. There's one at aft. Yeah, the one at aft. Is that the one there? And two at four. All right. Oh, true. That's right. They, we moved them. Never mind. No, four is the front of the ship. Yeah, four yeah, starboard. Oh, correct. correct. Yes, yeah, sorry. We'd have two port, there one starboard. Go. Yeah, that's actually yeah. correct. Yeah, because certain weapons can have certain firing arcs. That's why this one's got the, the lines on it. Yeah, you could. All right, so the yes, who go first? I don't remember how space combat works. I don't do it often. Dun, 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 dun. Fire Goodness. my lasers. I'm about to pew 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 it up. Alright, Ayala, roll your initiative. How many guns are on this bitch? One. Two. <laughs> There's two. two. One on the top, one on the bottom. Um, oh, as soon as they like start, like they're in attack formation, I'm gonna go and comms and say, am I supposed to shoot back at them? What do you want me to do? Yes. Cap. Do we, though? Do we want to? <laughs> we haven't killed any. <laughs> Fine. Let's just go. Whoa. Okay. Okay. If if they shoot us and we can't go because they shoot at us, then yes. If not, no. We're going. Shoot only if okay. necessary. Yeah. Uh, roll your initiative, Ayala. Since you're the pilot. All right. Click on the and ship. everyone just go on your his turn. Same character. Cool or vigilance? Um. Cool, because you were actually expecting the, expecting it. Oh wait, hold up. One sec. I still had that upgrade in there. Oh, I just, I realized I did too. I know, for the ice pool. Interesting. So if we take off, what, one of those advantage, one advantage? It'd be, it'd be two, one for us. Oh, okay, I still have a three green, so. I would just re-roll it then. Uh, I'll, yeah. All right, re-roll it then. Hey! Hey, still from the same thing. It's one less advantage. Okay. So you guys will go first before you jump. So you survive this turn, then you can jump next turn. Okay. So what do you want you to do? There's a it's like, let me reopen the starship. Can yeah. I prepare an action? Yeah, uh, if you open up starship combat, there is various smaller things you can do on board. That's what I'm trying to find. What pages? Like, like damage control, God, repairing. Impossible to read on this monitor. I know. It's oh, do you have a combat. handout for starship combat? Yeah. Oh well, shit. That saves me time. There you go. <laughs> Let's see, actions. Uh, yeah, so there's... Action is pretty much what everyone can do. Except the pilot, of course, because the pilot has to do the piloting. But then you can have a co-pilot, someone can try to jam him, or you can boost the shields, things like that. I was going to say, there's, what, there's pilot course jam... Is that jumping or jamming? I can't bloody tell. Um... And um, pilot the course hyper- is yeah, when you're trying bottom. to jump. When you're well, no, I'm just going through the list because it says pilot course, co-pilot, either jumping or jamming. I can't tell what that second letter is. Uh, uh yeah, I, this would be pilot pilot course. So, like, you plot an astrogation to hyperspace. Then co-pilot can give you a bonus to the pilot. Um, and then jamming is you can try to jam communications oh, to make it okay. harder. Yeah, harder jamming. So you can try to, so it makes it harder for the enemies to shoot shoot at you. Can I fire some like spoof missiles or something? Um, does your ship have any? I don't know. No. Then no. Mm. So yeah, the maneuvers I, uh, is what the pilot can do. So are we only making maneuver? like? Are we all doing yeah. our own action? Or are we doing a single action? Everyone has one. I'm gonna evasive maneuver. Yeah, I'm so the do. pilot's gonna try evasive maneuvers. Everyone else could try to do something as well. Essentially, it's your ship, and then they're then them. I would like to. Attempt to boost the shield. Okay, ship will suffer one strain. Oh wait, never mind. Can... Never mind. It's a fucking mechanics check. We're not doing that. I take it back. <laughs> yeah, that would be bad um, for everyone, especially me. I'm because uh, yeah, you don't still have has to do to anything to make the jump to hyperspace, right? 
Um, he made the he made he plotted the course, I believe. Okay, so he, but does he have to still roll the astrogation roll to jump for it, or? Um, yeah, I believe okay. actually to successfully make because he's got the course in, but he still has to make the jump itself. Yeah, I just can't um, start and try that till the next turn, right? Yeah, he can't start to try it till next turn. Then I'm gonna assist him in that by not talking to him and keeping One so I'm not a distraction. Okay, so you're just not going to do anything? That's my assist. I'm giving him a boost. I, I'm okay, assisting. so I give him a boost. Yeah, you can do that. You can get boost out of someone. Okay. Anyone else want to do anything? God, my skills are ass. <laughs> <laughs> you're a crit machine, but everything else is fucking ass. Well, I, it's not like I can talk to the the enemy. Um, How much does it cost to angle shields? Um, uh, To boost shields? It's no, one strain, shields. and you angle? have to make a mechanic. Check. Oh no, it's angle deflector shields. Where's one that? part defense. Reassign one point of defense to one another. So I would say let's like angle the four shields to port and have two defense on. No, that the pilot side. only the pilot can do the maneuver. Oh, the okay. The co-pilot can as well. Pilot and co-pilot can do them, or co-pilot can only do. The actual straight up maneuver, but uh, angled, yeah, you can do angled, angled deflector shields because it says pilot only on the side. So he, so yeah, Ayala doesn't try to base maneuvers. You can angle the shields if you wish. So you'll have All to right, decrease from one to add to another, Fuck. and that doesn't require a check, right? So that that can be your action. Can I? Attempt to do fire discipline in case we have to make an attack. Yeah, you can land an assist if you wish as well. Assist is an option. So you give a boost to someone else, the next person who's going to check, which would be Ayala. For sure, the I'll just do that. So okay. he gets two boosts. Uh, G is what are you, you going to do? Uh, I'm going to sit here and play hollow chess with IG. <laughs> okay. <laughs> If the ship mechanics gets broke, not, I'll get up and fix it. Doing anything. Yep. Yeah, if the ship gets broke, I'll get up and fix it. Yeah, you can, you can boost shields if you wish. That's always an option. Do that. But you're going to sit but, there and do nothing. But if I go and boost the shields, can you guarantee me IG won't cheat while I'm away from the table? Yes. I Yeah, I'm more... Yeah. He's a, he's a loyal yeah, robot. Then I'll go boost the shields. I was going to say, you should just be able to stick your torch into the hollow deck, you know? Yeah, can I just do that? Like when yeah, I set you can do it from where you are. Coordinates? Okay. Yeah, you just got to tune into the ship system. Do it. Yeah, so just okay. give me a mechanics check. Okay. Is it set properly? Yep. It's got three purples. <laughs> hey! Nice. Oh my god! I want to use those two to triumphs to sneak a sneak in two different cheats against IG. Okay. Definitely not boost <laughs> the shields anymore, but, you know. Yeah, definitely not. <laughs> yeah. I already boosted it. I gotta... Look, if IG wins again... Remember, this then... is essentially combat now, so you could spend those triumphs per combat. Yep. Yeah. Can I just instantly destroy those two ships? Uh, no. <laughs> they're not oh. minions. They're not min. Yeah, one, they're not oh, minions. They're not minions? No. Oh, I figured they might be minions. No. Nope, they're more considered rivals. Okay, hold on, let me... You oh, could the Starship combat upgrade the difficulty of the targeted thing. characters next check. You could upgrade any ally characters next check. You do something vital, such as shooting the controls to nearby blast doors. Uh, you could... Could you use that to gain additional shield? Yeah, I would allow you to get to gain additional shield. Would that be the, that's the equivalent of like gaining a plus one defense, right? Yeah, essentially, as a set, each shield adds a setback towards the person shooting at you if they're shooting you from that angle. Oh hell yes! So for two, you could literally add like one to each side. Yeah, you can add <laughs> one to each side. Uh, okay. Or two to the one where there's two of them, I guess. Yeah. Because why do you have a boost? Good. Yeah. Let's see. Let me open up. Great thing. Whenever you guys wish to rename that thing. Oh, that's the name of the ship. Okay, so yeah, so you have one forward, one on the aft, in terms of defense. Uh, you can either, with the triumphs, add additional one. So you're adding one more defense, 
and then you can spend each triumph to add an additional defense to wherever you please. And uh, fuck. so he has three defenses to add. Correct. If he wishes, if he to. wants to do it, yeah. Okay. Starboard, and port, and aft. Era, you also can move one of those defenses. So you can move the forward or aft to, uh, to the starboard or port, wherever you wish. Or was it you move one or add one? Uh, yeah, you resign one. You guys have the great fang on the thing. Yes. Yeah. Mm hmm. Jeeves? Yeah. Well, are you gonna <laughs> do your defense? Starboard port and aft. Starboard port and aft? Okay. Starboard. Oh, do I actually add it on there? Yeah, you can yeah. actually add it to the thing. I already did it for you. Oh, I didn't know that's what you wanted me to do. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Jerry, you can move one. So you can just tell me which ones you move. I can move it. Or you can do it yourself. Wait, I can. Yeah. I, so on the Cray Fang, everyone not, has access my, I already to did it. My, I already did my action. I added a boost. Oh, yeah, I added a boost. Play I added a boost boosts. to Ayala. Okay. Oh, that's what it was, though. All right. Wait, why the hell do we have two and aft and they're not aft? Because he's adding three. He's spending both triumphs to add additional two. Okay. Because you only have, have one forward, one and aft. So now you have one port, starboard, and two and aft. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, the three fighters are gonna bring it on. The range on these. I'm just confused why we didn't put two at port instead of two at aft. Hey, that's he just put it at aft. That's what he said. Okay, and what's the range on these guns? Okay, so I got to close the distance. I think I'm going to turn space combat more into ground combat, because space combat itself is just so confusing with how many numbers flying around. Yeah, it's crazy. It's like, depending on your ship speed, and the maneuver, and the fucking thing of the ship. It's like, ugh. Okay, I need tokens. Okay. These ones are on the port. We're going to have to spend a maneuver to get closer. And then they're going to ship strain. To get another close. <laughs> Let's see, is you within range? Oh, still fire at you. Those other two ships are uh, hitting the station. I think they blow up. No, no, they're just there. Here, I'll put them here. Happy. <laughs> they're leaving the station. Yeah, they're leaving the station. I'm hitting the station. Hey, okay. random question before we do this. Not that it matters now, but I would just ask. Does my plus one advantage to initiative apply to ship combat? No, because you're not the one piloting. Okay. Gotcha. It's only the pilot. You don't want me to pilot, so that's fine. Yeah, unless you're piloting. <laughs> but Ayala said she is. <laughs> We'd all be dead. You can yeah, no, pilot. I think you want me pilot. I think you want me piloting. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, give me the pew pews. This one's gonna fire. Let's see how dangerous were you? We're not very dangerous. I had a murder. We only killed a bunch of people. It's fine. We didn't try oh, wait, to. Just, our our troy accidentally did yeah. it. This one's just going to fire its cannons at you from outside the range. So it's going to have a setback because he's outside his normal range. His close range. He's at... Uh, not close. He's at medium. That's two, per two blacks. Okay, let's take a shot. Big money to whammies. Oh yeah, and two... Doesn't matter, miss. Woo! And there's also the setback. Holy shit, link itself. one, really? Yep. Holy shit. Yeah, so he fires, and he quickly just fires right as they fly right past you. Um, the next one... Let's do this one. Yeah, it's like... Doo -doo 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 -doo, they just fly as you quickly do some invasive maneuvers to quickly dip out of the way of the incoming rounds. Coming blaster rounds. I was gonna say, I'm gonna yell hold on before I do. Down through the comms. <laughs> yeah. And you probably hear some alarms going on in the ship. Like, gonna, the combat I'm, alarms or something. I'm gonna yell back to you to do a barrel roll. Barrel. Can I add that be my uh, my base of maneuver? Yeah. Use the boost to push through, Fox. If you want to describe how you dodge it, go ahead. It's a barrel roll, yeah. A barrel roll. Oh. Hold on, let me get some Star Fox quotes for you. <laughs> okay, the other one is going to spend two more ships to strain, to close, to short, and then close on the aft side. 
Okay, what do invasive maneuvers do again? Were there not supposed to be any purples in those shots? Oh, true. Ah, I already rolled it. Well, yeah, I'm just saying for the future, because if you're going to yeah, roll the same thing again, it's like, um... <laughs> okay, end of the round. Of a difficulty of all attacks against you. Okay, perfect. So, there is a, so it's one manned way. Close range. There is one shield on that side. One purple, one black. One purple, one black. Upgraded difficulty of missive maneuvers. I will spend a dark side point. Thank you. Hey. And upgrade the attack against you guys. All right, so let's go. Sure. Woo. Oh, it's a miss. <laughs> awesome. It's a quickly flies by as you dodge these rounds again. How do you dodge them? This other one closes and starts to fire at you. This one I'm going to kind of do a, what is it, not a barrel roll, but a loop, pretty much. Yeah, it's a quick loop as you quickly evasively dodge the round, the incoming blast rounds at you. Used to boost the push through. This one's going to spend two strain as well. <laughs> and close two bands. Okay, it's an upgrade on the difficulty. We are one, two, three. Okay. Three purple, two black. Okay, I am at medium distance, so it's two purples. Two purple. My bad. Uh, black for the shield. <laughs> Upgrade because base some maneuvers. Okay. Okay, what's the range on this one? Short. So additional black. Uh, I'll use another dark side point. All right. Um, this one, instead of firing its blaster, uh, <laughs> its linked laser cannons at you, it's going to fire a missile. Oh, great. Great. Fun times. Okay. That's a bit of overkill. Hey, oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Breach 4. Yeah. As this so, one quickly launches a missile at you, as it quickly just fly, how do you, as it flies at you, what do you do? So, this one's going to be a barrel roll, but it's going to be one, like, as it, like, inches, as it, like, it's about to hit. I'm just kind of, like, flipping directly over it. So, like, yeah. until it, like, finally passes at a point where it won't hit the ship at all. It's just, like, you know, it's, like, three feet oh, away shit. the whole time I'm doing the flip. Oops. I just uh, swung that dice. What is guided? What is guided again? One and second. what is slow firing? Like Slow firing, that? you can only fire, like, every once in a while. Uh, it's, like, yeah. a recharge. It's, like, basically, I think it takes, like, a one. It's a massive reload. The number indicates how many turns you have to wait between to fire again, I think. Okay. I think so. Let's see, guided. I think with guided, it's actually not good. Guided quality 156. Certain types of projectiles will benefit from course alterations after being fired, such as guided. The character misses while firing a guided weapon, and if guided activates, he may make an attack check at the end of the round. The difficulty of the check is calculated by comparing the weapon's silhouette of 0 to the silhouette of the target, and the check's ability dice equal to the weapon's guided rating. If the test is successful, the weapon strikes the target and damages don't normally. Where is well, regardless, so what's your ship? But it doesn't succeed because right. there's only you one need three. advantage. So basically, if he got three advantage, regardless of missing, the, basically the thing would have turned back around, and he would have gotten another chance to hit us at the end of the round. Yeah, because I didn't spend those three advantage on the previous ship. But fuck it. it but, yeah. but yeah, if he had gotten three, it would have been able to turn around and take another shot at us. I'll roll two boost. I don't think it's going to get enough. Because what? Spend what? Three advantage... Uh, yeah, I can only spend it to give it a boost to the next one. Yeah, I can give it two blues. That's about it. <laughs> next person and targeted character. Correct. All right. Yeah, one not enough regardless. Close though. Yep. So get is actually pretty good. <laughs> yeah. So it fires a missile as it quickly as you quickly loop over it. Okay. So you're gonna try to jump to hyperspace now. Oh God, yes. Yep. Plus two uh, boost. That's. I I helped. Does that count? The jump itself would be. It is astrogation. And we have an astromech droid. Yeah, so you have four blues. <laughs> and it's going to be two purple to jump it. Oh my god. I believe in you, y'all. Four blues. <laughs> four bl uh, you, you know what? Just because just fuck it. Please, yes. I don't want to. Please upgrade. All right. <laughs> yeah, pilot. Astrogation Sweet lord. Pilot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at those blues. Those are beautiful blues. Yeah. So you quickly. Hit the button, or 
Describe what you do. Punch it. I'm, damn, I'm trying to eat here. Oh, sorry. I'll I can yeah, describe it for you. I was gonna say it. you go for it. I'm I'm trying to eat at the moment. Yeah. As you quickly dip and out of the way as you str- struggling to avoid all this fire incoming round fire fire at you, as you quickly just sl- pull up a little lever and just slam it back down. As the all the stars on the, the front of the cockpit are to like stretch and elongate as you jump to spa- hyperspace, and we hear the Star Wars theme song in the background. Yeah, we survived! Yay! <laughs> gonna, yeah, yeah, it's successfully jumped to hyperspace. I'll take you. I think straight there is a two-day journey. I think normally, let's see. You're jumping straight there, correct? Yep. Okay, and... There's no threat, was there? <laughs> no. All advantage is assessed. Nice. For a bit, so I can reduce my stress. Yeah, it'll take and you two then, days so everyone can stress can reset. I'm going to hey. explore the holonet. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I managed to jump to hyperspace and avoid combat. Congrats. Hmm. I'll reach out to uh, Gian and say, are you going to send out that uh, the uh, that heartfelt apology? Yeah. I, I, I can. Do you think that's a good idea? Uh, well, I guess we need to decide whether or not one, we want to make amends or keep the loot for ourselves. Keep it for ourselves? I mean, we do have an organization that might be interested. Yeah. At the same time, like, do we want to make an enemy and have bounties on our heads? I, okay, well, so you're asking, so you're asking me if you want us to accrue another bounty to give a share of what we get to the Black Sun. <laughs> I just don't like giving shit to the Black Suns. I'm with him. I mean, look, it hasn't caused us any problems so far. I'm with. And there's that key word, so far. But on the other hand, we've caused problems where we were already, so. Exactly, so we keep the loot. To the Black Suns will be useful in the fact that maybe they'll take out our bounties. I am. Do not want to do it. I could could try to. I could try to open a communication with Maru and see if uh, she might be interested. Okay. Or well, we then not fuck say, with them for a while. And I keep it for ourselves. You talk to you to figure that out first, and then we'll make this decision. But if she cannot guarantee that we have this bounty off of us, then I would say no. So I frankly don't even trust the Black Suns. I. I mean, they're mysterious for a reason. I don't, plas- I don't trust y'all. You just, don't trust us? Just There's a difference between understanding and trust. That hurts. How about this? Let's, let's see what that we hurts. can get, and then once we know what we have, we can try to make deals. Okay. Fine with me. So, I guess we just... Arrive at our destination. Oh, well, yes, just wanna skip to we get there. Is there anything interesting on the Hollow Net, Donkey? Do you like have anything specific? Net. Uh, not really. <laughs> www.roboporn.com. <laughs> God damn it, Jeeves. First thing that comes up. I think that'd be more IG than Jeeves. Probably. Wow. <laughs> it's probably no. What you pull up on the Hollow Net is a bunch of stri- trips down blaster guns and everything. Like, it's just a bunch of guns that kind of, like, been stripped down, so they're more bare than anything else. Um, what? Yeah, IG was on it last, so. Can I? That yeah, would make mm-hmm. sense. I'm going to look at IG. I'll just open, like, a new eye. tab and Wait, see if there's, like, who's Jeeves? What's your, what's your Roll20 name? Jeeves? Potato. Jeeves oh, potato. potato. Okay. Yeah. Oh, are you it's actually Sakara Potato in there? Okay. I'll open a new tab. I won't exit out of it, but in the new tab, does it come off as like breaking What's the news home page? or some shit like that? <laughs> What's the homepage? <laughs> the homepage is like Google, but with like five, like twenty different O's, different, 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 different
Google. over the years. Google. You gotta like, scroll Google. down for a few minutes before you can find the search bar. Yeah, there's also like in, like in the corner like an E23 as well. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well I guess not. Let's just arrive, I guess. Yeah, unless uh, you want to look at something. Headquarters? Unless you want to like, put something specific up. It's just random stuff. You can scurry the net. Where's Google headquarters? Uh, probably Coruscant. Uh, can, oh shit, that's in the inner rim, isn't it? Yeah, yep, or yep. the core yeah. planets. Core, core rooms. Yeah, core worlds. Yeah. Essenti- it essentially be core world. Oh, I guess we're not gonna rob them for what I mean. Visit. Mm. We could say fuck this and go jump there. It's <laughs> 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 always an option. <laughs> I don't, I don't think know. we have that fuel though. We can't make it even if we use a popular route, we can't we don't have that kind of Wait, why are we not going to the, the No, we're going to the ghost ship. Okay, I'll say like, what the, the hell? Ship. Yeah. No, Donkey's okay. saying if if we wanted hey, we could yeah, go rob. If you really want to say fucking go to something else, you really could. I have I think mean, Kato's trying to but... get us to go rob uh Google. I mean look okay. if we go to Chogana and we get her stuff, then we'll have something to go sell off and make money and you know, my Google. What? I'm sure Google existed a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. It's uh, it's now Stoogle. Star Wars Google. Google. I mean, Fair technically Google. they're alphabet, Stoogle. right? Oh, so. I thought it was made by some dude named Stu. Welcome to Stoogle. Uh, no. So, are we arriving at Cholgana then? Yeah. So you guys want to just kind of chill and relax until you get there? Mm-hmm. Say, I'm about to go get me a drink real quick. So. Yeah, you guys want to take like a 10 minute break? Chill and relax and act and. Yeah, let's take like a 10 minute break. People outside the school. That way everyone can go grab a snack or get something to drink. And then we'll Sound come good. back at 10 minutes or so. Sound, Sound good? good. Alright. Oh, wow. Well, Discord a adds a uh, thing when you're streaming that has a watch button when you click on their name. Not really? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's got find your name. Oh, there it is. That's cool. That's actually pretty cool. That's how it always gets yours. It's just quicker. Yeah, 10 minute break. Cause I'm oop, oop. Real quick. Wait, can you read that first and say yes or no? Just yes or no? Yeah, you could. Okay, I'm gonna do it then. Alright. I don't. Do you need me to do anything specific? Because it's just as simple. Yeah, uh, you can probably just send a message. Okay, okay, I had a really dumb question. You know how, um, you know how I gave Maru the uh, that, that con channel or whatever? If I spin yeah. a light side point, could I guarantee she answers? Is that a thing a light side point would do? Um, as long as you're within range. Okay, but it wouldn't guarantee think, the range then. Yeah. Gotcha, uh, gotcha. Range, not so much, because that's physical equipment. Okay. Instead of something conveniently happening. Like, conveniently happening, it's like, oh, she wasn't in a meeting, or she wasn't doing anything at that moment. Gotcha. So, like, if I knew she was in range, then I could guarantee she would answer. Yeah, like, if you got to a space station and then calmed her, then yeah, she would answer. Okay, cool. I wasn't sure what the extent of the points would be. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because as long as it's not, like, like physically impossible... Uh, you can do it. So I'd assume this planet is mostly abandoned. It's going to be like. I will find out when we get there. Because <laughs> <laughs> there's nothing more terrifying than Star Wars wild- wildlife. Oh, yeah. Alright, I'll be right back.
Do you know the way? Please kill yourself. <laughs> what he said. <laughs> uh, sorry, so much cancer. Can I spend a, a destiny point if you never say that again? Oh my god. Oh, I love it. <laughs> so hyperspace, much time fighter, very force. <laughs> Oh, so we're just missing, um, uh, we'll be missing our fifth. All right, I'm sure Sakara will jump on randomly and, like, murder somebody. Of course, probably. Exactly at that time. Conveniently, when the Rancor's attacking! I mean, would there really be Rancor's on an abandoned planet in the Outer Rim that's been pretty much left off every chart? We're not even going to the planet, we're going to the ship that's supposed to be there, supposedly. I'm just saying, like, what are the odds there's actually a Rancor? Yeah. There's the going to be a Rancor on the ship. Yeah, last known coordinates was in that system. So. Do Rancors have a home? Yeah. Like a home planet? Yeah, it's called Ran. <laughs> yeah, yeah, World. Dathomir. No, I think it's called Ran, and it's been spread out over, over the years since it's been found, because it's been a very vicious animal. So if you can tame it, or it's more or less capture it. Yeah, capture it. It's like, you know, fuck it, drop it on the enemy compound. Rancors are large, the... semi-sentient reptilian carnivores native to the planet Dathomir. Standing five meters Dathomir. tall, long arm, immense jaws, and armored hides that would stand blaster fire. They're a formidable planet of formidable predators. Mm. Dathomir, the Night Sisters world. A rancor named Patissa was kept as a pet by Jabba the Hutt. <laughs> Well, that's good to know its name. Yeah, you know, you could have a name for this horrifying creature. So the okay. Night Sisters Look. sold them off. I'm looking for music, I type in space. First thing comes out, Space Jam. Come <laughs> on and slam. <laughs> it's like, you know what? Welcome to what the Space for. Jam. Maybe Rancors are just misunderstood. <laughs> 16 feet tall, 3,500 pounds. What if they had, like, you know, a society and, like, government? Mm. The concept for the Rancor in Return of the Jedi was described by its creators as a cross between a bear and a potato. A bear and a potato? It was first to be played by an actor in a suit, but no one was satisfied with the results. Rancor was then made as a rod-operated puppet filmed with a high-speed camera to, to slow its movements down to give the illusion of a much larger creature. I like it. I liked how they did it. I'm glad they didn't do man suit. That's one of the appeals of the original Star Wars. It was very puppet-driven. Mm -hmm. I also like that Patissa has like an arm hanging out of its mouth. Watching Fairlight play Subnautica and he's about to drown. <laughs> Sonata is really? a terrifying yeah. thing. Like Sonata in VR God. just feels like a giant nope. Yeah, yeah, you can. It, it, you actually could play it in VR, yep. and it is probably just as scary. There's a <laughs> prequel to Aquaman. <laughs> yeah, that's probably the funnest thing about Sonata because, like, sure, it's in the ocean, so you're probably expecting fish, but it's like, but how big could they be? I like that the thing stays kind of true to the concept. The further you go down, the more fucked up things are. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Scariest things get. It's like, hey, what if I go to like two thousand meters? Well, yeah, like once you're in like hundred and two hundred, you can see like the ocean floor. It's like, oh, I, I feel somewhat safe. Like, but then like once the floor just drops off and you kind of just floating in the middle of nothing. Yeah, like, it's like go. and you wet yourself and it's great. Yeah, down. one thing yeah, I really like, a like. There's one really fun thing about it is they capture the concept of like when you're underwater swimming, when you lose that ocean floor. For there are moments where like I don't know which way's up. Mm hmm Yeah. Um epic. <laughs> or the you go so deep that lava still flows. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. of the pressure. Pressure. Only thing I don't yeah. understand is why can I swim where my ship can't? <laughs> yeah, the re the realism on the player character itself isn't very accurate. Because you don't have any nitrogen and blossom and blo well. Emblosis, I think it's called. Right. Or the mm -hmm. bends. Oh, he's going into the eyeball cave. 
Yeah, yeah but it's a fun game. Are you required to, like, cure the Aurora, or no? Um... I don't think so. No. It is extremely helpful because they give you death module and sight. Right. In order to beat the win, you have to explore it. Oh, do but, you? Yeah. Because the end game is you eventually build a rocket to escape. Right. And the only place you get the plans for the rocket is on board the Oh, is that on the Aurora? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm debating. I've been debating if I want to buy it or not. Um, Actually, if you like survival games, it's a very I really, relaxed. I would love for it to have mod support. Yeah, it's a more relaxed survival game because the only thing you have to worry about is food and water. And the Leviathans. And that. you can easily avoid those once you know how to avoid them. Yeah. I've well, until you know you have to not avoid them. I've been trying to decide between Subnautica, RimWorld, they are billions, and PUBG. RimWorld, I would highly suggest. RimWorld's highly, highly RimWorld's replayability is way up there. Oh. As mod support. So sport. And when you Xavier get the psychotic billions, people, Xavier billions is pretty good. Uh, Wormwood, sure. I think, is up on the top of the list because of how chill it is. Because you, and, there's no threat. There's no. It's just like, well, you say, I'm just you here say to play and have no some fun. Until one of your dudes has a mental break and lights the entire base on fire and everyone dies because you can't kill them quick. I mean, more like you're not under pressure, really. <laughs> like compared to oh, like yeah, a shooter, no. where it's yeah, like you're not. You know, like there's no like huge pressure to do something. Yeah. Did you guys hear yeah. that DayZ is actually supposed to go into beta within the next few months? <laughs> what? What? Yeah. Only after like 18 years? Kind of like. Uh, it's been Star like five, five or six years. Kind of like Star Citizen? <laughs> it's been. I got that when I first got in the army five years ago. And I'm See, still but at waiting. least Star Citizen's actually improving. That's where DayZ is not. Oh, we yeah. got rid of some more bugs. Oh, cool. So only 19. <laughs> and then you go. added 50,000. <laughs> <laughs> Good news, guys! We got rid of 132 bugs. We and we only we added, added 142. 142. <laughs> so. Oh, and you know the one thing that you guys really, really liked? We took that out because we knew it was causing so many bugs. And instead of fixing it, we were just like, "Fuck it." We said, "Eh, you guys will like them." <laughs> well, we'll add it back in later. Probably like, through well, DLC. And you know the, how the loot is kind of scarce? We made it even more scarce to where you have to actually hunt for your food now. They said to take the loot out of the game. <laughs> <laughs> so now if you want something <laughs> good fucking luck everything must be crafted from sticks mm. we've removed all trees <laughs> <laughs> you must grab twigs stick ten of them together to make a stick ten sticks to make another larger stick it's not your larger stick and then you can build 983 sticks and you can build a log it's like, it takes 18,000 like, sticks to build a fire. How much do I need? Mm -hmm. 300. Like, what? For that wall? What? what? Yeah, it's like, what? Why do I need 300 pieces of wood? I can't even hold 300 pieces of wood. It'll take that's, you 18 hours like, to build like, the shed in 30 seconds to there are seven. There are seven logs on this fucking wall. Why did it take 300? <laughs> all right, are we all done? Ready? Hmm? Yes. Here's some Rancor oh, lore for you. So, Patisa. Yeah, sorry, we're going to blow up. Do you know that Patisa is uh, the hut word for friend? <laughs> He's moving away. <laughs> so Patisa is hut for friend. It was a male Rancor and was given to uh, Jabba on his birthday by his major domo, oh. Bill Fortuna. Now you understand why he was so pissed? <laughs> I mean, if listen, if if you killed my dog, I'd be pissed. Well, now, is there a way to save me the Aurora from blowing up? Expect your no, dog to kill it always up. It yeah, has to no blow escape. up. There's no escape. Can never leave. Always there. Yeah, it has to blow up. You can save the Sunbeam, though. Yeah. But you have to rush that, don't you? Yeah, you have to rush it very quick. Just, like, disable the tower? Mm -hmm. have the mods. But in order to disable the tower, you have to go like all the way to the deep, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you have to go down like a thousand feet. You have to like speed run it. Mm. You, have to, those, like, the... you have to be very quick on it. Better have the big ass submarine. Yeah, you need the big ass sub in order to really get anywhere. And the uh, prawn too. And the prawn yeah. as well. Prawn is the prawn is pretty cool. It's good. I like the prawn. Prawn is love. Prawn is yeah, because Seamoth can't go deep enough. Are we missing anyone? I don't think so. No. All right, you want to start back up? Yeah, let's start back up. This applies. 
So confirm okay. their rancors. Confirmed possible rancors. <laughs> Rancor in space. <laughs> Thanks for giving me an idea. Dark side point. You know, I think that's 20 damage in one hit. <laughs> I just pictured a rancor with a space helmet on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what were the tentacle creatures, though, in uh, Force Awakens? Uh, I can't uh, remember their names. Those would be fun, too, though. No, it wasn't Dagobah, it was... I'm looking. The Rathtar? Yeah. It was, it was something else. Rathtars. Something like that. Something like that. But yeah, so it's like that small tentacle eye and the mm -hmm. big ass tentacles. It's like it's like the uh, Star Wars beholder. Yeah. Yeah. Except not nearly as it. Yeah, nearly as it. <laughs> yeah, it was a uh, Rathtar. You're not hauling Rathtars on this freighter, are you? I'm hauling Rathtars. Yeah. Or it could be those giant space worms that live in the asteroids. Oh god. <laughs> can we fit one of those on a ship? <laughs> what are those going for? <laughs> If we get the class B, can we fit in on there? Nah. If we get Stop an Imperial off. Star Destroyer, can we fit it on there? Well, the class B is the biggest. I'm not sure, I'm not sure the size difference between those two. I couldn't know. The class B has the largest uh, cargo space encumbrance, I guess. Uh, is the Executor class B? Yes. Can we just get Snoke ship and call it good? Jesus Christ. Don't, Sounds don't good. Ship, sorry. Does it come with Snoke? No, he's dead. Can we? Well, Snoke's Snoke's reincarnation does it come Who with our fuck is Snoke. I keep finding Smoke. <laughs> can we find? Can we find a? Can we find a ship that has smog on it? Either you start fucking speaking English, or I'm gonna fucking. Like, start you haven't seen the newest Star Wars movie? No. Oh my god, bro! I've watched the original <laughs> seven, and that was it. Oh my god. The original seven. seven. Bro, at least original those, those are the only movies the I have watched. I've watched original seven. Original, original seven. Number eight is not original, guys. <laughs> what is the original no, I've only ten. watched the first, the four, the four, then the prequel. So. The four and then the prequel. Yeah, there was, there's four three and three, dog. So yeah, yeah, but then four seven and three. came out before four. <laughs> yep, that's how up to them, Star Wars lore, am. Or idea. seven <laughs> came out before 3.5. And you were the GM. Yeah, it's Star, right. Wars. Yeah, it's Star Wars. Yeah. You can just make shit up and just assign a planet, dude, and you're good. True. <laughs> like guiding a missile down a super tiny vent Look. that has zero obstructions in it. There's a small flaw in the design, okay? There is a flying octopus that holds eight blaster rifles. <laughs> Follow right. General Kenobi. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Do it. I, I don't right, know if I guys. can keep playing this if he, think, if he thought there were four original movies. Might have to quit. Sorry. That is, uh, that I, I couldn't tilting. even... What is what? Turn of the Jedi. Jedi Strikes Back. <laughs> what? <laughs> and, uh... Return of the... <laughs> I don't fucking... Jedi know. Strikes Back. <laughs> the last <laughs> Jedi. Literally, the last uh, time I saw those movies was probably, like, five years ago. Like, any of those Star Wars movies. So. Clone Wars. <laughs> now, this the is Clone Wars, the cartoon ben Clone Zed. Wars. <laughs> New Hope. Empire Strikes Back. Empire. Return of the Jedi, Force Awakens, The Last Jedi. They're actually making a Star Wars story Ben Kenobi movie. And a Solo, solo. movie too. Solo. Yeah, right. Solo's supposed to be shit though. Well, because no one cares. Okay. To choke, uh, I'm still not exactly sure how I got to GMing EOTE, but sure. So <laughs> kind of time, let's go. Let's go. Alright. So as the uh, Starlands fade back to real space, uh, the sensor systems immediately go haywire, flashing lights and sounding a malfunction alarm. A quick glance so the system is jammed or overwhelmed. Looking outside, you see what assumed to be the Chol star system as a dim, yeah, the Chol system star as a dim hazy disk. You can't make out any other stars, and you don't see immediately, don't immediately see Cholgana or anything else. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, oh, time to go back. <laughs> yeah, sensors seem to be overloaded. Can we fix the ship? Yeah, you can attempt to fix the attempt to fix the sensors. Uh, I'll fix the ship. God. Uh, Ayala, do you see anything? Let's see. Do I see, see. anything? Yeah, what if you look I... outside, you see a red haze. What do I need to fix the ship? Uh, computers. Okay. I'll head back up to the uh, gunner's turret. Do you have it set up? Yep. My god. Oh. Yeah, so as you look up and out through the gunner's seat, 
The only thing you see around you is just a large red haze. Like, doesn't seem to be anything else visible. Hey, Captain, did you uh, land us in a nebula or something? Boom, science. Uh, do what I know if there is a nebula nearby? Um, yeah, you could roll me a... Let's see. If it's anything Outer to do... Worlds, I believe? Yeah, I'm about to fuck this shit up. I'm about to fuck this shit up. Still four? <laughs> Holy shit! I know nothing, Jon Snow! This is an uncharted system, so... Hey, uh, hey, Chief, remember that time that I just walked up and, like, punched the computer and it fixed the ship? I'm gonna try that again. You want me to punch the computer? Okay. I... Yeah, as you walk up into the cockpit area, you look outside the windows, it's just a bunch of red haze everywhere. Uh, I would like to attempt to fix the sensors. Okay. Go ahead and roll me. Well, did I completely Fuck. fail? Um, <laughs> well, what kind I'm of might... I'll give hey, a shrug and walk me. away. Look at me, I'm IG. Woo! Oh. Can I roll for anything to f try to figure out what this red haze is? I was gonna say, I'm just waiting for my chance to. <laughs> yeah. IG what is this, Outer Rim? Yes, yeah, it's Outer Rim. Can we just all roll Outer Rim? Oh, I'm uh, good at Outer Rim. Like, yeah, uh, when do you already rolled for it, so they can't, that person can't roll again. Okay, yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, if you haven't rolled for it, you can't roll again. Success for me. Do you have it set up? Nope. Damn. I'm you can't smart. Really get right now. <laughs> hey, oh, you take two strain. Or is Ziana? That's all right. Strain. I'll take my strain. Damn it. Yeah. You recall. You vaguely recall as you struggle to remember, and your brain slightly hurts. As uh, you remember hearing stories that the Trogana system has a large uh, gas nebula as part of the system itself that kind of rotates around the the star, and it covers about two thirds of the system. And you guys seem to kind of be in it. Seem to kind of be in it. <laughs> you are in it. We're in the nebula. Yeah. I'm gonna ask Jeeves um, if his astromech droid can help fix up. the There computers. is a thump on the hole as well. Hmm. Oh shit! Shit! Bang. Wait, a... are they the giant sea pancake things? <laughs> are they... uh, hey Ella, give me a piloting check. <laughs> is it a race core? <laughs> is it a race core? Space no, there, I, I remember seeing this. There, there are actually like space sea pancakes that live in nebulas. <laughs> no. As you quickly look out the For window, sure. a large yeah. asteroid seems to be flying straight at the ship. Shit, you... no. Yeah. Like someone get on the guns. Large I, actually, here. yeah, I can blast it, but if it, Nebula's gas, so... Oh, no, yeah. No, no, so Let's you... See. so uh, it, How do you wish to spend your triumph? Nebula's are plasmic gas. What can gas. I do with my triumph on this, right? I'm not nebulas sure. Are, um, yeah. No, nebulas are plasmic gas. You're fail. not shooting plasma, you're shooting photons. Um, so you, you can quickly dodge out of the way. Yeah, 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 that's what I'm doing, yeah. Please do that. Yeah, because it's essentially just three success, so I'm going to count as three so you can successfully dodge as a large uh, uh, asteroid, just meteorized boulder of rocks, quickly, as you quickly dip in underneath it, as you quickly dodge other way. It seems to be more in the area as well. As you hear it, it's smaller thumps along the hole of the ship. We've got, we've right. got to fix the computers. Uh, geez, can you get the astromech droid to help? Yeah, I'll go plug into the astromech. I was gonna say I'm about to do what uh, fucking Zeon did. See if that works. Just smack it really hard. Oh, why, why the hell am I in the cockpit? Nope. Well, well. Do what about it? Okay. Nope. <laughs> that that is isn't four. That's a lot of strength. What are we? Yeah, it's what just are a, we rolling? It's just a fail. Boom. Oh, you have to roll. I was doing the astro mech. Tell me before you roll. <laughs> well, I that said you I have it set. set. It up. Okay. Hey, it's success. Yay! My God. <laughs> I'm gonna pet it on the head. Yeah, so yeah, you take one strain. As you quickly Ooh. pushing buttons and not hitting the correct ones as you try to compensate for this large gas cloud. Because the sensors just can't handle it at the moment. As the little astromech droid just kind of like spins up from the west. This little astromech droid like runs up in the cockpit, just plugs himself in and like, turn to the left, turn to the right, another turn to the right. And the sensors seem to come back online as he compensates for the gas cloud. Huh. Well, shit knows what he's doing. Do you ever wonder why every ship and building is in the galaxy is compatible with an R2 unit? There's another rock coming at you, though. What do you do? Yeah, I'm gonna shoot it. Shoot it. Shoot no. it. <sighs> it's Try dodging again. He can just okay. dodge Give me away. another piloting check. Hey, he's just quick. Wow. Quickly duck out of the way, quick thanks mess. to the... Thanks to the sensors. Can I get rid of, of some of my stress there? 
Uh, only in combat you can. You. I tried. Yeah. Now let's take a rest. Only in combat will happen. Well, you can be able to spend advantage for something. So are we yeah, out of the nebula? I was going to say, I'll pass the advantage the, 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 the nebula, but the, uh, if you need to still be in the nebula, you quickly duck out of the way of this large rock. But the sensors kind of ping, ping towards the planet air, planet S area is the best they can. Just just bring us down, Captain. Wait, are we going on the planet or are we looking for the ship? I thought yeah, the it's ping the general be. location of where the planet is, because you guys can't see it. But the sensors are struggling to try to, to actually get a lock on it as well. Right. I didn't think we were landing on the planet. I thought we were looking oh, for... Oh, uh, is it not on the planet? It's just I was going to say, planet. I'll bring us into the, atmosphere, or into yeah, the can... atmosphere of the planet to try and see if our sensors will acclimate yeah, the there better. Is, the planet is outside the, sun, the cloud. It's just pinging you, this is the direction of the planet, because you are still in the cloud. Okay. So hopefully if you go this way, you can get out of the cloud and see the planet. That's actually what's telling you. Do it. Yeah, I'm going to try and bring us in and just hover a lot in the atmosphere, see if yeah, our can pick anything up from there. Kind of like enter orbit around the planet. Yeah. You bring it into ship to do. Yeah. So as you quickly kind of it's like scurry off towards the direction the sensors are pinging you, um, the, the, the red haze seems to start lighting up. It starts to get lighter and lighter. More and more, it seems to fade away as you eventually uh, come out of the glass cloud itself, or the nebula cloud itself, and you see open space in front of you, and there's the planet. There any sign it of is, uh, it's a nice blue and green-ish planet. Uh, you can definitely see some clouds on it as well. It definitely seems habitable. Uh, does anybody see this? I'm going to ship. set our, shan- our scanners to start searching for ships in the area. Okay. Yeah. Right, it'll take you a long time to scan the whole planet. Uh, well, I was more trying to check the area around as we're flying around it more. Oh, you just want to check the area The ship's on the planet? No. I thought it was Inside... Inside... Yeah, just give me... Okay. Who wants to scan? Just use the scanner. Use the sensor to scan. Just whoever wants to do it. I was say you're going to do it. Yeah. Gonna do it all what, am I, what are you rolling for that? Uh, computers. Probably computers. Yeah. I'm probably not the best. Can I, do, at it, but I can already I do said I So should I do it? Um, you can't see. You won't be able to physically see it. Damn it. <laughs> I'll roll computers. Sure. Why not? Yeah. So you want to yeah. be the co-pilot in your uh, scan? Oh no, then I'm not co-pilot. I'm in the gunner seat. Right. Can I stay yeah, at the table pilot. and activate the scanners? Uh, sure. I think because yes. you can plug into the system, the ship system. Because I'm sure. a robot. Give me a computers. Hey, as you're scanning throughout the space to see if you can find any hint of where the Charlinar was supposed to be, um, so you're just following down along the trail, and it seems to kind of end in space near the planet, and there seems to be a small debris field around uh, where it, the last known location of it was. Debris? Um, I'll, ra- I'll radio to Jeeves. Do you still have the frequency that the 3PO unit used? Yes. Is there a way that you could ping off of that and see where it is? Three that PO would, units? but no, because Donkey said we would get here. Right, before. you would get here faster I, than the, the. I'm wondering if they are here now. So though. can I do a deep space scan? Because I know where the route is. Uh, sure. Give me another computer check. Oh shit! Cool. Uh, no, you can't seem to find any hint of location of the C3PO in it. Nothing seems to be in space nearby. Well, they probably got here super early because we came straight here instead of using the. Yeah, route. you either de- determine either you got here first or it's just not here yet. Okay. Could be hidden. You can find it, but more likely it's not here yet. So, we. I was going to say, are you, did you uh, relay that info? All right. Let's go say, check out no this debris field then. No other robots. There's me and IG. Okay. So you guys let's go and start to investigate the debris field? Yep. Yeah, it seems to be a debris field. There's a... It seems to be a lot of uh, metal and stuff. Like, uh, you determine, you see, like, parts of, like, one like, one of the parts, you see, like, a cockpit. Like, maybe a smaller ship. Uh, give me a perception check, yeah, whoever's looking. I guess the arrow. Oh, that's the actual looking, not the scanner. Okay. Yeah, because you're looking at the debris field. I don't see shit. My perception Wait, is where are shit. We, are we looking from the cockpit? Yeah, Zeon, since Zeon, you're... Where are you in the ship? 
I'm near the cockpit because I was pushing do the I, yeah, You have to be visibly looking outside. So Can I do that? Yeah, that was a perfect roll on my end. Just horrible greens. You're me to roll this shit perception? We all have shit perception. Did I find a thing? <laughs> I got a success. No, because you're not you're looking, not looking out the window. Well, I'm using the, the, the cameras on the outside of the ship to look. Because my <laughs> eyes are just cameras anyways. Is there cameras on the outside of the ship? There are. There would have to be. Or there's at least uh, external sensors on the outside of the ship. There'd be sensors, not cameras. Uh, what if we... What did the sensors pick up? What would sensors pick up? Um, sensors pick up... Um, a bunch of debris. Very, yeah, a bunch of debris. It seems to be like very cold. Like this has been sitting here for quite some time. As well. Okay. What if so we send outside. out a distress signal? Yeah, so you guys look outside on the ship. Uh, it seems to be just large... Like, like some of them are like large chunks of metal, chunks. Occasionally, you'll see like uh, appears to be kind of like weapon warheads or like parts of uh, like a wing, maybe. Can I do some kind of history check to see what kind of era it is? Era, era, yeah. Um, uh, he's looking for that Clone Wars me... ship. Sh- fuck yeah, dude! That shit goes for a he's lot looking... of money. He's okay, looking for that arc ship. Lord. Look, he's looking for Commander oh, Cody's ship. arc ship. I should like, keep somebody's thing up just so I can do Anything Clone suits. Wars. Like, Clone War armor as well. Oh my god, that stuff is amazing. Are there any clones out there? Can we resuscitate them and use them? It was a... Knowledge. Um, was it a Confederacy ship? Give me a knowledge warfare. Ooh. Uh, warfare? I feel That's like fancy. I should have this as a career. Do you have any... Would you have any bonuses to like that? Like, well, here's the thing, because... Background like, or... Right, my background would say... Or... I'm not entirely sure because I was a hired gun. I'm a merc soldier. Yeah, you get a boost die. Okay, that's good. You have a boost die for that. Damn. So you, you're that's... familiar. You're more familiar with like the modern technologies and things, but it gives you a more of an edge to point out, like, hey, that looks that's not modern at all. Ooh. Oh, man. Wait, why do I have two boosts? I don't know, but fuck it. Doesn't okay, matter. fuck it. Doesn't matter. Either either way, I take one as a way you get success. Oh, so. yeah. remember last time the game was adding on blacks to combat for some reason. Yeah, it might just yeah. So you can definitely things. tell this seems to be like an older model fighter. Um, what kind of era? Like probably a good. Uh, Which one of the time? original seven, Donkey? <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, I let everyone know that. Just, just throwing that out there. <laughs> that what? <laughs> I threw that into general right. so everyone could see that. That Donkey <laughs> said there's an original <laughs> seven. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm gonna join attack the Wookiee sound. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, it's definitely an older model fighter. Probably. Uh, fuck. I think it was headhunters back then. Uh, sorry. Say that again. Um. I trying to remember what the ships were called. I think they're called the headhunters. C ninety one head under I think. Ooh, how, I don't how remember what their exactly the name is, but it's definitely like that kind of era, like definitely the era of when the Charlinar would have existed. More towards like the end of the uh, CIS and uh, was it still the Republic then? Yeah, uh, years before the invasion of Naboo. So this is even wow yeah. holy shit yeah this is like more towards like the end of when the clone wars because this is a cis vessel that was yeah, what this is this is before... years old. how broken is it oh it's in, it's in pieces this is even before like clone wars no it's more towards the end of the clone wars yeah, i was gonna say this was a separatist ship yeah this was a separatist ship. oh okay yeah, yeah. The, so it's, it's a separatist a it was era. a separate it was rumored to be a separatist treasure ship from one of the more outer from one of the colonies from them and do you guys attempt to track um, it down to see if he can loot wow. or restore his treasure? Because no one's have ever has ever found it. Yes. Yes. So that's what you're hired to do is find this thing. Right. It's got treasure. But these are the hand hunter ship. They're not. Yeah, these the, are uh, like the fighters esque of that era. So these are the like the escorts. Yeah. They wouldn't be the escorts. Because CIS would have droid ship escorts. Uh, yeah, droid fighter escorts. Right. Cool. So these are the people that were trying to find it. That yeah, so this is probably oh, okay. that this would be people that either attacked it's it on the planet. Yeah, you probably on, probably more than likely the attacked ships it. on the planet. The ships on the planet it crash landed had to have. Um, 
off of that roll, since I see, I know that, like, can I see anything of particular importance that was that would be of cash value? Of cash value? Something. Um, yeah, sure. Give me a perception check. Again, <laughs> another perception. See if you, can, yeah, because see if you can just find anything that could like intact. Is what yeah. this do it. Nice. Do good. Do good. I don't see anything because I'm Jon Snow. So. I oh you wow! Did. You see nothing. What a roll! Yeah, see it all seems to have been like destroyed. Most of it, like it's in too small. The pieces are just too old at this point that it's not of any value. You like, oh, relayed that like... information about the that they were the, like the not the escorts, but someone that probably attacked her, right? Uh, yes. Yeah, sorry. I was gonna say at that point, now Yala would come over. It's like it has to be on the planet, then it has to have crash landed. Yeah, because definitely not enough debris here to signify like a larger ship explosion or detonation of its core. It's definitely not enough for that. It seems to be more of like fighters and larger pieces, like something got shredded off than anything else. I would agree then. Let's go to the planet. Okay. You guys want to try to scan the, see if you can find it on the planet? Let's do it. Scanners activate. So for roll computers again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> can I, I roll the comic? Can I roll mechanics and boost someone using the scanner? Like, I could boost maybe the scanner's range, or just signal period. Okay. So who is looking specifically, just, like, are you guys looking with the scanners on the planet? Or are you just, like... I was gonna say, like, one of us is probably gonna start here. looking, I'm probably gonna look, I'm probably gonna use the scanner, and I think, uh, Jera, since he's on the gun, would probably, you know... I can do the scan thing in my jigs. Well, I think you'd probably actually passively be looking... I'm giving you another perception check. All right. <laughs> um. Actually, give me a survival check. Uh, to see if you can determine like what path, uh, Jera. Like what path, like or Jera or Yala, one of you, both, both of you, if you wish. Like oh, what man. path, like a crashing ship from this position would most likely land. As a merc soldier, would I get a boost die? Uh, yeah, I can add a boost die to yours. Then when he's done with that, I'm gonna use the scanners. His background is crash test dummy. He gets 19 Damn straight. Yeah, it's like you can't Damn. tell too much. Like, there's just not enough debris to hollow it down towards the planet. But how would you trace it down to the planet? Because you don't know how many rotations have been. Okay. Well, it's more not... of like the what uh, <laughs> launch it. it would kind of land on as it rotates. So that'd be like the best spot to just scan the planet on instead of having to scan the entire planet. Can I take a look at the scanner? Uh, sure, you guys will look through the. Com you have the roll of computers for it. Can I can I use mechanics to boost though? Okay, you already rolled it. Who was a three? Well, that was me. Oh, can yeah, I use mechanics to boost the signal of the scanner to give him bonus when he? Um, sure. Give me a mechanics check to give a boost die to the person that scans. Da, yeah, da, da, da. you just have to manage to power up the scanners a little bit more. <laughs> Maybe like direct some juice from the shields into the the scanners themselves. This would be sensors themselves. computers more than survival then. Um, he was trying to determine the path it would take down. If you're just actively yeah. scanning through it, yeah, no, I, I want to try to determine the path. Okay, I'm gonna try to determine the path. Yeah. Uh, I made that a three per. Yeah, so just give me a survival then. Do I get a boost? Uh, why would I you get boosted a boost? the scanner? Can I you use you the scanner to check that? To if you're gonna use the scanners, you gotta roll computer. Gotta roll computers. Oh. Well, if you're trying to determine the path it would have crashed on, survival with yeah, no boost. Yeah, survival. Let's go. Hey. Do, 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 yeah. do. Um, based on like the debris fields of like where it's located, and based on like how the planet's spinning, you could probably determine that it's probably uh, you can probably narrow it down to maybe like a uh, small section of the planet as it rotates. So you manage to narrow it down to like the longitude style. You still have right. to narrow, narrow it down to like the latitude. Do you mean you guys no. can probably sit there for like an hour just as you slowly rotate across the planet, scanning it along that section? They would have narrowed it down to latitude. Longitude is up and down. Yeah, that's I'm trying to remember which one. Yeah, latitude. Can I make it's another actually... survival check to try to speed it up with the longitude? See, I'll probably bring us into the atmosphere at that point. Just kind um, of... It'd be much harder to do that because of how the planet's spinning. If you wish to try right. to try it again. And if it's an un if it's kind of an unknown planet, there wouldn't be. I mean, uh, I'll go ahead and just try it while we're do. like while we're coming down to see if it helps. It doesn't matter. Yeah, try to survive again. 
No. <laughs> Donkey said nope. <laughs> Alright, I'm doing another survival. You try to survival as well? I'm gonna do it. Okay. Yeah, as Ayala slowly starts to pilot the ship back to slowly slowly rotates the ship around the planet. Uh, do you enter the atmosphere or do you stay outside the atmosphere, Ayala? Say it one more time. Do you it's enter the atmosphere like or do you stay outside <laughs> the atmosphere? I was gonna enter the atmosphere. <laughs> gonna enter the atmosphere? I see and know nothing. Yeah. Uh, inside your inside your uh, <laughs> gunner seat, um, as Ayala slowly starts to bring the ship back into the atmosphere, you slip. Uh -huh. Do I fire? Do I fire? Uh, no, you slip and you land. You hit your head on the bulkhead as you slam down on the ground. Damn. Uh, you take three points of damage of wounds. <laughs> you cut your uh, head wait, open so, bad. Uh, so great. <laughs> All right, come um, here. Let me do medicines on you. No, this is straight to you. This I is know. on your head. Let me lay hands on you, my son. Can I get? Yeah, it's not like you're. Like, are you wearing a helmet? Am I wearing a helmet? Yeah. Um, or any kind of head padding or anything? No, I don't think I. Three yeah, psychic take damage you straight to you. He takes three straight uh, wounds. You'll hear a loud "fuck" throughout the entire ship. Can I go do? Slam down. Can I do medicines on him? <laughs> Yeah, you want to go and try to bandage him up? Yeah, I'll try and at least <laughs> stitch, put some stitches or something. Be right back, Beth. You tell me it's, it's probably just a quick bandage. Uh, yeah, roll me medicine. Boom! Hey, oh, you can heal three HP, Jero. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, as he quickly slabs, like slaps on a, well, kind of like an alloy, yeah, futuristic stem bandage, whatever you want to call this. I don't remember. Alpha Joe. Yeah, I don't remember what it would be. Uh, I think it's like ice we, impact, but... Do I still have half a pig person of meat in the fridge? Oh, uh, no, you lost that. Oh, Did that's we, right, yeah. You, you sold you off can... half of it, and then when you tried to sell off the other half, uh, you got ambushed <laughs> by stormtroopers. No, I thought it was after the stormtroopers. No. You took half, someone else took half. Oh, uh, that's right. Their half, and, or they sold their half for the... Hyper matter, hyperspace reactor igniter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that was IG. Yeah, and then you got shot by stormtroopers. You tried to go and sell the other half off and lost it. Oh, yeah. All right. With what next? People. Okay, yeah, so you guys are in the atmosphere slowly going around the planet. Uh, you guys just circle around for a while. Uh, who's looking out the windows? Once or who's using I, scanners? I would be looking, looking out the, out the window. window at this time. Uh, you know, they're all me, perception windows. or computers, depending on what you're using. Computers for scanners are perception just to look out. If I use the scanner, can I have the bonus I die boosted it for that no one? Yeah, if you're using the scanners, you can add a boost die. You good for roll? Okay, I'm adding a boost die since yep. no one... So everyone, everyone who's actively looking can roll. Boom. Uh, nice boost die there, Jake. Yeah, Yeah. well, I mean, I, use, I thought someone... Yeah, so as, uh, Look at that. Yeah, <laughs> finally see Zeon, something. Yeah, Zeon and Ayala, you're too busy looking out the windows, like, maybe you're, like, Green. looking in the wrong direction. Like, you're looking off to the right, Zeon's looking off to the left. Uh, Jared, you actually look ahead, and, geez, you're also detect a signal of some kind of large metal object. Mm -hmm. beep, beep. On the ground or in the atmosphere? On the ground. All right, all right. Uh, do I have, like, a relative location? Or actually, you know, I'll just point it out. I'll say, hey, look at this certain direction. I just pictured you just firing the gun. Look there! <laughs> yeah, so more towards the southern end of the map, uh, you can you detect that's where a possible location of a large metallic object can be as well. Like, there seems to be something glinting off the sun, like something like glinting off the uh, some kind of metal, metal, metallic object. Jeeves, you're kind of detecting this large source, like large chunk of like more modern metals. Or not modern, but... Like more like like not natural metals. I'll patch it into like, no, the cockpit. Like nice steel, but like it's gonna be like plastic steel. Hey stuff. captain, I kind of see something over there in that certain direction that I am, I say is perfect, and you know exactly where I'm saying. <laughs> you're I'm pointing from direction. way up here. <laughs> I'm pointing. Yeah. You see my finger. Well, I sent I sent the ping into the cockpit. There you go. There so. You go. That might make it a lot okay. easier. Okay, I'm gonna head that direction. Bank. Map part two. What do I need for yeah, part three? Part um, yeah, I'm out of you. As you quickly, these guys fly over. He seems to be like aft section of the ship as well. 
I can pick a large aft section of a ship down okay. below. Engine sector of the Sonalar. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah. I'm going to kind of yeah, fly over and can... just kind of try and see if I can see any like weird growth in the trees that might represent something hitting them and then you know breaking and then having to find a new one. So you're trying to, to find the landing area? Not a good, no, not like a landing area. Just kind of try and see if I can notice anywhere in the trees where like a tree is shorter than a different one where something might have hit it and broken it. Like um, or some shit. Maybe like a new river or a pond that's close by. No, everything seems to be more natural. Right. Maybe it's the passage of time that's eventually regrown these trees. So nothing seems to directly stand out when you're looking around. Like he knows a couple of like, gaps like in the tree line or the tree section so you can probably put the ship down there as well if you guys want to disembark to investigate but hey, it seems, doesn't seem to be any nearby landing locations like it's gonna take you maybe an hour or two to get there jeez will Don't. you run diagnost diagnostics on um atmosphere uh yes i can do that um hey donkey where's the where's the fuel on the ship page i mean it's in the book but there's nothing on the ship page um i don't know either i'll just put it in the whole sheet let's make a note somewhere yeah i'll put it in the ship hold Okay. Uh, what do you want me to do for diagnostics for computers? To try to scan the, uh... The See if there's an atmosphere for the flesh bags, yeah. Sure. Give me a computer check. <laughs> it's breathable! <laughs> yeah, you can probably determine it's more than likely unbreathable. Like, nothing's... Probably nothing harmful out there. Maybe. <laughs> You're not exactly certain. There's a spacesuit on the ship, right? I'll tell him it's perfectly what? breathable. So is there a spacesuit on the ship that actually came with the ship? Um, no, I'm not sure. More than likely, there'd probably be one. Six or... Maybe one or two. Good night. Yeah. Just probably a breathable atmosphere. Cool cap. Can we send Dwes out? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dwes is too busy tinkering, like, with some tools. Maybe try to eventually. Probably take it using his hand scanner. Wait, yeah. wouldn't I just be probably, able to go out and yeah, find anyone out? Anyone else can grab the hand scanner if you wish. Like, no. there's one. I think someone else has one. And there's one on the ship. Well, wouldn't it be? Wouldn't I? Wouldn't I be able to better detect if it's breathable if I just went out? Yeah, because it'd be easier to scan in person. Than... Yeah, you let the air into the ship though. Well, no, it's airlock. Yeah, you want to use airlock? Okay. Yeah, I'll use the airlock. What did you think <laughs> I was gonna do? Open a window? Because <laughs> well, there's the cargo bay on the the front. And the two side oh, no, entrances use... are more for space. More for I'm space talking than anything else. I use an airlock. <laughs> Alright, so you're gonna shut down, shut down, shut one of the doors as you enter in, then open the other one, appear outside? Yeah. You're probably a good five to six, like seven feet off the ground as well. That's, so, that's fun. I'm not gonna jump. Yeah, you open the door, there's a rush of air coming in to the ship. Or the, your small little airlock section as you appear outside. Uh, <laughs> lots of greenery and everything. What would I roll for? Do you have just a hand scanner? Yeah. Yeah, so you pull your hand scanner out and actually start to sample the air. Yeah, it's definitely got a nice uh, breathable atmosphere for most, for pretty much every flesh bag. Fucking flesh bag. Yeah. So not, nothing toxic that stands out. Maybe if you, like when you know, ate a fungus, that probably get you sick, but nothing Unless... in the air seems to be poisonous or toxic in any way. Unless they over the comments. It is very hot. Good. It is quite hot, though. Wait, like how hot? Like, mm, I need to go like... get some liquid cooling hot, or...? No, like, it's definitely, like, on the hotter, like, definitely feel like more like a tropics. Oh. Than anything else, like, that yeah, tropical temperature. <laughs> okay, Less I'll send... <laughs> I'll, I'll send it over the comms, and... Alright, perfect. Let the flesh bags know. Then let's land this beast and make our way. Yes, please land before we use more fuel. Oh, this yeah, is an uninhabited still. planet, right? That yeah. we know of. Oh, yeah, geez, yeah, you're like, like what, a couple hundred feet in the air? You appear outside the out, out there, lock. You said seven. I thought you guys landed. We were landing. I thought you went to start landing, so we were probably in the middle of landing. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, but I'm holding. Grab a, grab a handhold and poke your scanner out the door or the, out, yeah. out the airlock. Yeah. As we're as we're landing, I'm gonna ask if we want someone to get directly onto the ship before we bring our ship down, or if we want to just go on foot. I can do it. Because I have a grappling hook. Oh. Do we want to like, step, someone scout ahead, or...? 
I'd prefer not, because if those other people that are on their way here find the ship and do that too, that person probably won't live. Um, I'm. Are we looking to hide the ship? Probably a smart idea. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna look around on the ship if we have any like tarps. Do you like camo tar- camo tarps? For the ship have, this size, you guys have any in your hold? No, so that actually. Well, no, you never really gave us the full biggest. list of no. what's in our hold. Oh yeah, there was some. There's some stuff on the ship. I don't think anything like that. Yeah, so I know it came with, with I think two med kits, a uh, hand scanner, the droid parts, a couple of reels, a couple of stem packs. I'm gonna ask you if Jeeves can kind of like mask our scanner or, something, or mask our ship somehow from scanners. Like if you if you put the ship like in, there's like a, you you spot a section of like the tree line break. If you manage to get your ship like somewhat like half underneath a couple of like lo- looming trees, Ayala, you can probably at least cover half the ship. I'm gonna so try that and also still see if Jeeves can. Make it so scanners will be harder to pick us up as well. I, uh, give me a piloting check. Piloting planetary. All right. Let's do this. You ready? Yeah. Damn, I thought we had one more light side die and I was going to use it. <laughs> we do. No, I you thought we had one. two. No, no, you have one. Yeah, so you managed to uh, effortlessly guide the ship so it's like half of the ship is pretty much covered, or maybe three. <laughs> Like three quarters of the ship is covered by some overhanging trees. The murder bot has arrived. Just time to die. Yeah. Perfect. I know I saw that in a movie. I just can't remember which movie it was where something like that happened. San Andreas. There we go. People watched that movie? <laughs> it was free on uh, HBO, so. But your time's not free. Not. Plus, the chicken, it's extremely hot. I was fine with it. Moving on. You also got The Rock, though. He's a very attractive man as well, so... Hi, Sakara. We're on an uninhabited planet because we are we found the ship. Oh, by we the have, way, we, we just... cannot go back to the wheel space. Yeah, no, we're the, now the wheels crossed off. Criminals. But the most important part about this entire thing is Don K thought there were four original Star Wars movies. <laughs> seven. Yeah. seven. He said seven. seven. Sorry, seven. Sakara. Yeah, seven of them. But he thought there was the three prequels and then four of the... Original. <laughs> Sakara, uh, what Reve- if I... Revenge of, or... <laughs> Revenge ah, yeah, of the Jedi. Star Wars. Yeah. Em- no, it was Empire or oh. Jedi Strikes Back. <laughs> let's let's, let's be real back. though. Let's be real. Empire Strikes Back. The Force Awakens was basically just a new, a new hope. hope. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Zakara. I'm gonna basically tell you the very beginning was we walked back into the Infotech thing, and Jesus like, hey, I'm gonna shoot my guns and roll a double despair. Yeah. yeah Ayala, Long story like, short, comment, Jeeves tried to shoot him. Uh, got double despair. We opted to keep the roll. <laughs> And uh, accidentally shot a sensor on the inside Isotech, and then shot the secretary as well. So we're not going back and there. She's dead. She's so, dead. So, so the secretary of secretary the to the guy who's paying Rom him is now dead. Is, yeah, his secretary. And dead. we did never found the robot. Well, we yeah, kind we of did, but we robot. kind of didn't. We know he's on his way here. But the good so news is, you. we found the son of Lore, and we are landing on Shogana. So what could go wrong? So now, will you please roll destiny, and then, uh, oh my God, I don't Donkey, roll will you one roll a one d one hundred thing again? Oh yeah, one d. I guess one d thirty. I was gonna say, Ooh. isn't it gonna be him anyway? One d one thirty. Um. Oh, wait, oh, yeah, oh, God. Or just, just how much yeah, he has? I forget. Hey, you take one strength. You have one strength. <sighs> Bye, G. You're the only right. one who does. That's fine. No one else has it. Just him. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so you lost the one from last time, but now you just gained one from this one. Because okay. you have a 35, and I rolled a 4. So yeah, like, as we're landing, I'm just gonna kind of like... I guess I'm still up in the cockpit area, right? Yeah. yeah. When I look so, over yeah. at Ayala, I'll be like, you don't think there's security on the ship, right? Like, battle droids or anything? It's pretty old. Well, if we get down there, then I can plug in and find out. I'm gonna say there probably is, but hopefully their power cells are out. I'll just so, give a shrug oh, and tap on my sword. Ship? Yeah, this is your ship. This is the Great Fang. So I can either use this one or I can use another, but no, I'm going to use this one instead. It's more clear. Your planet side. As soon as I you yeah. land, I... Yeah, so you manage when you land the ship, you manage to quickly duck it and cover it up. You cover about three quarters of the ship with like large overhanging trees on the planet as well. 
And then, like I said, as I'm going to pass, like, Jeeves or something, I'm going to ask if you can try and, or whichever IG or Jeeves, they can try and cover, like, have our scanners not be able to be detected or something close. That's a Jeeves. We have personal signal jammers, but I don't know if the ship has one. Not but fully jam, it just kind of make it a little bit more hidden. Yeah, so try to cover more of the ship up. Are you trying to, like, make it harder to be detected? Covered up or like, yeah, electronically like covered. Electronically make, covered. Yeah. Does um, have a do you have any jammers or anything? Me and IG have personal ones, but they're not that big. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think they're big enough to actually jam the sh- to jam mm-hmm. anything coming from ship. I just didn't know if they could do something with computers that could do that could jam it. Yeah, you have to describe how they would. If they're going to try. Have a signal go out that matches the trees. There we go. The trees would be... are, are emitting a signal. Jammer. Yeah. I don't... Fine. We could match the ship's cross. Like section with like general background bullshit. If yeah, we like if you on, got some, if we were on an, a habitable planet, there's no. nothing here emitting electronic signals in the background except us. Like so. if you shut down the ship completely and cover it up with like trees and like branches and stuff, you might be able to physically cover it, so you're no longer emitting electronic signal. But the ship's gonna take a while to power back up. Yeah, if I get where this is, go for it. Oh. Yeah. I mean, let's be serious. If they find us, we'll just kill them. Can we have the astromech droid and Dwes be ready to fire if we're fired? <laughs> yeah, you want them to kind of stay on board and man the guns? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, they can, they can stay on board and man the was guns. Was it Dwes that was building the astromech? He's yeah. built. He's built. He's ready to go. Good boy. Droid. It's your yep. boy. Okay. And he helped out with what? He helped out with the jump? Yep, here. he did. All right. Let's get rolling. Yeah. So you guys uh, disembark onto the ship. As you uh, exit the ship, the trees are very tall on this on this planet. They're easily like a good like hundred feet up in the air, and they're some of them are quite dense together. Some are more spread out. You, you're lucky you managed to actually find an area to put down the ship of this size. So it's like, Yavin, to... it's like Yavin four. Yeah. Um, do I hear like birds? Oh yeah, there's definitely animal sounds out okay. there as well. That's good. Um, yeah, so you guys just embarked the ship. Uh, they had some weird thing. Did we do oh, a yeah, that's what it was. Before we landed this thing to figure out if anything's gonna, like, come out of the jungle <laughs> and kill us? No. Yeah, sure, give me a perception check as you scan the tree lines. Can we all do this thing? Yeah, everyone can look. Oh, uh, by the way, I'm I rolled you an extra dog so far, so... My God! <laughs> I see I nothing. I don't think my perception's good. Oh, yeah, everyone could roll. Oh, there's well, a success. That bonus. Oh, it was blank though. So Thank so God I did. Fail, fail, fail. Success. Okay, is that everyone? I only put the one in the skill from like fucking character creation. Haven't touched it since. <laughs> <laughs> I put yeah. everything else into ranged heavy. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Did everyone roll? Oh, yeah, hey, as we're getting off the ship, I'm going to look over to IG, saying? and I'm going to tell him, uh, grab the disruptor rifle. Oh, oh, yeah! Ooh, yeah. yeah uh, give me a perception check as well, let's just scan the tree line. My... Because you haven't given me one. I'm going to carry... Hey, it's this. Probably want the uh, disruptor and some thermals for this. Do you want me to bring yeah. both or only one? I'm bringing the disruptor. I mean, do you want to leave them on the ship in case someone finds the ship? I'm bringing them both. <laughs> do I want to carry any more of my grenades? Yeah, because you can probably lock the ship up as well, like close all the hatches so nothing like native can really get on board. And then uh, Dues can probably man the guns since the reactor's still going to stay online. Who still has yeah. a stun grenade? I do. You do? Okay, good. Keep that. Um, I'm going to take my ion grenades as well. Okay. Donkey, I am walking around with my virus sword in hand. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Jera Zeon Jeeves, give me a resilience check. Uh, give me like life. two... Fucking hell. <laughs> I'm going to die today. Question, is this resilience what? check related to hot or air conditions? Uh, make your check and I'll tell you. Well, well if it because is, if, it is, oh, if it is, no. I get a setback die removed. No, it's not related to this. Oh, shit. Okay. There's just a car crash outside. Suck huh, a dick, Donkey. 
suck a dick, suck a dick, suck a mother mother of god, dick, suck, a dick, suck a motherfucking dick. <laughs> Jared's like, what the hell's going on? How is that? Five, all the success possible. Nothing is happening. Possible. There could have been one more success after. There's Jared's like, I think, going. I think I feel something. Maybe. Well, there, there's Maybe. either a bunch of stress getting handed out. Or yeah, there's a shit ton of. I'm taking four Ugh. stress for that shit. Or the yeah. threats mean something else because the threat isn't always stress. It yeah, it's not always stress. Too. Can I determine the threat to be? It's hilarious, though. Sometimes it's my, checked. Well, my what's the problem? Get drained. Because, like, I cause like I know, like, yeah, because like I know if um if you're buying something like on the black market, that's like, on the next you action you can provide like, a uh, setback, donkey. Yeah. Okay. What's so or two, two stress, or you could just drain my power pack with my <laughs> weapon. Nah, I think I need a spare for that. Yeah, or two. Uh, I need a spare for that. Uh, One thought... strain is stress. Uh, two strain would be like a yeah. setback die. Yeah, but you can use three of mine. <laughs> no, I specifically need a despair to drain it. The uh -oh. three can make you lay prone. I was just gonna. I, I have an extra power back on me. I was just gonna switch it out. <laughs> okay. Um, Jeeves, you take two strain. Uh, Zion, you take two strain. Um, Jira, you have a setback die to the next roll you, you make. All right. And take two strain as well. Okay. Yeah. Also, since who failed that? Jeeves, since Jeez. you failed it, you also have additional two setback dice to any checks you make. Oh, sweet lord. For the <laughs> entire time? This, yeah, you, yeah. Um, until you make another one. As you look outside, like this your is next definitely roll. not a planet you're used to being on. Like, you're definitely not designed to be on these kind of planets, these uninhabitable planets. Like, there's nothing around that's anything man-made. Everything's got sharp angle, or, like, rocks, trees are everywhere, grass is growing everywhere. Like, you, your robot chassis was not designed to maneuver on this kind of planet. What? I'm a gut. okay. I'm gonna... Mm. Yeah, you're an engineering droid. You weren't designed to be wandering the wilds. Sure, like you could be like on a more civilized planet with dirt roads and things like that. That's where you're used to being on, but not this kind of hostile environment. Wait, wait, wait! I have an idea. Uh, wait, how far away are we from the crash ship? No, I guess not. You're probably a good couple hour, miles. An hour. Yeah, probably like an hour's walk from where you guys okay. are. Um, one second. Wait, we're gonna go investigate a crash ship. Why are we doing this? Because it's got treasure, damn it. It's yeah, the treasure so the Charlinar, when you guys got to the Trogana system, there was a debris field up in orbit, mm -hmm. yeah, but there was no like large enough debris to signify like the, a larger ship being destroyed. Mm -hmm. There were like, smaller fighters debris, but you're able to trace it down to like, there was debris heading towards the planet as well. So oh. you probably surmise that it crashed, and you guys are searching for the remnants of it. See if are you there, can find anything. Are there any... Compressed? Are there any tanks of compressed gas on the ship? Is there? Well, that's I what I'm asking. I imagine no. there might be at least an oxygen tank or two. Yeah, you could probably grab an oxygen tank from like a spacesuit if you wish. Okay, I'm gonna grab an oxygen tank. Okay, because you said my resilience uh, failed due to the environment. Yeah. But I'm good with dirt roads, so I'm gonna take that oxygen tank, <laughs> and I'm gonna take my blowtorch. And I'm gonna make a flamethrower, and it's all gonna be dirt. Oh, the and whole path there, God, the whole path there. <laughs> there wouldn't be enough oxygen in the tank to do that. It's pure oxygen. I can make a really big fire. <sighs> and then the fire would also encompass the ship. What could go wrong? What? No, so look, not you land in any jungle. Burn. It's a controlled burn because the stuff is alive anyway, so it's got resilience to fire as it begins. But the grass and stuff on the ground. Okay, that's gonna take you an additional half an hour to get there if you wish to do that. Like slowly burn your way there. Deal. Does everyone want to agree with him? No. Can I just I hack mean, through the jungle with no. my sword? So yeah, IG's can you do that? like already yeah, like, like I mean IG's already like on the move. Like we have a <laughs> If <laughs> so... he does that, can I have one setback die? Because he's removing everything. Sure, if you hack your way through the jungle, you can get one setback die removed. So you have only one. Nice. I will I will hack away. Setback's only black, right? Yep, one yeah, black. Setback's a black. Oh, that's nothing. Please. You okay, how well, hard would it be for me to cut through to on the way to the, the ship green, with my Viber Sword, given how it's upgraded and stuff? How much to what? How hard would it be to actually cut through like the foliage on the way to the ship? 
given. Are you trying to cut through the trees or just like general bushes? Like and bushes and stuff like blocking a walking vines. path. Yeah, I'm not going to cut trees down and shit. Hey, yeah, we have that vibro. Yeah, you can easily, like, like your sword with this monomaker edge can easily cut like the smaller branches and vines that are on the area. They can pretty much clear like a path. Yeah, so you can, you can clear like a small path. It shouldn't, shouldn't take maybe like another 10 minutes to clear the path along the way. So maybe an hour, 10 minutes to get there. Can I keep the oxygen tank? Um, I'll have my pulse rifle drawn. Okay, you can keep your weapon drawn. Yeah, I almost want other weapons as well, or just nope. no. Keep I, the slug for our turn. IG's already scouting ahead. He's got the disruptor <laughs> rifle. I'm gonna okay. keep that oxygen tank. All right. Let's see if just map. Oh, this out of the way. Just uh, well, don't, 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 not moving that fast. So though. a uh, a vibro sword is essentially just a sword that has like a vibration generator attached to it, right? Have it like yeah. hum at a low frequency. It. Yeah, yeah no, it, it basically vibrates at a at a super high frequency that allows it to slip between atoms. It gotcha. basically, uh, yeah. Yeah. Jungle, yeah. Jungle, so you guys uh, occasionally come across a couple of, uh, metallic objects like wings, grates, plates, things like that. As you start to make your way towards the uh, engine section of the ship, given with my extensive knowledge of things, uh, do I see of anything of use or value? <laughs> um. Give me my extensive knowledge of things. Give me my extensive sure, knowledge. Give me a perception check. I'm all knowing. I, no, I would just <laughs> know these things. Oh, you just know these things? No. <laughs> He's all knowing. Okay, like if you were like a ship engineer, yeah, you would know these things. These, yeah, these seem to be like parts of a ship. Oh, hey. Most of them seem to be sh sheared off. Or okay, well, like I'm still going to roll for it. Do, do I see anything of value then? Because I'm a mechanic. Why is it that when I'm looking ship? for shit that I want to sell, I see things? Important, I don't see shit. <laughs> yeah, maybe you, you see like a couple of pieces that can be of value, but oh, they're not wait. a whole lot of value. Hold Most on. of it seems to be like I rusted lied. and. Give me a second. Sorry, I forgot to add the one thing. The one ring? The one. Boop. Are you invisible? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> well, that one will. Yeah, I'm going to cancel that. You didn't find You managed to find it. Like, what you do find is all rusted what? and... Uh, I got two success! I know, but it's four threat. So. Well, no, 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 take what out the other... What you do find... No, I, know, I, don't, I only have two threat. I know. Because okay. uh, those purples are... He, oh, those the black. Are on your so it's side, two don't yeah, it's two success two and success two threat. Two, yeah. Okay, you managed to find maybe a couple of pieces of metal. Most of it seems to be rusted and stuff. Like, maybe you can find, like, a power... Like, a, a power cell, maybe? Maybe a couple of uh, pieces, like maybe. Gonna be me. How many credits would I probably add up to? For what a power cell? No, nah, just general scrap metal. Yeah. Thirteen credits. Yeah, the most of what you find is rusted and stuff. You can maybe find like thirteen credits worth of uh, <laughs> uh, actual usable equipment. For how much? Credits? Yeah, thirteen yeah. credits of usable yeah. equipment. All right. <laughs> Yeah, the, the majority of what you're finding is old and rusted and burnt. Like, a lot of it has scorch marks. Our holes are just plain rust <laughs> since it's been here for so long now. Okay. Um, and there's nothing in this pile? Yeah, you can give me uh, another perception check. Okay, can I don't get my... Set I send out another time. IR burst to see if I can find that droid. Yeah, uh, Gallus will give me a computer's Jeeves. Uh, you had to... Yeah, uh, add an additional... <laughs> what is this game?! <laughs> Alright, now roll me computer's Jeeves. Okay. Uh, uh, do you want to take the computer. four stress? Oh! <laughs> I added... I have my setback die on there just for all my rolls. <laughs> but... No. No. Eh. Okay. Oh, I got take one strain, Jeeves. Since apparently okay. he added setback as well. Take one strange use. Uh, uh Jera. Um, you tr as you're trying to scavenge the rot the thing, the uh pi giant pile of metal. Um let's see. Yeah, so while they're doing that, can I get on top of this thing and just start scoping yeah, you the area? Find, um trying to think of just a general purpose item. A scanner? Yeah, you find a general scanner. It seems to be seems to be functional. I do? Yeah. Sweet. Who wants a scanner? Yeah, you find a general purpose scanner. It's functional. It's an, it's an older scanner, but it still works the same. It's an older, it's an older model. Yeah, you with do a hear something up. behind the trees, though. Like, behind you, in the tree line. Can I um, perception check to see if I notice it? 
Yeah, I'll point it out regardless. Sure, just also, uh, would it be your perception. Would it be perception or would it be survival? Um, if you're actually just looking, more than likely perception. Yeah, trying to like trace, or... trying to like track something, like if something's moving, survival. Yeah, survival is more for like tracking and trying to like survive. Because it says that survival is used to recognize the signs of imminent dangerous conditions and knowing how to prepare. Yeah, so like you're trying to scan the area. Like, was there like a bunch of branches moved, like missing or broken because something yeah. moved to this area recently? Yeah, yeah. So you can roll perception to look, stack actively look, or survival scan the area. Like, is anything broken? Like things All like right. that. Yeah, I'll survival check it. I didn't even realize you rolled the d100. I'm so okay. dead. Oh yes, yeah, die on it. No, so. I'm it's on purpose. Wait, does this scanner tell me where things are? Like, can I figure this? Yeah, you can like scan this? frequencies, scan like things like metal, metallic objects, things like that. Um, is so whatever you scan kind of gives you a detail. detail is the on. thing moving metallic? Uh, as you look through it, no. All right. Well, nothing metallic seems beast. to be moving. Do I get anything off that weird survival roll? Shit. Uh, nothing seems to be in the area. Uh, you should, at least what you can tell, nothing seems to be there. This uh, as you scan in the ground and looking around, and, like no leaves are disturbed, no branches are broken. This I don't know what the purple is for that me. though. He's rolling dice. We're all yeah. dead. No, nope. uh, yeah, nothing seems to be in the area, immediate area. The sound's still coming from the area though. From what you can tell, can you some kind the of area? Just over here. Like okay. over there, gotcha. over there. It sounds oh, seem to be over by me. Up. Shit. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna start walking this way. <laughs> okay. Uh, my weapon is drawn to the area, but I'm just on high alert. Yeah, nothing seems to be in the area though. When you're looking, but the sounds do seem to be coming from there. I don't know what the purple is. Maybe for some that like role. like what is? I don't Your know what the purple is for that roll, but um, the the metal parts that I'm walking over, like approximately, how old would this look? Um, what would you determine? Like, what, 30 to 40 years old? That's my character. It's when the uh, CIS and the Republic fought. Uh, yeah. I think. Okay. If we're in episode 6, that wasn't like 30 like, what, or 40 20? years ago. Yeah, it was like, um, oh. Yeah, because it looks yeah. like he was born at the end of it and he's like 20 ish. I thought we were. Probably. No, because the Empire is still a thing. We're not episode 6. This is like right after New Hope. And yeah. oh, this is right after, okay. right after yeah, New Hope. Yeah, it's like 4.8. Like, yeah, the Death Star yeah. has exploded. Yes. Yeah. Okay, the Death Star's exploded. Yeah, been, it's, it's, but it's like, not the Battle of Endor. It's like, then it was yeah. like 25, 30 years. I was going to yeah. say, so between episode <laughs> 3 and A New Hope, it was 19 years. Yeah. Yeah, so roughly 20 years then. 20, yeah. probably, this year, I could just probably 25. Okay, from, so this is like, see, so this is like a Republic really ship? Did not age yeah, well. yeah, no, this was like the end of the. It's a separate ship. Yeah, oh, a separatist it's a ship. It's like the end of when the Separatists and the Republic fought. Okay, so this is a separatist ship. Yeah, this is more towards the end of that war. This looks more like a, an IG will say, this looks more like a transport ship of some kind, rather it than is. Like a battleship. Well, it's rumored to carry treasure, so... Right, it's, it was supposed to... The rumor is that the ship holds treasure that was supposed to be a... Um, oh Spoiler god, what's the, the word looking for? Yeah, um, a tribute, in a sense? Yeah, tribute. Yeah, spoils of war. Okay, right. so what was the spoils, then? That's the thing. Nobody That's knows. Out. Nobody so really knows. we're on a wild goose chase. I like this already. On an Hell yeah, but planet. there's the chance of high loot. Even if it's battle droid tech, I'll take it. Old battle droid tech pales in comparison to what we have now. That's true. Be able to mass produce them. Mm-hmm. They'll be worth something. Could be worth something. Or I'm something to a collector. I'm just worried about coming across our still activated security droids. So am I. I hope their power work. cells are down. Well, that's just I me. have I have grenades just for that situation. You yeah. want to throw one preemptively? No, <laughs> it's not metallic. I know. Uh, I turn All on my I'm scanner. All I'm saying is, is destroyer droids have quite the reputation, and I don't think EMP grenades go through those. Those are droid decus. No. Right? Yes. yes, those are droid decus. Okay. Fuck um, <laughs> if I'm also looking for those one would of those droid shields. Right up. <laughs> yeah, droidicas are terrifying. I would love a personal droidica shield. I love myself. a personal droidica. Ugh, that would be fucking amazing. All right, let's go. Let's keep. I want to keep searching around. Head you directions. Can't the whole Clone Wars with just finger guns. Watch. Me. I want to. <laughs> <laughs> I want to move on. I'll head 
still cautious. I'm just going to follow way. IG. Is there okay. anything else of interest value I see, or just let's move on? No, most of what you see is just the general broken, scorched wreckage from falling from orbit. Um, Got holes in it. Can we? Broken, most of it. This, I know this happened about 20, 30 years ago, but I mean, a spaceship crash is still pretty jarring to the landscape. Can we, like, like look, pick through the tree, like the canopy, and see, like, the trajectory would have screamed into the fucking jungle? Yeah, you kind of. Yeah, like, if, when you're following the trail of broken wreckage, it's also kind of following the destruction that it would laid. Most of it's grown back, though, so it's kind of hard to tell from or from above that where it's gone directly. But right. the majority of the metal seems to be leading in a direction. Like, if it's follow it flew along this path as it came down. Right, okay. Well, I guess we just keep following the wreckage, and eventually it'll lead us to either a clue or the treasure itself. Yeah, he did, he did spot part of the ship from, from when you were out guys above. But you had to land nearby, and you're following. You managed to find a trail of wreckage and following it there. Okay, well, let's go. Okay, you guys, just keep walking along then. Yeah. Let's see, I'd say we're on okay. guard though at this point. I was gonna say I'm probably every you know like couple hundred feet. I'm gonna stop and scope around through the trees with my slow What planet are we on? Uh, uh Chogana. Chogana. What, does anybody know anything about this planet in particular? I actually made a roll for that and succeeded. I was going to say, I think we... Yeah, yeah Zian knows a bit. I do. Okay. What does she know? What do I know, Donkey? Yeah, so what you can tell from orbit, when you made your check in orbit, uh, Chogana's system, by about two-thirds of the system, is covered by a large nebulous gas cloud that the planet, the planet kind of comes in and out of as well. So Ooh. coming directly to the system itself is quite dangerous. Because the gas cloud is also laced with asteroids everywhere. As in, a couple of bounced off your ship on the way down. And I dodged a couple of those, great. Yeah, you managed to dodge a couple of them. Um, the planet itself is pretty uninhabited. Um, Probably because of the gas cloud. Yeah, it's a remote and isolated ward, war, world. Yeah. Look on the outer edge of the outer, outer edge of the outer rim. It's pretty, And though. with only the wild space beyond. If you who have heard of this world usually know it as the home... World of the Nexu. The Nexu is a fierce, fearsome, <gasps> four-legged beast with a mouthful oh, of razor sharp Lord. teeth. Dude, that would have been condition. nice to know. That's what I was saying. I was like, yeah, I, feel like knows. I was like, oh, now we know. Now we know this as well. I was about to say, I feel like I feel like there's some pertinent information we're missing because you don't come to an uninhabitable planet where that's been growing for thousands of years without any humanity touching it, and not have like crazy predators. I on mean, it. what's the worst that could happen? Yeah, because most people who come to this planet come here to pick up some of the, the wildlife, like the Nexu. I would, I would actually... know about this planet then. Yeah, so would you know you? some of it. Like you probably heard rumors that this is where it's from, but not like anything concrete. Yeah, it sounds able to know actually like concrete. Like, hey, I actually know this. Like By most the way, people they come look here. Friendly. Yeah, um, it's like so, a jungle. Okay. Life grows, the floor grows quickly, so it's hard to establish a base of operations for a long period of time without having to manually cut it all back. Can, uh, like, hey guys, and I the wildlife is quite dangerous. I just remembered. Uh, there's a species of like cat-like creatures called Nexu on this planet. Uh, they're very deadly. Oh, so, I need to add more trees to this map. I just realized that. Maybe we can tease it uh, and make it our pet. So now we get to play my favorite game, Is It Tree? <laughs> Funny story. I actually have a... With my old crew, we had a Nexu cub. It was the most adorable thing. So I would just like Press to point X out... to Del. I would just like to Press point X out... Press X to what? To yeah. Del. Uh -oh. I would like to point out, ladies and gentlemen, uh, that uh, <laughs> cat-like cat -like predators tend to leap at you from high places. Yeah. So oh, keep your eyes up. Sweet oh, Lord Jesus fuck. Christ. <laughs> We're so dead. <laughs> okay, continue. Continue. There are nine of them tracking you. Uh, we're leaving. That's what we're doing. Because we got to follow this trail of wreckage. Does this look like most of the ship here? No, it looks like maybe this was like a small chunk of the ship that kind of fell off and landed. Like the ship was quite big, at least bigger. It was bigger than your freighter. Okay, well then, yeah, we got to keep following yeah. the wreckage because I want to get off this planet as quickly as possible before we okay. get inked. Okay, yeah. so, um, ladies and gentlemen, let's, let's shuffle this along. Zion and Jeeps. Oh lord, eyes up! I succeeded my survival roll, cap or resilience roll, Captain. Well, that's good for you. <laughs> <laughs> um, everyone, actually, give me a resilience check. But uh, I did so well before. I need everyone to do this this time. You're not my real uh, bad. Because we're on guard, do we get boosts? 
Oh uh, yeah, you can add a boost to your thing. Woo! Except he's a young guard. What about those of us that succeed the the perception <laughs> check the first time? Do we no, get this is on top of that? I know. <laughs> oh god. Look at those four setbacks. <laughs> <laughs> IG rip. <laughs> I believe in you, IG. This is I have five. I have uh, a G. Zero, IG. Yeah. Oh, it's me. It's me. Really this ain't gonna end well. This ain't gonna end well. <laughs> Ooh, hey, that could have been a lot worse. It could have been worse. It could have been a lot. G's failed. Perfect. I was <laughs> say, at least it's not my G. only Yon one. I have one in, so. <laughs> so. Yeah, actually a better way of determining this. Ayala, IG, and Jeeves. But Jeeves got double failures. So, yeah. Okay, let me move these creatures out. Okay. So, for those uh, who failed, uh, you don't take any strain or anything. This time's getting ambushed. <laughs> yeah. Um. Wait, where are the critters? You see, like, just looking slip? down at the ground, examining the wreckage, like talking amongst each other to see if you can get the, uh, like, what determining what happened and stuff. Um, those who failed, you feel a tentacle, kind of quickly wrap around your neck uh, and start to I pull on. I don't have you. a neck. Tentacle boys. Me and I do don't have necks. Torso. I Close have. A, I have a. Well, I mean, no, I have a neck because I still have something yeah. that connects my fucking headpiece to my chassis. Does that count as a neck? Yep. Oh, okay. We have necks. Okay. Oh, oh the great. Fuck? Wait. I can't even. Yeah. What the fuck are those? Tentacles. Is it that an octopus? Like, they look like a morps. Yeah. yeah. Okay. The Florps find... are fucking crazy. <laughs> I can actually find what it is because it's not a very common. O well, I probably could, but I was just fun octopus because that was the closest thing. Um, as you quickly look down, as this tentacle kind of like wraps around your center of mass and start to pull, as oh, you is this the everyone else like, looks octopus? up. Yeah. Oh god, these are terrifying. As you look up up into the trees, there's this large octopus hanging from there. As three of you are seen to be grappled by them, real quick. What the fuck? I put a nice picture for Discord for you guys. Yeah, I said everyone to roll me initiative. I, uh, uh, is this be, uh, holy shit! <laughs> um, those who were ambushed, who have the tentacle, is Vigilance. Uh, Jer is Zeon. That's actually Vigilance as well, because you weren't expecting them. V yeah, it's Vigilance. Hard. No, you two actually found out. Yes. So you both were cool. By the yeah. way, I get plus one uh, on my roll. I get plus one advantage. Okay. Uh, so we we get cool. Yeah. I mean, um, thing, it really so... doesn't matter for me. Did I clear the pool? No, I didn't clear the pool. No. Shit. Okay. Uh, there you go. Pool is cleared. Everyone roll. If you have a boost, add your boost to it. I mean, I don't get a boost. I just get a plus. They say a straight up plus one advantage to whatever I roll. Oh, I'll take that one armor. instead. Just so um, I'll just take my roll and oh, take it at a pl at a four. Um, okay, I forgot to click my character. Um, I got hey, a... you don't have to click your character. Oh. Yes, I did. Well, mine's not on there. It's 1-2. He oh, cleared it. Okay, I cleared can it. you can you manually change my 3-3 three, three to a 3-4? One second. Everyone put yours up there. Change I don't know if you can I'm, actually I'm, do I'm running through mine right now. Vig? Okay, I'll re-roll it then, I guess. Oh, that one isn't working. Interesting. Yeah, it's not working. Oh, there it goes. Oh, the cool. Okay, just roll the I'll cool. Keep that. Just to put it on it. <laughs> oh, and you know why that's good. not rolling? Because I'm not rolling it in fucking combat. Oh, that's oh, probably why. Fucking skill. <laughs> yeah, in combat there is intelligence and cool on the combat. You have a fucking triumph. <laughs> okay. Cool story, bro. Okay, let me get the creature. Ugh. Okay, so. Okay, my... so what did everyone have? I. Unless you want me to adjust it. My three three should be three four. Okay, so a 3-3 three, three should be a 3-4. Do you what? want the first one before you reset the pool, or the second one that I rolled? Um, I can just keep whatever. Uh, technically, Sakara, you got a 6-0. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll ask the 4-0 to 6-0. Nice. And then mine's 4-0. Then we got a 4-0 as well. It's a pretty good initiative, Sakara. I'm proud of you. Pretty good initiative, guys. A four, a six, a four, a three, and a three. I'm kind of uncomfortable how close they are. Yeah, I mean, you're me. Wait, what do you mean how? <laughs> you? Around my neck. Yeah, three I'm, of you are grappled. I was gonna say, yeah, it's around my neck. I'm, I'm also. Say, how, what do you mean you're uncomfortable? You have a sword. I'm. I'm also kind of uncomfortable that there's a uh, holy mother of God. Those rolls. Um, <laughs> their initiative is that good. Jesus <laughs> Christ. 
Oh, shit. And out here. That's Earth. so unbelievably fucked. Hey, nah. good news. We have a PC that will actually go before them. A couple, actually. Yeah, two. Okay. Yeah. So, everyone ready? Yeah, uh, I guess. As, yeah, as tentacles reach down and quickly grapple Ayala IG and start to pull you up into the air. So, question first things first, how far up in the air are these things? Um, they're like probably up in the trees. They're probably a good 30, 40 feet above you. Fuck yes, I'm pulling them. Uh, when I go, I'm doing my slug throw and then instead of my force pick. Oh, fuck. How the hell am I supposed to get to them? You chop at the things that are around our necks. There you go. Yeah. Oh, they're you pulling you chop. up. Gotcha. Yeah, they're pulling uh, them up. We'll, we'll, uh, do a, we'll do the fast. As you look up, yeah. they are very fearsome looking creatures. As oh, that's what I like to call the hut ball. It's special. a multi tentacled horror that lives in the upper canopy of the forest. It descends to the lower branches and pushes prey. So, grappled means I can still shoot it, right? Yeah, I don't think grappled really is a thing, but you just, if you don't, if you let it keep you, it's going to keep pulling you up into the air. Yeah. So, okay. and it'll fine. try to bite you and let you. So, we might want to get me out of this. I am kind of constricted around the neck here, and I need breathe, okay. and I need air. So, Ayala is just across from me, and I can see the thing that's pulling him up. Yeah, essentially, those things are above you. So, I'm going to shoot the thing. I'm going to take my first action oh, yeah, to shoot. Oh, grab the range bands. Just as an FYI, I looked up the lore for the helmet on these. Did you know that the Nexu hunt these? <laughs> really? <laughs> Time to get a Nexu pet. Time to get a Nexu. No, they'll um, be run away from the Nexu. Gian, <laughs> if you need to reach them, I will gladly let you use me as a support to jump into the Man, air. And that's weird. It's almost like I have a grappling hook in my armor. Weird. How convenient? Well, that's actually pretty convenient. <laughs> that's really convenient. That's horribly <laughs> convenient. That's great. All right, where's my range bands? Where did I put them? Uh, yeah. So I'm gonna shoot the one that's hoisting Ayala in the ear. Uh, okay, you wanna go first and shoot it? Yeah. You know, using base... my maneuver to aim. All right, one second. You know, based on that picture, they are horrifyingly large. <laughs> yep. Uh, I did you wish. give us range bands and stuff? Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Uh, I think that's I was gonna, gonna say be they're one. kinda up, so it's gonna be kinda difficult. Yeah. I uh, think I think it's bigger. at short range. I think everything's just about in short range except. Yeah, they're for about like... thirty feet, so they're no, about range... short. Yeah, that range band's it's about good. Thirty. Do I still have grids on this? Not me. Oh, I do have short grids as well. Good lord, that is a m a monstrous creature. Yeah, they're fucking huge. How big do they get? Okay. Yeah, they should be big enough for the bands. Okay. Yes, uh, yes. It's yeah, it's definitely big enough. That's definitely big enough. Um, I th actually, I think that thing's engaged with me. Yeah, the what the ones that are grappled with you are essentially uh, engaged. I was gonna say it's their arms that are engaged, from but then they're straight it, up. They're like thirty yeah. feet, right? From you to it, it's pretty much engaged range. From you to another one, it's gonna be short. So unless okay. you're like directly underneath it, it's within engaged range. Okay, so I'm gonna shoot. Yeah, I'm gonna shoot the one that's. Sh Holding it, y'all. I was gonna say. So at that point, then, since I'm aiming up, and like you said, it's like thirty feet up. Well, I was still. Right. I too speak static. I too love. I too speak. Can you hear me? There is a there's a town that says speaks binary. I was gonna say, can you hear me now, though? Yes. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I'm just trying to thank you for the mechanic with my slug throw. Since they're straight up thirty feet, well, even the one that's grappling me up kind of is engaged. Then with that, for that uh, shot. I'm just I'll just call them, no matter what, they're in short range from above. All right. How about, how's that sound? That works yeah. great for me. So, okay, so start short, and then move out from there. Okay, so I'm going to shoot at the one that's hoisting up Ayala, so Okay, that's so that'd be medium range. range. Be medium. Uh, medium range, right, right. Just, okay. to, just to make this even more yeah. creepy, uh, their tentacles have a fur-like substance on them. Okay, stop. <laughs> that on my neck now, thank you. Uh-huh. Yeah, you can see the picture in Discord right now. Does they're it medium range now? God damn it. Yeah. Can I stress myself to aim again? Yeah, you can aim twice. Okay. <laughs> Let's see, do these have any bonuses that I give them? No, I didn't. Okay. Wait, how far is short range? Bang. Short range? I was gonna say, I posted that thing, like, last yeah. week. Theoretically, like, short range is within, like, 20 feet to you and another person. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because I've ever yeah. seen this one picture of, like, engage range, he's in front of you. He's like, Short, 1 to 3 meters, medium 3.1 to 36, long 36 to 72, extreme 72 to 144. Uh, what was short again? Uh, 1 to 3 meters. Yeah. Sakara, that may have been the worst roll I've ever seen in my life. Holy shit. Yeah. Check. Oh, wow. Go, that again. actually is wow, really bad. Yes. If you want to actually uh, pin that donkey, or rem, either one of you two. 
Mm, yeah, I can pin it right Thank now. you. Oh. And then I can use that Hang to on, do... Oh, okay. Cool. Cause I... okay. Yeah, yeah, you mean, yeah. Spread the M's. Okay, so you have three. You miss. You take. So when you take your shot, you just miss completely. As it just yeah. burns through. As it quickly burns through the canopy just next to it. Yeah, it disintegrates part of the canopy. Um, yeah. I oh, can't. Set use... back as you grapple. All right, never mind. Oh well. Just go. Go for it. We can just roll a black, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, just go for it. Um. Let's see, what can I use this advantage for? I can use this advantage for. <laughs> Passing a Ignore penalizing effect. environmental effects. Passing a boost die. I wonder if it's actually watching us. Okay, I have a question. I have yes. a question. I can force the target to drop a melee or ranged weapon he is wielding. Can I force him to drop Ayala? Yeah, I would say yes. Okay, I will yes, use my three advantage to force it to drop Ayala. You basically like, spooked yeah. it a little and it dropped it? Yeah, like he, he went to shoot for a tentacle. But as it quickly as it saw you shoot at it, it quickly dropped the and got its tentacle out of the way. But it's two massive eyes. <laughs> That's tentacle. it. That's me. Or... I'm still getting hoisted in the air. <sighs> yeah. Uh, Next turn. I'm going to... Gonna... There you go. Go ahead. So am I in range? So what, am I in short range of IG then? Um, If you want to jump to IG. Short range IG is short range from three, you. Yeah. To hit it, it's going to be medium range. I'd have to strain myself to hit it. Uh, you'll have to if you shot if you shot or it. You yeah. Just... I mean, well, I you, a... you wouldn't be able to melee attack it, but you can melee yeah, attack yeah, the yeah. tentacle. On, yes, on what I'm saying edge. to attack the tentacle. Yeah, if you closed with an IG, a gauge range of IG, you can hit the tentacle. Sick, we're doing that. So I don't get the aim, but who cares? Yeah, swing away. I'm gonna free you, buddy. At... <sighs> I think I'm just hey, yeah. now. You ready? Crit machine activate. Sweet lord. <laughs> There's your crit. So that's a uh, double crit? crit? Yeah, crit machine activated. So that'd be, uh, okay. that'd be um, so vicious 2, 30, 40. 6 plus 2, so 8, eight. damage. And then a base, plus uh, a, two. then a D100 plus 40 crit. So 12 damage. And a D100 plus 40 crit. A D100 plus 40. <laughs> Kill it. Where's my crits? Critical injuries. Can you roll like a 91? Plus yeah, plus 40. Because it's vicious too, so... 81. Winded. Can I... Oh, that's worthless. Nah, okay. it's winded. Ooh. winded. But, but does he get freed? Uh, when you hit the tentacle? Yeah. Let's see, let's drop him. Let's make a resilience check on the octopus. Oct Hi. Oh, I didn't have any purples. Well, you I did. did. Yeah, there's two purples. Yeah, it drops them. Is it upset? Is um, it... no. Is it, it sentient? quickly? Yeah, you, you quickly smash at it with your sword. Is it quickly just chops off like a tentacle? Is it a uh, reacts what's left or lifts what's back up to in the air? It kind of like scoots back from me from from you a bit. Because it lets out an ungodly shriek. <laughs> Lovely. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's see who wants to go. Oh, cool. I still got one person grappled. Perfect. God, these things are terrifying. Uh, All Donkey, right. real quickly. Yes? Now, because I was with my old crew and they had a Nexu Cup, would I know like a sound that I can make that would call like Nexu in the area. Please don't. We'll die. Um. Sure. Give me just a. Be survival. I, I'm not saying. I'm not saying. I'm making this Would action be survival, right now. Right? I'm just saying what I know. Did you grow up with one? Huh? Did you, you grew up with one, or did you a friend had a cup? Uh. Said, well, this what this is. Uh, the old my old crew did. Oh, your old crew? Yeah, you would you would know that the a sound like an extra cup would make. Okay. Especially frightened or in fear. Would this be a deception or... roll? It would probably be Pro deception. Performance. <laughs> be deception, right? Performance. Probably deception to see if you can either if you're trying to frighten the octopus or summon Nexu, possibly both, depending on how well or horrible it goes. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. 
Yagnip was holding Jeeves. Is he going to <laughs> do some shit? There's an even do some shit. I like that. Very descriptive. Oh, I didn't put bite on this. Attempting yeah. to bite the shit out of it. That's what you're gonna do. <laughs> Biting um, the metal. I'm gonna give it a boost because it has you, has you in a cynical. Of course. Um, this is melee verse. Do you have your weapon out, Jeeves? Yeah, probably as soon as I got choked. Being a bounty hunter would be a okay. natural reaction. All right, I'll add a setback as that. And if he's not grabbing my arms, I mean. Yeah, it's more of a grapple. All right, he is There's... going to attempt to fight the spare Play with you and kill him. Oh. <laughs> it turned into wow. a Japanese porno. All right, you Link's... take three. <laughs> right, you take six uh, damage. What did Link do again? Unless you make another attack with another tentacle. Yeah. For, at the cost of <laughs> advantage. Yeah, so three I can advantage. do it up to three times. No, for three wow. advantage. Three advantage. No, it's up to three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up to three. up to three. It just right. yeah. Yeah, you yeah, you use times. an advantage. Like one to six. Be two advantage. Yeah, yeah you use two yeah. advantage. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah you so I, can advantage use, I can do three additional hits if I. So if you somehow it. get manage to roll six advantage, you could hit him th with like three additional times. <laughs> yeah, linked. It's terrifying. Yeah. Well, I mean, they are octopi. The firing lead weapon is successful attack. The weapon deals one hit. The most bad two advantage to trigger an additional hit. Yeah, so I can hit up to three as long as I hit get additional advantage. Yep. Yep. As you... All right, so geez, you take six points of damage okay. from as this tentacle starts to fucking choke you or it starts to kind of squish your systems together. It's um, and I can't trigger the circles in either. your neck. Yeah. So it is six points of damage to you. It's okay. I got a threat. Can I use a reaction? Uh, there's no reactions. Misty step. <laughs> right, it will take. Uh, let's see. I got one threat to spend. Oh, it'll take a point of damage, as as some of your systems kind of like spark it and cut. starts to like cut the tentacle a bit. <clears throat> yes. Can I? Can I? Uh, can I use my reaction for eye for an eye? <laughs> <laughs> can I? Uh, uncanny dodge. Cuba force. Wall of force, baby. <laughs> um, there we go. Rah. <laughs> hey, Jero. Reach down, grab you, Jero, or snag you, Jero. Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck off. All right, it's gonna come down to those tentacles to try to <laughs> smack you right off. All right, so that is once again. My AC is eighteen. My, is 18. My AC is eighteen. Doesn't have a boost. Eighteen damage. <laughs> Wacky, wavy, inflatable arm flailing. And, and I have a shield, so it's Wait. twenty. Wow. Wait, so with the six damage, my soap still takes off, right? Yeah, your soap yeah, still takes off. No. Oh, because you said it. six damage, and I didn't even think about my soap. I, I tell you what your damage is, and then it's yeah. up to you to determine your soap, because I do not know your soak off top of my yeah, head. Yeah, it's always. I didn't it's even always, think about the soak. <laughs> yeah, it's always damage minus soak. I was like, wow. Same damage. with strain, strain minus soak as well. Because I was Busy like, with that tentacle shit from that one yeah. hit. Yeah, this tentacle reach down to like kind of like slam you and grab you, but you quickly duck out of the way as it zooms right over your head. That was okay. actually a wash. Okay. What? That's crazy. Quick, yeah, close the door turn. because we can save ourselves. Uh, I'm going to take my turn. Uh, short range. And from I'm going to ask the party how they feel about me trying to summon some Nexu. <sighs> yeah, I mean, if we're going to die, might as well go out and tear, right? I mean, do we do we feel like we could win this? Oh, yeah, we could totally win this. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm not going to do it just yet. Okay. Is we can either win this or we can try and win the other thing. <laughs> I think the other one might be a little worse. <laughs> yeah, because if I, do, if I mimic a Nexu cub, then they're going to see us as well and go, oh, yeah, they're hurting my babies as well. <laughs> yeah, maybe not. Um, Nexus are yeah, depending on how well, good or bad that roll went, it could go from bad to worse or from good to better. So Depends. shooting the one that just shot at me. Short range from you. Short range, thank you. Because it's um, up in the trees. I'm going to shoot it. Are you ready? Yeah. Uh, roll four. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, I think okay. it's dead. Uh, plus one advantage as well. The Ferrier Boy. So it has. That's blast Which right there. Nine damage straight. <laughs> oh, oh, blast would be crying. worth it though here. Bla blast is going to be. Yo, that's here, three crits you if you want to use all the advantage you got. That's six advantage and a triumph. Yeah, because could... blast isn't going to do anything. They're not in. Engaged range yeah. with each other. So if you wanted to, you could plus a d a plus thirty uh, crit. So right now that's plus twenty nine damage. Now he gets one more advantage. Two, 
Yeah, it goes to two advantage. Yes, six advantage. Yeah, and a, so and a triumph. That's two crits. So it's a. So oh it's no, you're right. You're right. The first one's and a then crit. the actual crit itself. Yeah, yeah he doesn't have. It's the eleven. Shot, eleven damage total. Oh yeah. Do you want to spend the blast and that? No. No, he's uh, got it's a... nine. It's nine damage. It, it plus two. Uh, point blank. Point blank. Yeah. One of my blank. abilities. Okay. It's eleven damage I mean. and a triple crit, basically. Yeah, so a, a plus twenty. It's crit. a triple crit. Yeah. So I'll so triple to, crit that thing. One triple crit it. Okay. Plus twenty isn't great, but it's something. He could roll seventy one plus twenty. So plus twenty. That's death. Great. It's not as smart as it used to be. <laughs> great. Awesome. <laughs> the octopus is dumber. Hey, you know, that just means if when I make that Nexu Cub sound, it's just going <laughs> to fail it and flee. I mean, oh, that, that, that's true. It could. Okay. Uh, can I bonus action disengage? No. <laughs> bonus action die, if you wish. <laughs> can I bonus action cry? <laughs> bonus action cry. Just remember, Roll performance. Your pants uh, that's my action. turn. Okay. Uh, who's next? Uh, Man, Ayala, can I go? Yeah. Can I shoot the tentacle off me? Sure, you want to shoot the octopus? Can I get it off? Yeah. Me? Yeah. All right. Um, it is short range from you. So, okay. give me your damn your attack. Did you? I put the setback die on. Just to oh, make yeah, sure yeah, it's you are, yeah, double you're anymore. being grasped. Put a setback die. It's a miss. What the fuck? Wow. <laughs> you are heavily <laughs> advantageous. <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> Look at I put all these points in here, and last game I was shooting triple triumphs, and now I get this bullcrap. Oh, uh, look at your advantage. Your advantage. Jesus oh. Christ. You can still free you yourself. Come on, send a boost out of someone. You can spend oh, three. Can you can spend I... three to, to free yourself, because you're forcing it to drop you. Yeah, you could spend three of that to force it to drop you. Yeah. <laughs> can Potentially I spend eight advantage to reroll? It damaged itself more than it damaged me. Yeah, can we make that a homebrew <laughs> rule there, Don K? That what? Uh, a set amount of advantage to reroll. <laughs> no. Can no. I spend my eight advantage to reroll? <laughs> oh, sorry. So you have, what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven advantage. That's hilarious. Okay, geez, what do you do with your advantage? Can... Try to drop um... yourself. You can you can force it to drop a melee weapon, which would be you, essentially. <laughs> is that three? Yeah. Yep. Okay. There I is the advantage roll? and threat table. Yeah. Rolled like, seven. I rolled seven. seven. So you could do that, pass <laughs> two a boost ion to anyone, and then use two to reduce strain. There you go. If I use another one to force the target to drop another melee arranged weapon, drop one of its tentacles. <laughs> no. Uh yeah, you could, but it's still gonna be able to hang up there. It has eight it has a total of eight tentacles. But now it would only have seven? It only have three holding onto the branches. I was say, it has them all, just... Yeah, because it's four <laughs> hanging onto the branches, and then four for hunting. Uh... That's why it's linked three. Yeah, get one, the other three coming to hit you. Um, let I'd me, pa yeah, I'd pass let me recover guy. the three strain I have. Okay. Okay. I take and then, get mine. and then I'll add a blue to the next person. Alright, sounds good. Okay. Oh, Remember that. Now it me. is the octopus. I'll throw it in there for myself now since I'm the next person. So, yeah, the last person I believe too. Yep. Right, octopi, who went? Uh, the one on Jera went. This one did not. Come on, bitch! Uh, I'm gonna swing over on the branches and try to nail you. Give me your tentacles. <clears throat> who just joined? It was Wolf. Goodbye. Yeah. It's a cool me, daddy. All right, Jerry, he's gonna tentacle you. Tickle me. I had to move. Let us be sent by. I was gonna say, well, after tentacle me, daddy, I don't think there's any chance Hi. of this VOD ever doing anything for you. Oh god. <laughs> Fuck me. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so you get hit for five damage. Uh, fuck me. Uh, I take no damage. <laughs> no, that's a, I don't know what you're saying, so yeah. Um. I mean, this could have gotten worse. Roll me Fuck a critical me. hit. Yeah. Yep. It's just a flat yeah. Where do I even find that shit again? Um, under uh, 
at the top where it says combat skills on the fourth tab to the right, it says combat injuries. So below where it says wound, strain, yeah. and soak. Uh, critical injuries, uh, and there's a roll critical button. Combat. Wait. Set your critical um, roll offset. I'm fucking blind. Give me a second. I don't know where it is. Say it again. Oh, okay. So, oh. Never mind. Found it. We're good. There you go. Roll that crit, baby. Oh, you're off balance. Set back. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. To next skill check. the next skill check. That's fine. Easy roll. Yeah. Easy clap. So you Unless you're like, I'm gone. The one in G's is gone. <laughs> what? Yeah, the one in G's is gone, right? Yep. Yeah. yeah. Try to eat him. Uh, Ayala. Woo. All right. Add that. <laughs> Dark side Yay. point real quick. <laughs> Dark side uh, point the fuck out of this! Gian, it looks like you're about to use some light side points here. Probably. Alright, Tentacle's gonna try to come down and smack you. Ow. Tentacle board. Damn, I need two advantage. <laughs> yeah, so as it quickly reaches down and, uh... I think Snare is a passive, right? Uh... No. Probably not. Snare passive what? or inactive? No way in hell that's a passive. Or, this can't, can't be. That's OP if it's a passive. That's a yeah, passive. Yeah, trigger on one. And a weapon with a snare weapons. binds the soul and restricts its movement. When a snare is triggered, the target is immobilized. Six, it's active. Six. Active. Alright, see, I can't trigger it then. Yeah, see, if that shit's passive, I'm gonna go buy an ensnaring weapon. <laughs> yeah, cause it depends. Because some weapons straight up do ensnare, like a net launcher. That will ensnare you. Right. Okay, yeah, so I come down and smack you for seven damage. And uh, I'll pass the boost to the next person, next octopi to go. Okay. Uh, the octopi. Uh, it's gonna try to smack you, Zion. As you. I have a I have a defense, one. by the way. Okay. So this is melee versus melee. So two, and you have oh, one defense. Oh, wait, what? did they have the setbacks for me? Yeah, they did. Yeah, they just did. making sure. Yeah. So it's gonna try to smack you. So it's two purple. Uh, one for setback because of defense. Let me double check before you roll my armor because I just added gonna, it. Yeah, it's gonna aim at you. Uh, oh, where God. the fuck is my armor at? The item inventory. It is. Uh, uh, okay. Yeah, that's yeah. actually a pretty good one against the first octopi because it can't activate its abilities. No, it, except for trying to activate abilities, so no, it can't do that. All right, no, I don't have anything extra. That's all it all is. Right. It's going to reach down and smack you. Smack Let's use another bitch. point, because I got four of them. <laughs> yes, okay. give us more, Donkey. Okay. Hail it. Not bad. <laughs> success. So it comes down as a tentacle after getting one of them hacked into. Another one comes flying out of nowhere and just smacks you across points of damage. That's not bad. So seven wounds. That's not bad. Why can I not get any fucking advantage? For crazy hey, they're, uh, they're crazy not attempting wall. to stun or strain me, are they? No. Okay, so they moves are weak. You know, you know why you can't get advantage? Because we're rolling all of it. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, you guys don't buy advantage. Alright, okay, last, uh, last person I believe y'all are, correct? Yeah. Yep, you have a boost from before. Yep, and I'm using that because fuck this one right here. This, um, this particular one. It's going to shoot one above you? Yep. Alright, that's one range man away because it's short. Fuck that particular one. Uh, ready? Back when you're ready. Right. <laughs> Boom. There's all oh, the advantage. God. <laughs> There's the advantage, guys. <laughs> well, you can credit. Two crits. Seven, eight, nine, ten points of damage. I'm going to credit and pass a boost die. Yeah. All right, you're going to credit and pass a boost die. Oh. This one, this critical injury is... Let's find out. I winded, winded it with a slug thrower. Wind. That's fine. No, I winded. I just blasted um, part of it off, you know, but those previous crits are still there. Hey, I can't do anything about that. Okay. Okay, it just so stacks it then. I would either have to have three for each character. You can just clear one out and just add a 61 to Oh, it. yeah, I guess add it 61. That is true. I can clear out what it is, rolled out 61. Uh, let's heal that. 61. Slightly dazed. All skill checks. Yes, until the end of the that's, encounter. That's, that's good. great. Yeah, it's got black on everything then. Sweet. So, am I in melee range then? 
Um, Since the motherfucker just tried to slap no. his tentacles at me? No, you're able, to slap the te- you're able to attack the tentacle off IG, but it's still up in the air. It's like it slapped down at me and then pulled his tentacles up? Yeah. Grappling. Well, that time. fucking sucks. Alright, player character. I mean, um, can I can I grappling hook Craigasm? I would like you can to grappling sh- hook him in a tree and pull yourself up to it. I w- I would like to shoot this fucker. In All right, the one that's when he's wounded as well. This motherfucker in particular. Did you get a disadvantage? All right, the one next to you, to the south. Yeah, the one that's in the engaged circle with me. Okay. Remember, you get a, bo- oh, a bonus die. I do get a boost die, yeah, and then I'm going to aim, and then I'm going to aim again. <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, that's what I forgot to do. Shit. Shoot that motherfucker. Yeah, it's take two strain aim again. Yeah. It'll be short range for me, right? Because it's <laughs> you have three boosts. Alright, ready? Disruptor him. Jesus. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey. 10, uh, another 11, crit. 12, 13, 14, crits. 15. No, it's Technically, that could be three crits <laughs> if you wanted to do it. The damage alone kills it. Just disintegrates it. I was about quick. to say because a disruptor Ooh. rifle base is a crippled limb. I was saying if you, Sakura, <laughs> if you did the uh, the triple, you would have gotten like a plus seventy crit on it, and it, I've already yeah. crit it once, yeah. so it would have been a plus yeah. eighty. That's gross. It would have yeah, been the bad. fifteen damage alone killed it. Um, I would like to. Okay, so triumphs are weird, so I have to go look up what I want to do with this triumph. Um, I wait, hold on. How much advantage do I have? One, two, three, five. four, five. I will recover five. Maybe I, oh, I can't even recover five because I'm, I'm at one dress. Yeah, yeah, one. Uh, recover okay. four then. I could upgrade um, the difficulty, upgrade any allies next check, including that of the current active character. Dad. Uh, do something vital. I could do something vital. Having next to arrive. No, I'm kidding. Come oh on. my god, I could though. <laughs> next two that are on our side. <coughs> nah, it wouldn't be on your side. It wouldn't be on our side. They would just arrive. Um, Cause how close are you guys to the ship? You're probably good, maybe ten minutes out from the ship. I think. I uh, the next two would run us down. Um, oh, they would. <laughs> yeah, easily. way faster than us. Um, I will upgrade. Is it the next character's check, or is it I get to choose? For two, for you next, get to choose for one. Upgrade any next. allied character's next check. So yeah. I get to so choose. So for two, you can pick. For one, it just goes next person. Uh, okay, then I'll just upgrade the next allies, uh, person, and then ra- pass a boost side to the next person as well, and then recover four strain. Yeah. So next person has an uh, upgrade. Yeah, you have an and upgrade a and a boost. Okay. Go. Next person. Would that be? Uh, can I? Well, can I go? Yeah, I'm useless here. I kind of want to grapple okay. boys, but we'll see. Yeah. Um. So first things first. I know that's two boost, and then I have one setback, or that's definitely a difficulty. Let's do a setback. Um. And then I'm gonna shoot a person. Don't forget your upgrade. Yep. I get an upgrade. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. I just got a triumph. So he's spending oh. his triumph on upgrading the next person's. Yep. Check. The next person gets an upgrade and a. <laughs> Boost. Uh, oh, he's a dark side point. Oh, That's so fine. It, so it so negates the... I, uh, no, I'm upgrading the difficulty. Of okay. this uh, but you're going to put that in, right? Yeah, I put that in. Perfect. I'm going to attack the left same hand side, one. I'll do the right hand side. Or Should I attack the same one? Or should I go for the other one? Uh, probably, probably focus fire. Alright, I'm going to shoot the same one I just shot. Okay. And Roll boom. One ready? Well, this is awkward. Oh, there's that uh, despair. Oh, shit. So my um, charge pack <laughs> drains. No, I pick. Yeah, he Fuck picks you, it. I want to pick it. No, no I get picked by the dude. I know, I know. I, I know. pick despair. <laughs> uh, oh. But that's still... That's going to happen. That's still two crits. Plus... Okay, so yeah, you're, you 12. have to... Yeah, your gun runs out of ammo. All right, I'm going to reload... You have to spend a maneuver to reload. Yep. I'll spend my maneuver to reload. Did you aim? No. No, I did not. There you go. Spend your maneuver to reload. Perfect. Yeah, your charge um, pack is now gone, though. And there's two crits, and that's another 10, 11, 12 damage. So you hit the one on the right? I hit the one that eight, I already hit. Eight, nine, hit ten. This. Or, yeah. I don't know. Which one you hit? This Skull? one. The one that I hit previously. Uh, ten. Oh, yeah, he did. 
he dead. Um, Just enough. And then I have to take out my extra elite reload pack. Okay, so you have the a extra triumph? reload pack is now consumed. You have a triumph and two advantage. What okay, do you, you have a triumph and two advantage. You can so upgrade the next ally's check. Nine. Oh, more encumbrance. Wonderful. More grenades. Um, a triumph and two advantage. I'll upgrade the next allied character's attack and then recover give... two stress. Uh, I don't think I have any stress, so I'll just give a boost to the next allied character. Okay. Okay. Oh no, by allied, I do have two stress, but I'll I'll save it. I'll get I'll upgrade the next person's okay. thing. I'm not gonna okay. lie, I kind of want to. I want to grapple. Um. Also, <laughs> my. Uh, critical injury healed because it's just next skill check. Yeah, yeah so you can't, you don't heal it off no, your no, sheet. No. It's just it stays yeah. on your sheet until you someone physically heals it off you. But the effect yeah. no longer applies. Okay. Because uh, the critical injury still exists. So if additional critical injuries give a bonus to previous, give a bonus from pre previous. So mm -hmm. if you took another yeah. crit, it's now a plus ten. My base. Okay. So okay. eventually, you do want to get it healed off you, but someone's going to have the medicine check to get it off you. Okay. And our medic is in here. I know. <laughs> Wait, did Wes actually bow out? No, he's just not here today. Oh, okay. That's important. Okay, so the octopus seeing his brethren slain is going to try to smack you. Bring it on, bitch. I ain't afraid. I ain't scared. I'm afraid. <laughs> uh, I'm going to use a lightsaber. I, I said it before you clicked it. <laughs> uh, I said it before you clicked it. Oh, all right, flip me one back. And then flip another one if you want to. Yeah, flip so one You did back say it before and... I did. So. Uh, Someone flip me one back. Perfect. There we go. All right. Now you use your point. So what's your point to do? Uh, Make your check harder. Okay. So I'm upgrading the difficulty to hit you. Or no, no, no. I'm going to... Sorry. I'm making your yellow die a green dice. Okay, so you're downgrading my There attack. we go. That's what I wanted to say. Yeah, because you need to upgrade crit. or downgrade. <laughs> no more bullshit. Okay. It's going to aim at you. Aim and smack you. All right. Jeez, uh, there's no purple. Oh, there's no purple. Why is there no purple? Oh, thank God. Um, and wait. And you're downgrade. Yeah, your downgrade didn't go through. You got it down. Um, no, it's brawl is two. Uh, it's one green, two yellow. Holy shit! Yeah, I did get it. Yep. Wait, let me check its really? brawl. One second, let me check its brawl just to make sure. Its brawl is two yellows, one green. Okay, yep, so I did get it. You downgraded yeah. my yellow to a green. Yeah. So, so that is one success. success in hitting you, and two advantage. Uh, no. Okay, so it's just five damage. Um, yeah, five damage in length. I can hit you again for another five, I believe. Yep. <laughs> so it'll take five. Oh, they count as separate attacks, right? Yes. They are indeed separate attacks. Okay. I, so I take no damage. <laughs> five and then five again. Yeah. If it was, yeah, you're lucky I didn't have, if I rolled one less failure, that'd be six, six. Yeah. Um, you could ensnare him instead of. Oh, I got the fuck him. up. Too late. No, he already, He's already, no, he already used Link. It is, yeah. it, is, it is too yeah. late. It is too late. Yeah. Oh no, you and he only be... has um he only has two advantage. Yeah, he only has two advantage. Activate and So I activated the linked to hit you oh, a second okay. time. But as you said, your soak is warped. Yeah, but Same he line. could have instead ensnared you, but right. Okay. How many you have three left? Tell him these things, IG, you're trying to get me killed? No, I'm trying to make it fair. <laughs> oh, and trust me, these things are like the weakest things on the planet. Yep. Yeah. They are. I thought you said yeah. you were stepping up your game, Donkey. What happened? Oh, no, this is the intro fight. I mean, next <laughs> to hunt these, remember? The other creatures on this planet. I was going to say, next to are fucking <laughs> we're terrifying. So I, I, yeah, like, like, the next picture this in your head. There is a cat There's... that jumps into the trees to hunt these oh, things. Oh, no. I'm well aware. I know <laughs> yeah. what next to are. They're terrifying. The guy alone says there's the, the octopi. There's also bark rats and next to. I don't like the sound of bark rat. Can we ignore that? No. Hey, 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 hey. So then they you explode? Know, it could be a fucking Wait. chip. All right. I doubt that. They explode? Press X to doubt. <laughs> <laughs> did you, you, did you, Donkey, did you just say they explode? <laughs> no, they don't explode. Oh, by the way, the bark <laughs> rats are also haunt, hunted by Nexu. Hey, 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 hey. Do, yeah. do, right, do the bark rats. 
Do do the bark rats say Alu Akbar and explode? <laughs> look, look, Nightwatch, that was racist. All right, I'm gonna hit <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> that was actually racist. I just uh, said that question that for my a too. That was the best part about that whole thing because I was like so tired. I was like, wait, was that racist? <laughs> Damn! <laughs> five okay. damage, one advantage. Yeah, so Jeeves, the tentacle reaches down to slap you one more time for five damage. Okay. I mean, he's getting yeah. damage off, right? Can I shoot it now? Yeah. Uh, you can uh, use the yeah, upgrade in the boost occupy. from the previous roll of the PC. There's an upgrade in a boost? Yep. There's an upgrade in a boost that's getting handed to you if you are the active character. Okay. And then I have my one setback, okay. okay. Yep, one setback. Kill that shit. Are you going to aim with Shoot your maneuver? Fuck. Hell no, I don't aim. Aiming's for pussies, because you okay. need pussies. It. That deals 7, 8, so 9, 10 damage. That's 10, and then another 7. And then another 7, because you're firing linked. Yep. You're firing the second gun. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, it dead. It dead. Just so enough. So that only expends <laughs> two of your advantage. So you still got three left. What do you want to do with it? Uh, you you want something special? Is that what you're asking for? No, no I'm just I, asking. Like, is there anything you, you want to do with it? I have no more threat to get or strain to get rid of. You can negate the target enemy's defense bonuses. You can ignore penalizing Doesn't environmental. Happen. You can deal damage to a target. Or no, that's only triumphs, isn't it? Yeah, triumphs are the triumphs only ones that pass so on blue to any yes. allied character. Is that so, a, can, can I pass on three blues? No, you can only choose it once. Yeah. You can only choose that option specifically. You get, once. Just, for three's advantage, you could say the next gets a blue, gets a blue, and then the specific person gets a blue. Yeah. Okay. So, like, a yellow, so I can get a blue to pick, and then the next person, if that was a yellow, I gets another blue. For instance. Come on, do that. Well, who's, who's next? Anybody. It's Ayala or me, and okay. I am far worthless in this fight. Yeah, give it to Ayala. Jeez. Okay. okay. Yeah, so Ayala, you have uh, two blue dice now. Late. It's late. Okay. I'm also going to aim and then take two strain to aim again. Okay. Because why not? And just because fuck it. <laughs> so All look, right. that's four boost die, right? That's four yeah, blue dice and an upgrade. Great. Yeah. All right, you ready, Duncan? Here yep. comes that failure oh, somehow. <laughs> it's dead. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> uh, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Wow. You guys are just killing it. Like, it's just enough damage. I'm gonna pass a blue die on to IG, then heal two strain. I mean, I haven't gone yet, but... <laughs> Passing it to IG, and then heal two strain. <laughs> That's fucked. That's so fucked. Get sword. fucked! <laughs> Uh, I'm just going off what you said. You just said you're useless. I am you? useless. Just saying. Dead, dead, dead. And then we go on to the last doctor. Grapple. Grappling hook. Yeah, I know. Uh, I like to try to grapple up the tree when I get to go. Just for, just for the hell of it. Athletics. Okay. Uh, it's running away. Isn't it's beasting the fuck out. Can bitch. we all aim together and fire at once? Yeah, do I get an attacker of opportunity? <laughs> oh, it's going to Bale Bear. It's climbing through the trees. I shoot at all it. At once and fire. I shot at it. It dies. No, if I you're don't. gonna attack, attack at it. Oh, I did attack. No, because I, I didn't fucking right. set it up. I think that's the right dice pool. So it's gonna be oh, that, is, that would be two because I would be medium yeah. from it. Yep. Who does? Hey, Wolf. They're yeah. killing Octopi. Sexy bit. Be... Um, okay, so you guys don't want to keep trying to fire at it as yep. it runs away. Uh, yeah. I would suggest we don't because we'll yeah, be fine. We've... All right, it's going to escape in one turn, so I'm going to have everyone one attack to shoot it. Okay, nah. I just did. Okay. Uh, it is in the tree, so it's going to be a hard check to actually hit it as it's flaying through the trees. Oh, what That's do fine. I need to add? Okay, so just uh, roll your attacks. Or if you want to aim first, roll your attacks, whoever's shooting yeah. at it. You Does anybody have a decent med do skill I, besides I medic? It. I do. Last so medicine. that's that's eight and then another seven from okay. me. So, that's... so I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna crit I, it. I got the boost die from Ayala, so I'm gonna fucking aim and then aim again because we're <laughs> fucking going to shoot it. Fuck what? Fuck it? Why not? Let's shoot this. <laughs> this little thing. Got so <laughs> dead. I was gonna uh, say it's got seven damage. damage plus <laughs> that.
Okay, that's dope. <laughs> it's dead. It's fucking dead. Do <laughs> okay, you regret giving us a disruptor rifle? No. <laughs> Twitchy, fight what's next. Yeah. Well, yeah, these so are So, let's just let's just say this. There are some things like that one that one creature in the cave that the disruptor rifles literally bounce off of. So, um, yeah. So do the do the aboral or whatever they're called octopus have any uh yeah any loot on them? Loot? Any loot? Uh, they are squishy. They have innards. <laughs> they're hairy yeah. though, right? They have like fur. Mm, like, space yeah. octopus innards. Oh. So wait, they're like wolves, <laughs> like cousins? wolf. They have uh like they they live the in the trees and they have octopi. fur on their arms. It's a mottled brown green color, ideally suited for concealing itself on tree trunks and branches. Its skin is flexible but difficult to pierce. Its central body is round and less flexible and carried in head covered in hairy fur and thick hairs. I'll go up to Jeeves and say, Hey, I remember so you hearing me earlier. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah their yeah. main body is fur. The tentacles are ask Beyond if she itself. could chop it up for me so I could put it in the fridge. I'm going to give you the weirdest look. Like, yeah, we chopped up an actual sentient being and put him in the fridge. I'll just give a heavy This sigh. is a lot better. <laughs> can I Can I attempt to chop it up for him, Donkey? Okay, you want to try Wait, to when, when did we chop up a something? You know what? Session one. Don't Where worry about we it. stole the ship one. from? Yeah. Oh, the Transdotion? You put him in the fucking fridge? Oh, yeah, that's yeah, right. And, we and sold then we sold his meat. Sold yeah. Hey, yeah, that's right, Jeeves, that's right. That's right. Can you give me a medicine roll to try to heal my crit? Oh, yeah, okay. Donkey. Um, what am I doing? Roman survival. Survival? I don't get to cut it with my weapon. No, you're trying to oh. care. You're trying to carefully cut this the fur off the creature, correct? Oh God, like, yes. skin it. This is gonna be such yeah. a bad idea. Uh, if you're gonna try to cut it in pieces, you can just attack it. My survival is only one green, so right, I was fuck it, do yellow. It hey! Oh! <laughs> yeah, you, get, you get that octopi skin. So you have one occupy belt. Wait, what about the meat though? I don't want the skin. I want the hell. I'll, I'll take the pelt if you take the meat. Deal. Yeah, I need you can you to have chop one octopi pile of meat. How much does the pelt weigh? How much does the pelt weigh? Yeah, it's like one Probably uh, one hey, encumbrance. It's uh, it's an L for your bulk. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's a one encumbrance. <laughs> By the way, Sakar, how many shit points do I get since you're here? Shit points? Uh, shit. A lot. <laughs> because I never... I forgot can how I much we did. Can I throw my frag down that fucking hole? Let's end it all. <laughs> Can yeah, I... you actually could. I'm not <laughs> even joking. Like any one of you fuckers could just throw a frag down that hole. Um, but I mean, but first right. you have to make your uh, a plus four uh, wisdom save to disbelieve. No, I don't. Yes, you do. There's a hologram that says no. The hologram gives you plus four. It says no. Hey, there's a so something on the floor. So you I'm still gonna yeah, have the hologram's going to give you a plus four to yep, the save. You still have to hey, make essentially the save. Essentially, what happened what is the... I would... <laughs> we're talking about Starfinder. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Yeah. We're talking about our other sci-fi game that I Okay, love. continuing on with this game. Can yeah. I heal Jara's crit now? Yeah, you can attempt to heal Jara's crit. I think it's critical just one was... purple. You tell me when you're is ready. Is one purple? It's based it's on the critical purple. you oh, it have. Says, yeah, it says it on the crit. What does it say on the crit? It's one purple. Alright, roll my medicine to see if you can heal off. <sighs> uh, I'm trying to look for medicine because I can't spell. May, may oh. I attempt as well? You can heal four strain. Right. I would like to attempt to uh, heal his sure. crit as well. Please do. Sure. One more person can attempt. I'll do it because I'm a horrible person. Yeah, only one more person may try. You ready? I mean, what were the odds of me only rolling advantage? Son of a bitch! No. Nope. You can heal four more strain. Uh... Four strain. <laughs> Wait, no, you can't heal strain. No, you cannot, because this is specifically for the critical hit. Yeah. So no. Okay, I'll put my strain. So back. your critical hit is still active until the next good couple of hours, and someone else can try it again. Oh well, yeah, you get forty. By the way, four zero. Four zero. Oh, okay. Right? Okay. Cool. Do you guys want to uh, continue on? We do. Yeah. I I believe it's safe to say we might be on guard now. Mm hmm. And then the next two attack. I'm kidding. I IG would like to activate his jetpack and fly <laughs> at tree top level. Well, I mean, <laughs> to be fair, I G. Activate his own jetpack. <laughs> they 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 hunt the octopus who <laughs> live in the trees. So, <laughs> what would be scarier than next than next next with a jetpack? I feel like a next who wouldn't need the jetpack. It doesn't. Oh, they, right. No, it can jump even higher. No, a a rancor with next a jetpack. Yeah, the answer is always the rancor. <laughs> rancor. Yeah, those are scary things. Or a like, All right. like's just as scary. Yeah, or a like with so. a jetpack. No, a like with lightsaber size. 
Anyway. Lightsaber arms. <laughs> uh, continuing on. Lightsaber arms. Okay. So you guys continue back on to, uh... We're walking Making my way down downtown. The... Yeah, we're following the trail of, um... Crap, literally. Yeah, following the trail of crap. Oh, sweet lord. Oh, it's pretty. Oh, sweet lord. Yeah, this ship it's actually a... looks fairly yeah. intact. Can for we salvage this shit and fly it away? Landing. It's just a, it's a pre-generated map. Can we really salvage it and fly map. away? My mechanics okay. skill is not I would you could if it would... wasn't just a pile of engines. I was gonna say, I was just, that's fine. Bullshit. I was say, I feel like those are skate pods from the like wreck from the crew. Like these are probably sections of the so, ship that are, need to be welded back yeah, on. I don't know. Like a like a cargo bay <laughs> wait, that wait, fell wait. down. So if there are two engines there, and you said it's just the pilot engines, can I weld one engine to me and <laughs> weld another one to IG? Because then we can just fly in space. Because we. You know, if, you, if you were giant enough, size of a ship, sure. Oh. Now these things are huge. Look, the, it's, uh, just, it's not really a two scale map, it's just an example map. So, what, what are we oh, looking no, at? Here? Like, what is, yeah. what is so this? ahead, you see the narrow winding through, you see a narrow winding valley, one of the many cutting through ragged and overgrown terrain. A small river is visible through the trees. A rocky dam at the southern end creates a long, oblong lake, filling much of the valley floor behind it. Shut After a God. moment, you realize that the dam is actually the rusted hulk of a ship, jammed between the rocky outcoming outcroppings of the opposed bluff. The color is similar to that of the surrounding rocks. Water pours through the huge holes in the hole, flowing through the decks and out through the engines. Among the other exit points until it plunges into a series of natural falls that continue south. Okay. Wow, that's so actually pretty neat. Separate so, areas needless, then? Yeah. Needless to say. Things to say. Needless to say, the engine's a bit fucked. Uh, it's got a water. It's got a river oh, going through it. It's just water. Yeah, the ship has a critical condition of river flowing through it. it, so, it look, it'll buff right out. Yep. I want to know what this is. A little TLC. It'll be fine. I'm, gonna, I'm on guard. Like I'm slowly peeking my head in, listening. Um, especially that I know that there's Nexu here, around. So like, I'm Pretty gonna cool, go up probably. to it, listen if there's like meowing or growling. <laughs> Yeah, this is more of a pre-generated map, so it's not really like an actual like set map for like this is specifically what you're looking for and stuff. This is just okay. Like when well, I showed you this, when like, I showed you this, the space station. <laughs> there's like separate this something areas yeah, that yeah. have like meanings. Like, yeah. does this have a meaning to what you're trying to go for? Like, is this like a cargo hold or something? It's just part of the ship that fell. Not really. It's just part of a ship. I was gonna say, we just, just found, found engines. Section. We didn't find an actual like, Yeah, we just found yeah. You find like the aft yeah. section of the ship. All so right, like, there's dude. various debris thrown around, like things like that. I was gonna say, can I climb on top of one of the tallest points and just keep an eye out while everybody's searching around? Yeah, I mean, I could grapple up there if you'd like check. me to. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you want to climb up onto it? Yeah, I'm gonna climb up and just use my slug thrower scope uh, and just kind of scout around. Give me a coordination, coordination to climb up. Oh, I'm really bad at that. All right, take out one advantage. Yeah, so you assess the manage to climb up on top of the rusted oh, hulk sure, of the I ship. Probably clear my... I was going to say, I'm going to let everyone know that I'm going up to check everything out, too. Okay. Anyone else want to go up? And on that point, I'm going to run to nah. bathroom. I'm, I'm exploring need... the ship. Okay. Do you... Oh, wait. I can't ask. He's not here. Um... You can climb up if you wish. Can I grapple hook? Can I grapple up? Yeah. Grapple hook. Should, wait. Really make a check before I grapple up, can I perception... The to get an idea of how sturdy it is, so I don't fall into a pit. Sure, give me a perception check. You, you generally scan the area and the ship itself into the river that is flowing through the ship. <laughs> yeah. So as you uh, look around the the banks of the ship, um, the ship itself looks, even though it's quite rusty, like at least be able to support your weight. So if you wanted to climb up on top of it. So it, I mean, so I can I can be safe to say that it's it's not going to be dangerous. Yeah, like nothing's going to collapse underneath you. I mean, it is a spaceship. It was designed to survive the you know the pressures of space. Wait, I I have to know for space. my sake. Oh look, it's a roll I couldn't use a couple of days ago. Um. <laughs> <laughs> to not fall in the pit. 
But yeah, I, I beat your ungodly DC. Perfect. It's a DC 17. It's not even that bad. Chill. <laughs> that is pretty bad. <laughs> ungodly DC. <laughs> See, so yeah, I'll go up. Yep. Uh, There's a fucking re for you. You guys just rolled horribly. I, I, got, I got you. You need re's? I got them. <laughs> yeah. wow. In my trench coat, man. Um, I'm going to explore. Oh, can I make uh, another perception I'm... from on top? I'm trying to find my Ruri. Since I have a better vantage point. Vantage. There you go. I mean, it's really not my fault. Y'all fucking... There you go. It's your, it's your Ruri. Yeah, you should post that shit in Starfinder. Word. <laughs> okay. Do you want to just explore the area? Yeah. yeah. Just give me a perception check if you're just looking around the area. Can I actually survival check? Uh, for what? Uh, kind of the same shit I did before, right? Trying to see if there's any signs of danger, like... Dangerous. What was the way it said it? Um... Trying to find it. General non-goodness. Yeah, like, general badness going on. Sure, you can give me one to check for that. I can't remember what the, what the wording was exactly. Well, yeah. it's whatever I said before. General bullshit, I don't see anything. Yeah. Yeah, you see, like, there's holes on the ship, so you can climb aboard the ship and explore that. There's a couple of computer systems. Like, they're not too bad. Like, the inside of the ship isn't too bad compared to the outside. At least on some uh, sections when the water's not running through it. Uh, no, no creatures seem to have been in the area for a while. Like, nothing seems to stand out. Like, when you glance up at the trees, no, no branches are broken or anything. Um, uh, I'll call for IG to, like, join me on, like, on one of the outside of the whole the breaches of the ship. Mm -hmm. What the hell's doing that? I don't know. I hear dishes. I think it was Wolf. Damn. Wolf! Wolf, you're muted! How the fuck... <laughs> How does this even work, Wolf? <laughs> <laughs> Server, I'm confused. What's going on? Muted. You're muted, but we're hearing shit from you. Server oh, muted I'm like getting on. myself a burrito. That's weird. Okay. <laughs> Wait, how yeah, are you weird. talking with a <laughs> muted? Like, like, it it says I'm muted, talking? but... <laughs> I don't understand! <laughs> Wolf? 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 Are you magic? <laughs> Wolf, I need, this is what I need you to do. I need you to turn off your magician shit and stop sacrificing small children to dark gods. Yeah, turn no off way. magic bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking weird. That's my fetish. Okay. Okay. Right, continuing. Moving on. I'm gonna call for IG to come over to one of the breaches in the hole and then, like, Sure. Uh, yeah, no, I'll come over. Perfect. Did you, did you and anything? then, like, poke my head in. Yeah. Did you just poke your head in and take a look around. I'm just gonna poke my head and take a look around. Suddenly, look. And then next, I'm kidding. <laughs> I and was. Then, and then a, ro a row of two headed cyber bat dog that's just lasers. <laughs> Suddenly, <laughs> droid. Fucking laser sights. Two headed cyber bats that shoot lasers. That's gonna happen now that you said that in Starfire. I know. One or two. <laughs> Okay. I, mean, I could tell that dwarf I called it. Anything I see? Yeah. Uh, yeah, when you're looking around the inside, you see a couple of those definitely powered down, but they don't look to be in too bad a condition. As you glance around, there's a couple of uh, bro old, broken down, we appears to be droids as well, scattered around the area. Some are kind of scattered, some are still in racks, as you look around the area. Okay. Um, no, cre no, like, no creature droppings or anything like that, or scratch marks from like claws or tentacles or anything um okay i'm gonna shift my ion grenades and hook them on my belt mm -hmm. so they're easy to grab uh if needed and then slowly and very carefully watching my feet make my way inside okay so you enter inside the ship uh do the droids look to be like deactivated for a significant amount of time yeah, a couple of them, a majority of them, like at least the majority are still in the racks, and they appear wow. to kind of be all rusted over, like what moss. Kind of a couple of them. Uh, B1 battle droids. Yeah. Are those droids? Battle... No, no, they're the, the, they're no simple, those are the those simple those battle droids. Oh, the small yeah, ones. Those are, they're yeah, the yeah, simple those, battle droids. Yeah, those okay. are the standard battle droids you don't have to worry yeah. about. So even like the ship was like a treasury ship, it's still going to have some competent of droids, just in case like they get boarded. Yeah. This so you can probably be... surmise this is more of like the... Uh, the droids they hear to protect so the ship. This was the bipedal ones, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. B1s were the bipedal ones. The, well, the standard B1 were. battle droids you see that always get fucking murdered. 
like stupid. Yeah, yeah. Well, the, the, it was the standard battle shoes, not the yeah, episode one. Those droids. Yeah, those guys. Gotcha. Yeah, that yeah, are like in mass. I'm yeah, also gonna kind of step to the side and have IG take point as if there are activated droids, they'll see him first. Okay. Uh, yeah, they won't recognize my chassis. Well, I mean, they right, would, but you're but... still a droid. You're still an intruder. Yeah, but they might know. hesitate because you're another droid. Yeah, I know. I'll take point. It's fine if he's, if he's if he's spoopy. If he's spoopy, are they I'll going be... inside? Yeah, they're entering inside. If I see this, I'm gonna descend with my grappling yeah. hook and yeah, make my way up. Yeah, check. Oh, sweet baby off. lord. Then you're going to. Then you're perception check before you hopped off, right? Uh, yeah. I need to figure yeah, out which weapon I'm gonna have in hand. Um. All right, yeah, as you looking around the area, you notice there appears to be uh. Was it on this one or the other one? Oh, I just have the disruptor in here. Oh, it's the other one. Never mind. I see anything I like that. This one. <clears throat> really? Uh, we just give it droids. So there's two parts it. to the ship. You're at one part. And I think the other part has. Mm. Yeah. So, upon like, when you're noticing more towards like the riverbank, you notice it appears to be some kind of makeshift boat down below. Like people, like, like survivors would have used to get away? Yeah, like, it's definitely, because you can tell, it's scrapped together from wood and metal. Definitely doesn't appear to be in very poor condition, either. Oh, so it's recent. Mm -hmm. It looks relatively new. At least compared to the materials it's made out of. Is Ayala here? What? Ayala, I'm going to point out the boat to you. Oh, no, Jera. Am I up with Jera? Is I'm up with? No, you're up with Ayala. Yeah, you're up with Ayala. Okay, good, yeah. yeah. JL and IG are inside. I'm gonna point it to uh I'm gonna point this little makeshift boat out to Ayala that you know noticing that it's uh relatively new and say that we might have company. I'm gonna scope in on it and then just start scoping around, see if I can spot any tracks or where any footprints moving away and which way. Sure. Just give me a reception check. Since I'm using my scope, can I get a boost eye? I'm guessing we're like on top of the ship yeah. somewhere. I don't know where we are. You're on top of one of the engine sections. Okay. Yeah, on top of the highest the point possible, search. pretty much. So, pretty much. Yeah. I didn't yeah, want my boost you Nah, you got four success anyway. I got five. Thank you. There you go. Even spot them with special eyes. <laughs> yeah, when you can tell, it appears to be like the boat there, as well as like along the bankments, some other grooves that other boats have been in, in addition to like what seems to be like more like a uh, uh, drag marks as well towards the the section of where the boats would have landed. There's yeah. definitely like more pieces of scrap metal around the embankment as well, and and it like seemed kind of been cleared and pulled towards the embankment. All right, am I spotting any footprints or anything else around there? Yeah, the footprints you see are a bit old, like maybe a month or so old as well. Or mm -hmm. this way you can tell they don't appear to be recent. Are they humanoid? Uh, keep an eye out um, that direction. Yeah, there's a couple of humanoid ones, a couple of other ones that are more like alien. Like I don't know how everyone everyone's feet look like. But it's definitely a couple of alien species you can recognize, in addition to uh, some metallic like droid steps as well in the, in the ground. All right, well, I'm going to keep my scope out that way and just keep watching. And then just kind of keep my eye on that side. Um, as I'm moving through the ship, uh, IG's going to have his, um, his stealth carbine in hand, not the disruptor, because we got to move stealthily, because I don't want to activate droids by accident. Yeah, yeah you, you stumble across a ladder that's, that's going up as well. What's the worst that could happen? Oof, that. No. <laughs> yeah, you, 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 as you're exploring the ship, uh, you stumble across a ladder that's in front of you as well. Like, it's, like the, uh, the, kind of the hallway's kind of been collapsed as well, but there seems to be a ladder next to you leading up towards an open area. <laughs> um, a ladder's leading up to an open area. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna like, kind of like an upper, like an upper area <laughs> that kind of like runs along the ship itself. Uh, hey, uh, Donkey, I'm gonna have a com linked the information over to the. There's lady. definitely, yeah, there's definitely a couple of uh, cargo crates in the in here as well. So like maybe this was kind of like a hold, possibly. Okay. Um, hearing the information we heard from outside, IG will tell them that I looks like we've got a ladder inside the ship that leads up to like an open cargo bay with some cargo probably still up there. Yeah, you can't tell if they're open or closed. Right, yeah, not from here, but I'm going to wait till everybody else gets here to go up there. 
No, we can do it. Let's do it. I'll tap your shoulder and say, let's let's do this. Let's fucking do this. Look, if it's if there's a trap up there, right? Some like some nauseous gas or some like crazy like fire effect or whatnot. Well, if I'm it's not gonna gas, then you then you should definitely go first, and none of us flesh bags. And then I'll hand you like a thermal detonator and just be like, "You got this." <sighs> fucking uh, fine. I'll go up the ladder. Yeah, yeah. You climb up the ladder. Give me. No, you climb up just fine. I see. There's a creaking from the ladder, but it holds as you start to climb up it. Yeah. It's a bit rusty. Right. <laughs> yeah, so you poke your head up inside. It appears to be uh, a large open area. A couple of the crates you see nearby uh, appear to be open. And there's a terminal with a small light on it at the end. Uh, like, it's a small it? little blinky light. I'll look down to Jira and be like, hey, It definitely uh, appears to be a jury rig to actively be active. I look down to Jira and I was like, do you know any computer stuff? <laughs> You're funny. Uh, I do. Uh, we need a mechanic in here. I'll go on to comms and say, Jeeves, get your robotic ass in here. Your shiny metal ass. Because he was so polite in complimenting the shininess of my ass. I uh, do try and keep it polished. Gian's going to ask what you guys want us to do on the outside. Keep a look or what? Uh, I mean... With the fact that you said that there are people here... One, I'm kind of a little pissed because it sounds the like droid. they've taken, yeah, they've taken the majority I'll of the, our... Yeah, I'll relay loot. the information that some of the cargo crates are open, and uh, it looks like there's some makeshift, uh, some sort of makeshift uh, console here to like be interacted with, that maybe it's like a manifest or something like that, or a way to bypass the cargo pod security. Okay. Wait, you say droid. Most droids um, have built-in comms. Can I communicate with that droid? There's no way up there. There, there were footprints that resembled a droid. On the oh. embankment, there's footprints that resemble it, like droids. Oh. Yeah. Hey, now, Donkey, quick question. Is that multiple droids, you said? Uh, multiple. Okay. Yeah. Quick question for you, Donkey. So on this map, right, it shows yeah. they were kind of in the middle of a ravine area. It's there a map. Oh, okay. On the map so part two specific. thing? Yeah, this is... Here, I'll give you the part. Uh, part uh, two, just, you can see where yeah, it actually that's what, that's what I'm, Yeah, I was going to say. And then, so the embankments are what, just kind of toward the, like, the, what, would that be, northeast area? Like, up the river, kind of, or down yeah. the... Yeah, it's more of, uh, up the river. All right, and then did we, we came in from the west. Yeah, because, yeah, because these, this section of it was more of acting as a dam. So All it's right. kind of like built up a lake around it. I was going to say, I'm going to try and I'm going to signal or at least let everyone know I'm going to try and get a position a little bit more up on the cliff to keep an eye towards that area better. All right. I'm no use to, on the indoors barking. sort of setting. So I'm going to look at Jira and be like, when Jeeves gets in here, you guys handle this. I'm going to go join Ayala up there on a cliff side somewhere. Do you want me to go inside or what do you want me to do? I can scale up the cliff. Your best you. will be probably to stay around here. You're better in close court, in close area, so if people try and come in and surprise everyone. Yeah, me and Ayala will take over watch. Everybody else just stay near the ship. While I'm waiting for Jeeves, I want to do a search of the what immediate area to see if there's anything that's missed of importance or anything like that. What am I doing right now? Am I rolling for... Can you just search in the area? Uh, yeah, investigation. <laughs> yep. Alright, roll me... What is it? I can't remember the fucking skills. Dude, it's I don't even want to talk about XCOM. XCOM, like... For investigation, it would be, uh... It's just perception. 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 XCOM. Uh, do I get yeah, a keep... boost at all? Uh, explain why you would have a boost. Um, because I know old technology. Sure. You gave me a reasonable re reason for a boost, not can give you. And we are in... Consumption. Hey! Oh my god, thank you, Boost Die. <laughs> so you're just looking for like any general things that have been missed, picked over? Yeah, anything of importance that would be missed that I would know, like, oh my god, yeah, they really shouldn't have missed that or something like that. <clears throat> oh, thanks. Let's see. Just gently combing the area for anything. Because this area, it's more been picked clean. There's a couple of rusty droids in the, the walls. There's a couple of looks to be uh, their battle rifles as well. Ooh. Like, like uh, you probably find tank? two of them. Yeah, Ooh. you find two of them, and if they're in not that bad a condition, if maybe if you cleaned them up and sold them to the right person, like a collector, you can get a nice, pretty penny yeah, off them. Or those, an import yeah. planet for the Black those, Sun. Yeah. Those blaster rifles are garbage now compared to what we have. 
Yeah, oh, they're absolutely. garbage compared to what you have now, but to a collector. Like, they'd be Priceless. definitely... Yeah, yeah, they'd be worth something. Because most of those joints have been melted down and broken because they're at, at the end of the CIS, and the majority of their, dest- their stuff has been destroyed. Right. And scrapped to make newer stuff, so... Like, able to find intact equipment from that era to the right collector. I was going to say, realistically, if we, like, took all those B-1 battle droids and, like, somehow got them off the planet, sold them to a collector, they'd go for Huge money. Yeah, there's maybe about 50 of them in there. Oh my god. Like, maybe, yeah, about half of them are just completely covered in rust. The other half have moss on them. And if you were able to manage to fix them up, get them to a collector. We have a collector, but he's pissed off at us now. We could, uh, we can sway him with money. We could sway him with a fucking 20, a compliment of 25 B1 battle droids. Yeah, we can. Wait. When you say fix them up, you mean, you mean make them look shiny or operational? They'd have to be operational to be worth anything. If they're sure, operational, shiny will work too, because that's if they're operational. Too. Yeah, depending. Why like, would working... I hand over 25 operational B2 <laughs> battle droids? Yeah, like, working condition, that'd That'd be be a lot more valuable than just having to look nice, because look nice is more just a museum, a display piece. But they've actually worked. 25 of those, I would utilize the shit out of those. Why? Yeah, and, like, five standard guards can kill them. Wait, what? Yeah, B1 battle droids are not that great at combat. Oh, they're B1? The best thing about... I thought you said B2. No, they're B1s. One. Well, if I line them all up, then there's, like, a 2% chance I can hit a target. Yeah, they all took fires <laughs> at once. They might hit the target. Their best is used in mass and as screening for the other valuable droids. Well, the dollies on the ship. I don't have the yeah. Like to make like one B two would be like the price of like five B ones. Yeah. So it'd be oh. much cheaper just to spam B ones. It's like, hey, eventually you'll just bury them under the bodies of them. Yeah. It's like, oh, hey, they're droids. So just pick them back up, smelt them back down, make more. Yeah, well, that was the whole point. Because like, hover dolly. Cause like B, B1 battle droids had to be just as cheap and as effective as clones, except like they got the cheap part right. They did. <laughs> so what size fun. what size cruiser was this, Donkey? The Charlotte R? Yeah. It's uh, uh mul- like m- munificent, right? I, munificent I just, so we're, just so we're clear, I just uploaded oh. It's, you never I, got it's, done... it's a frigate, right? I know that much. Yeah, it's like a frigate. You never got you... done telling me if I found anything. Yeah, you found those rifles. Oh, right. Yeah, it is a cruiser class, by the way. Frigates? It oh, is it's it's explicitly a, a munificent class star frigate of class cruiser. That means it would have its own hover dollies, and it's that means not like that those are advanced. fucking incredibly large. Yeah, it's also half the ship, too. Yeah, <laughs> okay. Can I find a computer and see if I if there's yeah, any? there's an active computer up there. Yep. Oh, that's off. what I'm doing. That's why yeah, we called right. you in there is because there was fucking. Can I yeah, shove my know. blowtorch in the active computer? <laughs> yeah, you can add two B1 battle droid rifles. Yeah, two they're a bit rusty. B1. Yeah, but rusty on them as well. So can if you I get take, a? Or manage to pick some up. You can sell them for quite a nice amount of money. Can I get a bonus to computers? Uh, why would you have a bonus? Because I spend 80% of my time with my blowtorch in a computer. <laughs> You're also not a hard 2D2 unit. So over yeah, time, I mean, my skill would, like... I, no, your joy, your skill easier. doesn't go up. Things would get slightly easier. No, joy's skill doesn't go up. Fuck. You have to, get a, you have to okay. actually... Are you ready to roll? Encode more data. Yeah, I'm good You're to go. Good. I'll make it wait, wait, wait. Is the computer in good condition? No, not necessarily. It's got some rust on it. Uh, nice. The power source has definitely been jury-rigged onto the computer itself. Um, I'm going to start making my way back downstairs. Can I attempt to make the computer... Just in case this thing blows up. <sighs> Wait, the power source has been jury-rigged into the... Yeah. So the ship has no power. But the source has definitely been jury-rigged, maybe from a couple of droids together, in order to form a crude power pack. To actually can, power the terminal. Can I use mechanics to make sure that it's stable and properly connected? Sure. We need to find out what's in the computer. Yeah. You take one can string. It? it looks can... to be stable. Like, it's not going to explode on you if you used it. Okay. 
You want to try to slice into it? Yeah. Have a boost die. Yes. You examine stable. Yeah, you yeah, you know stable. You examined it. <laughs> Fuck! Oh. It was still against three. <laughs> God damn it! I didn't know it was fucking against God based boost die. I thought that boost I thought no one on this crew has computer skills. Wait! 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 <laughs> What if you just fuck us? What what you fuck us? Wait, 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 wait. This is awkward. Yeah, a second. Oh, this is weird. Let's restart Discord. Hello? Yo. Yeah, if you restart Discord, it works. Yep. I did it as soon as you did, just because, like, wait, that's probably a good idea. Oh, oh we got one up, too. That was cool. Like Pepperoni. That. Rest in pep. Those of you viewing from uh, from Minkley's stream, we welcome you and thank you for your patience, and hope you're having a wonderful day today. Hey. Hey. Don't don't now back that. to your local. Yeah, I was weird. I joined the. I was in the wrong fucking Discord. <laughs> yeah, put us right. both in there for some yeah. reason. So uh, we got everyone. Okay, so that light side point I used before it all crashed is because there was another computer and it was unlocked. Yeah. Yeah. It was the computer yeah. and was unlocked. It was completely unlocked, just free access. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I just said come to me, Jeeves, come to me. Yeah. Here's so light voice. Like, yeah, the other man. one was like, Hey, hey, look at me. It's okay. Yeah. Over here. Well I, I wiped the dust off and I was like, Oh look, this one works too and it's already unlocked. Wow, what are the what are the chances? Yeah, somehow so, this one still has power from the ship. <laughs> Even yeah. the ship back is off. <laughs> no one knows how. It's flickering a little bit, but it's there. Yeah. Uh, it's on low power mode. Yeah, it's on low uh, power mode or something. I want to see the status of any droids on board and where the hover dollies are. Okay, yeah, so as you're uh, examining through the computers, uh, yeah, the majority of the droids, there's at least 100 droids on board. There was 50 in the forward section and then 50 in the aft section. Uh, uh, currently... All yeah, so currently the 50 in the forward section, there's no response. Uh, in the aft section, um, there are no, none are responsive. None seem to be working. Uh, half of them list destroyed as their state. The other half are just unresponsive. 
and the hover dollies. The hover dollies? Yeah. Um, you find you find two inside the aft section, two in the main hold, main hole of the ship. Okay. Um, I'm How gonna come B1s back up. Can I fit on a dolly? How many can you try to fit on a dolly? Probably like five at a time. Once you plop them on top of each other. Okay. And I would also like to know if there's any power in any of the ship systems except where I currently am. Uh, yeah. Currently, the reactor is offline. Somehow this terminal's still online. No one knows how. <laughs> uh, yeah, majority of the ship has no Fucking more power. Magic. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna the come reactors back up. in the aft of the ship. Huh? The reactors in the aft of the ship. Uh, yeah, the reactors in the aft, and there's one in the fore as well. Currently, the one in the aft is uh, offline, pending repairs. What it says, the can, other one's just unresponsive. Can I pull up a map to find my way to it? Sure. Okay. I'm going to look at Jara and be like, or Jara and be like, I'm going to go with the reactor. All right. Let's not, let's try not to turn anything on just in case there are still people about. I'm just going to see how, well, oh, can I turn back to the computer? Are there any weapon systems on this ship? Are there any weapon systems? External or internal, yeah. I guess. Um, The weapon systems, you find there's at least four turbo lasers on this side, the aft section of the ship. Um, oh, they all say right. offline pending repairs as well. Ah, uh, see, so if I were to fix the reactor, then if anything approaches us, turbo lasers. Just be very <laughs> careful, <laughs> please. I would like because there are bag. still friendlies about. Remember I would like to shoot a meat bag with the turbo lasers. Um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm turn to the computer them. and look for a couple of different things. First, I'm gonna look up and see if I can figure out what the other people were trying to search. You're trying to find the other half of the ship, pretty much, or whatever's in here. Or, like you said, the, the terminal was Jury rigged. rigged. Yeah, uh, so one was rigged and is locked. The other one is currently is, online, though. Is there uh, any way that I can figure out what they were looking... Or, like, are these two com connected? Like, can yeah, I see... No, they're not connected. Oh, okay. what? Uh, There's no power connection to both of them. One's then, locked, one's locked. What I'm going to look up on this one first is if there are any... Um, uh, like offline droidica units. I don't find droidica well, units. Well, I searched for all droids. Yeah, no, the ship wouldn't have any droidica units on. Thank droidica God. units were specifically like designed for like battlefields. See, or, but if they were uh, offline, then I could or, go and steal one of their shield generators. Yeah, or space no. station defense. That's what they were yeah, used no. for. Yeah, but you need a power system to power the shield too. You know what that Correct. is, Sakura? What is it? That's and a... nothing, nothing current age would be compatible with the power system of that fucking Droidica shield. The thing up in it was probably is the Droidica oppressor. These are terrifying. Yeah. Um. Okay. Wait. Then... Does okay. So is this? Oh well. Do you have okay. the Empire to Republic adapter cable? Um. Then this is <laughs> what I'm gonna do, and I really don't want to do this, but it's kind of left me with no choice because none of us are good with computers. I, I, I just unlocked an entire system. system. Exactly, no, but you didn't unlock the system that we needed. Yeah, I'm sorry about this that. This system's more separate than the others. Right. Well, so I'm gonna, gonna I'm gonna, I'm gonna just have to use our last light side point, and I'm just gonna like kind of bash the other computer, and it's gonna unlock. Okay. Just quickly swipe your hand across it. Yeah. And or pummel it. You probably smack it, and then it's like it turns red for a second, and then it uh, turns green. As you hear, is it the little dis main display starts to pop up? Main UI. Um, and then I'm gonna try to look up what was searched, find out that information, what they took, all of that good stuff. Control H. Give me all info. <clears throat> yeah. So when you're able to pull from the terminal, a lot. Of The last data you see that was that's not really corrupted hold on. was the... Hold uh, on. I just missed all of that. My connection's lagging. No. Oh, we no. lost... We people. lost two people as well. Oh, no. Um, I don't... Yeah, they're typing. I don't know why... Uh, uh, hello? Weird. Nope. There, there we go. Oh, I didn't even have to restart. Yeah, we go around. Damn it, Discord. Oh, right. We're just missing Ayala. Go. Yeah, we'll probably finish this up and call it. Yeah. So, um, so I guess just let me know then. 
What's what, what? What do I find? Yeah, so you're able to find like a report of the last, uh, like the last battle that took place of mm-hmm. like damage reports the ship has taken, things like that. Uh, down in the atmosphere, you've seen that uh, at one point the ship was a uh, lost connection to the forward half. Mm-hmm. As you can probably surmise, it, this is where it split and kind of fell through the atmosphere. Um, and that's kind of where it lost data on that. You're able to see some smaller ones of a. Uh, like a per- it seems like kind of more like a personal log as well. Uh, probably the. I too enjoy all the static. I love. Static. I too speak binary. It is best. Yes. Can you hear me now? Hey, hey, hey! So what happened in the last twenty seconds? I got disconnected again. So everyone out. He found a log of like the ship's reports of what was happening. The last known locations of what the ship was doing, and it was able to record like part of the battle. The damage the ship has taken, and then also the damage the ship, ship took while falling through the atmosphere. And at one point, it's lost connection to the forward half of the ship. Uh, so you can probably surmise that's where it split somewhere before maybe 20, 30 seconds later, it impacted the ground. Uh, I'm also looking for a shipping manifest. Yeah, it's, on the shipping manifest, uh, you see that there was a the comp, the, it, was, it was a large complement of uh, fuck, I'm trying to make a treasure at that time. I guess of uh, various treasures that would exist at that time. So like, the, the, there was there was like a lot of yeah, there was loot. a large amount like of treasury. Like some of it was quite high quality, as everyone keeps disconnecting. Yeah, superior um, internet connection to train supreme. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. All twelve servers. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, Jesus. Oh, that's all. Sound against the tide, my friends. Do I get a bonus die for this? Uh, join, join them on Twitch, or tell them to watch it on, watch your stream. There's like what, like an eight second delay or something? Yeah, yeah, it's a minimum five second delay, I think. So yeah, just I wait. Just can I hit the to... play button and actually see that? Uh, yeah, on your end, if you just open up another advanced show video one. stats. There we go. Um, apparently I skipped five frames somewhere. Yeah. That's weird. Um, I think I'm just up lots of treasure. That you guys found three seconds actually. Okay, so, there so, was a lot of valuable stuff on board. Uh, but is there a like what part or what section of the ship? Um, the majority of it was in the main hold. Oh, uh, um, main hold of the ship, okay. and this is more of the aft hold. So it was like a much smaller one that most was mostly keeping things like food and water, like basic supplies for some of the humans that would travel on board these things. Uh, do, is the main hole still like in? Um, is it, is it still together? In um, from what the ship can tell, it fell apart in two. Like, it kind of broke and lost connection to the front half of it. Mm-hmm. And it's unable to tell anything more from this side, from, at least from this side of the ship. Okay. Um, I'm gonna relay all that to uh, everyone and say, it sounds like the treasure we are looking for is in the main hole, which is separate from this. So we need to go somewhere else. Uh, is there anything else that Take I it, can thank you. grab from this? From the terminal? Yes. Um, anything of importance, that... relevance? Yeah, that after maybe a couple of days, the ship's the containers have been accessed as well. Mm-hmm. Can I tell what was in those containers? Um, when you can tell, majority of the tr- containers in this side of the ship was like things like food and water and stuff, like basic okay. supplies, like tools, things like that. Uh, I'll also get on radio and say it, it seems like the things that were taken from here are basic survival needs. So I would say, and this is what is interesting to me, we might be looking for another downed ship or survivors of this ship, which confuses me. Um, careful, sleep. Trying to think of... No, I'm still here. We're all still here. I'm alive. Yeah, I'm just. Uh, what does G slap the reactor? And there's no treasure on this side of the ship. No, at least not where you can tell. Uh, I'm disappointed. <laughs> all right. 
So the treasure's not here on this side of the ship. Yeah, and the reactor doesn't seem to be in place. Like when you go head down to the reactor, it's not there. So they took the reactor. They've taken a lot then. I feel like these are survivors. But these were, you said those tracks were like a month ago. Yeah, they're definitely old. It's like nothing recent has come by this section. At least in the past month or so. Then maybe they aren't survivors. I don't know why looters would take field rations. No, maybe I mean, they're survival. A... Why would you take the fucking reactor, though? Give roll 20 voice. Once you receive audio, want to broadcast voice. Does that work? Hello? Como estas ustedes? Me llamo es Matt. Does this work? Can you hear me? My Microsoft. What? I get plus 10. No. Ooh. Okay, how do I turn off my voice again? Oop. That was not the right button, I don't think. Was it? Resets it to nothing. Okay. Ended here. Okay. The session, everyone. You know, excuse me. Last two sessions. Woo! That was fun. Rip Discord. Hey, Poggers works now. Yeah, Discord isn't letting me disconnect. Love it. Where's close it? Yeah, I know you can hear me. Uh, let's try Discord. It sucks that uh, Discord died. I guess we're done then. Confirmed. Confirmed. Done. Yeah. Word stuck on connecting. Agenda. Alright, whatever. I guess that's that. Um Discord died. Killed the dream. <laughs> what, these settings? I'm probably connected as a fucking GM right now. Yeah. Because I have GM settings. When I reconnect to the game, it forces me in as a GM. So. So I had to make the game for all the scripts. Okay, I guess we're done then. Sick.
So, plus 15 XP. We'll see what happens next week. Thanks for watching.